Hey guys, if you're trying to jump into a game, uh, go to Night City Overdrive. If you're trying to learn more about the lore, go to Cyberpunk Uncensored. And if you want to, want to catch a live game every Saturday at 8 p.m. Eastern, uh, U.S., uh, go to Chuggy's uh, Twitch stream. The descriptions are in the box below. Like today, I updated my wardrobe because I'm going to a fancy uh, cyberware expo. I'm going to see all types of goodies um, I can get my hands on and make some eddies. All right. See you uh, there. Well, welcome to tonight for, for uh, what I think will be a wonderful game. Um, most of you have read the, the table rules already. If you have any questions yeah. about them, let me know. Um, and uh, we will get started soon. Uh, I will give you a few of my personal expectations from this game. I have made this session tonight uh, as, as a quite a role play heavy uh, session. Uh, the combat uh, most likely will only happen if the players initiated themselves. <laughs> um, uh, I will not make it easy. Well, for I mean, you. none of us would ever do such a thing. <laughs> uh, the, all, all the, all the people that uh, you will come across, they, uh, the planet that they will be acting as, uh, as uh, they, they will be acting like, uh, like they are actually uh, what you expect from them. Um, uh, if you find anything which, which, which is strange about the, the whole scenario where, where, where a sudden jump is made, please let me know. We can always pause the game in time. I, I want to make it have, a, have tonight have a lot of fun with us together. <laughs> so, um, and uh, in that case, I would say. Oh. Uh, let's uh, start off the game. So, uh, what you all guys heard, heard is that the Babylon Exposition uh, has been going. It, it will start. It will will start soon. Hmm? So this is in Babylon. Uh, you can be calm. You can go in Babylon. Yeah, sure. You, in, 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 you said the Babylon Exposition. So like, wait, is the exposition? Oh, no, 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 no. The where exposition will be soon, yeah. soon, soon. In, it will yeah. be in, held in the Glen. Um, and uh, what you uh, noticed is that that already it, in the da days before, uh, security has been uh, uh, increased. Uh, drones are flying uh, more around. Uh, it's a, a big happening in the city. Uh, high society is coming to it. It's 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 a, as if they are introducing something like 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 there's a, there's going to be a new era where where the city is being rebuilt and this is one of their first expositions where uh, all the companies can show off their new stuff in the cyberware or in their. Uh, uh, bio uh, fields uh, to where uh, people can uh, well can have maybe a better life if they have enough money of course for it I, I, I'm just like looking around the map and I see smiles and I'm just reminded of hey officer um um snapping fingers um uh, <laughs> I think the dice was there for that game for what game uh, maybe not, but I, I was I was acting like I like I didn't remember uh, Smiles's handle nor his real name, which would be Officer Styles. Was it the one but where he, I, was it the one where he forced you to uh, like try to give up like your video? No, was it was him? one that we had after that where he then forced me to give up a badge that I had acquired. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, I wasn't. But you left me the footy of that Can one. we just uh, have a, a quick scene in Babylon? Um, if you can draw yourself out. Uh, I'm uh, right here. Right, where are you? Remember, I'm I'm blind. Well, luckily for you, my circle should be nice and bright. <laughs> mine, uh, is, mine is quite dark, but this is where I'm at. Uh, <laughs> hold on, hold on. <laughs> okay. I am not very far away from where you have set your character. I am at the bar. Okay. Uh, oh wait, are you here? Yeah. Yes. So, Stitch has approached his Envy, and his, his carry-all is a bit, it, it seems a bit overstaffed. And pauses, um, 
Envy, can I have a moment? Um, uh, sure, Doc, what's up? Uh, I, I just, uh, I, I thought I'd, I'd get you something. Um, and he opens up his carry-all and pulls out about six smart rockets and just kind of places them on the bar. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> 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 Dice looks across the bar no, and just like this up his is drink. out of media res. I'm sorry. I, um, I, 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 uh, wow. I had a feeling that it would be either this or the exact opposite, which is betrayal. And I'm much. I'm very happy that it's this. Yeah. Um. um do you do you like them? Um. I'm not so sure how helpful they'll be on this job, Just but... Just for, for future use. Um, I, I, I thought I'd um, pick them up. Thanks. And then she just very hurriedly moves away. <laughs> da- Dice raises his wow. eyebrows. <laughs> Dice oh my raises god. An... Dice raises an eyebrow looking at those six rockets because, like, uh, they look very familiar. <laughs> <laughs> you stole my rockets. <laughs> and it's like, uh, I gotta be more careful. And thinks to himself, he has to be more careful about the people he does business with. <laughs> yeah. So it's just the, the little thing that I wanted to do. Um, mm. Right, I have six smart rockets uh, in my character repository because I'm not bringing the rocket launcher for this job. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so Envy is going to um, try to very subtly put those in her bag. It doesn't matter if people actually see. She just got fucking rockets set, set in front of her. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, did you, you all accept uh, when uh, an unkempt woman and man walked in and uh, where uh, mostly uh, Claudia Reinberger uh, introduced herself uh, to all of you, where she asked if you could uh, um, uh, find uh, or, or get them an, uh, a ruffling uh, Augmentix cyber chair spiders. Uh, cyber chair, spider chair. Holy fuck! That's a name which I'm not going to repeat many times. <laughs> you made it uh, yourself. <laughs> yes, I know. <laughs> and uh, uh, unfortunately, the normal ones uh, were unfortunately uh, did not uh, work for their child, uh, and their ch- because their child uh, immune system rejects any kind of cyberware and it seems that only uh, one of and and they heard on the news or in the grapevine according to their information I mean, cyber chairs aren't cyberware they're more like personal electronics yeah but you can also use them with uh, interface plugs as such yeah and uh, they learned that uh, that there is a new prototype uh, of a spider chair on the market, which is going to be in, in, unveiled at the Cyberware Expo, uh, which might actually help their son uh, be able to move again. And she asks, uh, or she try, wants to hire some edge runners to get that chair for them. Uh, it should be uh, quite easy to get because of all the bigs and happening. She doesn't expect much often. Uh, resistance there because a lot of the security will be preoccupied keeping everything uh, safe and most likely keeping an eye on all the celebrities all the high high society personnel who's walking about there and all the other government people in high functions uh, that will be there and uh, so uh, she is willing to pay you a, 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 a thousand eddies for, for, for retrieving the chair, and uh, a thousand eddies for a five thousand dollar ch- for a five thousand eddie share. Um, for, so for, obviously we can't just buy it. It's uh, it's a, a unique prototype, so it's not on the market yet. So you cannot buy it. Ooh yes. Uh, question. So uh, because. Uh, Envy is going to like already be in on the fashion industry. Would you like for me to roll local expert to see how much she like knows off the top? 
of her head about this? Yeah, go ahead. All right, I did pretty good. So, uh, so what you know is that indeed this tower exposition is is something envy uh, with 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 uh, with her goals. She uh, she wants to be there, even if you yeah. didn't have a job there. You you want to be there. It's 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 Absolutely. a chance to to see all the high society and maybe uh, make some new connections with people that may uh, make your life a little bit easier. Of course. And of course, all the high fashion will be walking around there yes. in the newest fashion, um, because so everybody will, will 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 be showing off their 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 uh, cyberware, their uh, which uh, which should be the newest hip thing. First mm -hmm. off, since the last time that uh, I have had a game with Minketti, she has not only picked up a handle, but like also been living with Envy the entire time. Um, Envy is aware that uh, your character goes by Bombshell now, but she is still on first first name basis with her just because, like, they're fucking roommates. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> I listen to both. Bombshell or Natari, it's fine. <laughs> nice. Uh, all of you... All of you have about, uh, let's say that it is, uh, uh, it, it is uh, now Wednesday late in the evening in the bar. So, right. and, and all of you know that on um, fr Friday, did, did I say up? Friday or Thursday? You, I believe no, it's Thursday. Thursday, Thursday yeah. the, it will be opening up around uh, 3 p.m. in the, in the noon. I'm gonna take it that How I don't need to run for. I don't. Hmm? How many days does it run for? Three. It will right, so it's end Thursday, on Friday, Saturday. Yes, and it yes. will end in a Saturday uh, night. Uh, some some sort of gala party where where all the the rich people are invited, basically. Which obviously yeah. Envy wants to not raise too much of a stink so that she can attend. Um. I, I, I take it I don't need to roll streetwise in order to tell in order to know that there are gonna be scalpers for this event. Uh, no, you guys don't have to know that they that, that they are there that, that they are present, but you might. They're more of an in, they're more of an inevitability, if you will. Uh, yes, indeed. So you know they're out there, but able to find one uh, trustworthy enough uh, or. <laughs> Not so trustworthy enough. Uh, you, you will guys have to find something for that if you want to do that. Um, uh, uh, so, go on and tell me. I mean, let's start with uh, from from. Uh, let, let's do it from bottom to top in my list and the stitches. What is your plan? A so little my bit? plan is to reach out to some of the. Um, I don't really work for medical groups. I work more for corporate executives as a private surgeon. Mm -hmm. And I want to reach out to them to see if they, them or any of their companies wants a representative with, you know, medical expertise to inspect the cyberware that's on, on display. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Can I yes. make a, a business role for this? Uh, yes, that is exactly what I wanted to, to request in business role. Uh, yeah, you 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 do some call a call arounds and and, and asking like uh, hey uh, representative and such and at a certain point uh, and somewhat smaller companies like yes please we would love you to to go there for us and uh, you will be able to procure, procure yourself an uh, an standard ticket for free. How much luck to get a backroom ticket? I would say that would cost you at least two luck. Okay, I'll spend two luck. Um, okay. So, that is me, Howard. And then Citrus is going to, you know, head out and, you know, get get on putting his suit on. Mm -hmm. for the, are, are we going the, the Thursday? The ticket is for, for all days. Okay. Yeah, it'll get you through every single day. Yeah. Same one. <clears throat> uh, oh, Pockets is, 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 is AFK for a little bit, so we will go to him. So, uh, Bombshell. 
What 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 were your ideas, plans? Oh, I do still need a ticket. Um, I know that there there's probably already lack like, security is already arranged, so I. Hmm. hmm. I might just. At least someone has a spare ticket. Does someone have a spare ticket? I know. Uh, uh, out of character, I know that Red Boy brought two uh, basic tickets. And I also know that Dice got two backroom tickets. Yeah. Yeah, but you, we don't know that in character. <laughs> I do not know that in character. <laughs> Um, I do have the money to buy buy the the. It's it's like I said it's 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 uh, mm -hmm. buying a ticket is not not something which you must do. No, that's true. That's true. Then if security has been ramping up, then surely there would be. Um, I, I want to ask around at my the, the, the mercenary company that I work at mm -hmm. to see if they uh, also will send representatives of the of their uh, like any of the companies mm -hmm. that go there. That need. I would say that is a local home in that case. Oh God. Uh, yes, I mean a cybertech expo would still be kind of a thing for a military. Institute for a paramilitary institution. It's a shame about that role, though. You, you you do hear that a few of your colleagues are are are, are going there uh, because a, a few of your colleagues are hired by some lower level executives that are are able to go there mm -hmm. and, and and want some extra protection. Uh, but every spot has been filled in currently. Ah, uh, that's a bummer. Uh, but I'm fi fine. I'm fine with buying it myself, unless uh, I will. I will. I will. I will send a, a group message to each of one of us to see to see uh, to to ask. Um, so hey guys, did you already get tickets? <laughs> um, Envy is going to confess. No, she she hasn't. She's been a little bit too broke for anything more than basic tickets. But she has a great idea that you and Red Boy can help out with that is going to just make you feel good on top of getting some nice tickets. Like, I promise you, this is going to be an uproar, a total gas. And we won't even get in trouble with anybody at the expo. Okay, okay, sounds interesting. Uh, I am going to have to wait for Red Boy to get back before I start telling this plan. I don't know if Red Boy is already back. Red Boy? He's not yet. Ah. Uh... He hasn't even put his uh, pawn on the table, unfortunately. I just got back. Ah, oh, hey. Welcome back. So, uh. Um... Sorry about that. No worries, it happens. So Stitches, uh, to, to bring you up a little bit to speed, Stitches has uh, uh, asked around in his, in his own personal contacts which executives that he, he normally helps and he's able to uh, sponsor himself a backroom uh, ticket with some luck. And uh, Bombshell asked around in her company, but it seems that uh, all of her colleagues are like, uh, uh I want to be on that spot. So, so a lot of all the the, the security spots which which were open for their uh, company got taken by her colleagues. And now she sent out a message to all of you to see if anybody already had procured tickets or if they, we could work together maybe to procure some. Uh, yeah, absolutely. So, uh, Red Boy, uh, the previous day. Uh, had got a couple like standard tickets um, just like you know walk in and browse the place but um, he doesn't want to use those ones if he doesn't have to um, so <laughs> Envy is sidled up to him at the bar uh, yeah I'm gonna say um, uh, tell me love you had some idea about uh, scalpers <laughs> and then he kind of like right. motions like he's scalping right. someone <laughs> so 
the both of you, Red Boy and Madari, could have you helping me here with this one. So basically, it's already pretty late on the day before, so I think that a bunch of them will be going home maybe empty-handed with some extra tickets that they were selling overpriced. You know, just like if if you wanted to get in faster, if you wanted to get your ticket faster, you could just pay more money for it because I've already got my ticket. Well, fuck those guys, right? We should mug one of them. Or two of them, and then we'll have extra tickets to sell at a discount and make some more bank. <laughs> There's uh, uh, exchange going on, with? and it's just staring disapprovingly at Envy and Robite. Mostly Red Boy, but also a bit at Envy. And, and, and um, the Dice, what, 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 what is Dice doing? Okay, so Dice has, two, has a plan and a backup plan. Um, he, he bought two, um, backroom, uh, passes already, but he would like to forge one into a VIP ticket. Uh, uh, mm. uh, give me that forgery skill and, uh, give me, beat, beat, beat the DV 18 for me. All right. I mean. So 19 or higher with your forgery skill. Uh, if you have any complementary skills, which you think might help with it, uh, you can let me know. Uh, I also have bureaucracy, I guess. <laughs> yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you will need to know what kind of information needs to be on the ticket and why and and how and how it is uh, how it would be a VIP ticket. Sure. Right. <laughs> Ooh. Should it's, I? Uh, hmm. It's a little bit too low. I gotcha. That's why I have. That's why I have the second ticket. Like uh, in doing that, does that destroy the the original? Uh. Nah, 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 nah. You 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 try to, about but with your with your forgery, you were unable to to uh to find the correct information on what makes a VIP a VIP ticket. Okay, uh, since I have these connections, I'm just gonna walk in with a um, with a backroom ticket, uh, talk to someone I know to upgrade me to a VIP ticket. Hmm. Sure. Give me that uh, connections roll. Oh hell yeah! Beautiful. Oh. Uh, you will find a person who who is like. Mm. I don't know. I, 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 uh, these these tickets are a little bit pricey, you know. Uh, um, I was like, "Come on, man! Can, remember that me, thing what, I did can for you." You give me a return for it. Come on! Remember that thing I did for you that other day. Your sister, your, your sister wouldn't be wouldn't be here without me. <sighs> you know it's true. She's well, okay, okay. If you give me those two backroom, <laughs> give me those two backroom tickets, and 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 I will, I will, I will and, and 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 give me another thousand, and I will make sure that 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 I will try and find you a VIP ticket. All right, that'll work. <laughs> and with that, you were able to uh, procure yourself a VIP ticket. Lost the two backroom tickets, and uh, you needed to pay him another thousand at least for 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 this. So basically, you gained two thousand eddies. Um, can I can I put it in the shop after the game, or do you want me to do it now? Uh, please do it now, so because, okay. Uh, and bombshell, envy, and red uh, boy. Red boy. We are gonna, we, we need to first off scope out the outside of the gal of the whole show, right? Give, give me Look. library searches or streetwise rolls to see if you guys can find right. and scalper willing um, to sell VIP tickets. I, I'm looking for VIP or backroom if I cannot find VIP. Mm -hmm. 
let's yeah. first see if you guys can find uh, these uh, these people are, who are trying to make an extra buck. Well, it's going to be a 10 either way, so can I do both? Yeah, sure. But, but, uh, the, the three of you can use both those rolls and... and All right, so I'm more likely to have heard about some people than spotted them myself, but I oh, haven't done sorry, too terribly. Yeah, yeah, yes. I thought and apparently sure. all three of us can use both library search and streetwise. It's because you're both scouring oh. the, the web <laughs> and, 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 and asking the streets. Uh, and, and, and Adari, stop looking for too long. And because these the <laughs> same score in each. Oh, so same here. <laughs> uh, my my street twice is a bit higher. <laughs> Envy's the only one who's heard word. Uh, I've got big, big giant fingers and uh, typing on the phone is very difficult. <laughs> so after a little bit of searching and and, and asking around, uh, Envy and Nadari, you both find 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 this this shady scalper who's 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 offering these uh, VIP tickets for for ten thousand eddies each. He's and trying. he claims to have at least uh, six of them. Rob him. Rob him right now. <laughs> He's okay. I'm glad that I chose the two lawmen on the gig for this because <laughs> he's probably going to have backup. Uh, but I am going to be bringing my rocket launcher for like what we trap this guy into an alley. Dice, would you mind driving us? Well, I don't have uh, a car. Before, so you guys found him, and there's a contact number to call him. We could we could just have him meet up at a at a like a deserted place or something, and then just don't pay. <laughs> it doesn't even have to be a deserted place. It can just be in like a combat zone. It'll be fine. People do business in the combat zones all the time because, like, they don't want we're getting out or shit. So just like, it'll be fine, it'll be fine. Let's just go to the combat zone for this. So do you have a location? You guys have um, a number? Yeah. I yes. mean, to, to lure him to, we do have a number, but we want to have him not at that place. <laughs> All right, let me see. Uh, nice important places. Um, uh, what about one of the reconstruction spots where nobody's around? Oh wait, am I with you guys this time, or am I just like doing my own thing? Uh, yeah, all the five of you can 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 go together. If 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 stitches and dice are like like yeah sure we're going come come along yeah, with no, you guys. Stitches is not a fan of this. <laughs> all right. Um, he doesn't um, like skill, but it isn't like uh, you know thuggish behavior either. Well, then Dice is going to be like, yeah, I'll see you there at the place. <laughs> not not, not at the not at the mugging, but like at the expo. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, fine. That's fine. How about a spot just <laughs> yeah, after away? The how about a spot away from the slammer in the old combat zone? Give him a call, I would say. All right. You're better at talking, so if you yeah, Oh yeah, no, absolutely. And oh, Envy is going to like flip her hair like mm -hmm. from under her from under her neck, and she is going to use her agent to dial up Dat Boy. And okay. uh, so when you when you hear uh, when when you hear the phone, you hear this uh, young. A woman's voice is like, yes, hello. Uh, this is uh, 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 I don't know. Fuck. Uh, I had a name. <laughs> give, me, give me a moment. It's uh, a name I don't know. Fuck. <laughs> no. This is Candice. <laughs> this is, ah, yes. No, no. I, 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 I wrote, wrote down here. Yeah, this is Pinky here. What can I do for you? Hi, I heard that you were selling a couple of VIP tickets and we're a little bit late to the party, so we don't we, we don't really have the time to be waiting in line to buy those right now. 
I was wondering if you could. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I have them for you. I have even a few, few extras for them. Uh, <laughs> yes, I can sell them for you. They are ten thousand eddies each. Yes, I heard. Um, would you mind meeting somewhere near the slammer? I can't do really? business really? outside of the combat zone right oh, now. Oh no 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 wait no no! It's, it's, it's before meeting. Yeah, you you have to give if if you want to meet and and have those tickets uh, uh, in person. You will have to give me some uh, down payment of at least a thousand eddies per ticket. All right. Wow. Hmm. And then uh, once I've confirmed the, the, that you've sent it over, I will send the tickets towards you uh, to an address which you uh, you like. And uh, then once you've confirmed you get the tickets, then you will pay. Uh, make sure you I'm, pay the rest. I'm pretty sure I saw this scam in RuneScape. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <sighs> Classic scammer behavior. Ask her if she's also right a Nigerian now. prince. <laughs> yeah, right, yeah, some Nigerian prince shit. Yeah, my All next right. character was going to be the, uh, a Nigerian prince guy, um, just for the hell of it. But yeah. Uh, All right. Um, so I'm gonna be lying out of my ass here. So I'm gonna go ahead and make an acting role. Sure. What what but, what are you li lying about? I'm lying about the fact that I can't be outside of the combat zone right now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And uh, that I don't just do business with anybody, blah, 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 blah. I'm a big important person, blah, blah, blah. Uh, and then she's like, yeah, you know what, you know what? Okay, so you, if you cannot do it, but uh, okay, you said, so you know what? I'm willing because to you put sound so trust that. Because you sound so trusting. You pay me 700 each for each ticket up front, and then I will send them to you. Well, I'm, I'm trying to look at what our skill set is here. <laughs> is it the call and go find this motherfucker? <laughs> yeah, no, if we have some... If you want to trace the call back to, to, to this person, uh, because uh, if you go to... I have her on, the, you... on the phone right now. Yeah, uh, give me, uh, I will be honest, uh, you will have to give me an electronic and security check to find, uh, to, to, to be able All to right. find out her, 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 the, the, this, this person. Anybody in the team location. have more than an 8 in security tag? I have a 10, but I'm not helping you guys. Oh, <laughs> lovely. Uh, good, good, good to know. Um, so, my thought is we have the number, right? Yes. Right. Um, maybe we could check it against like a database and see what's up. <laughs> uh, definitely. I mean, so far we've gotten a name and a number and a voice, but not a location. Is it one and of you the guys like a long what we're looking for? So, so, that we so can you 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 hang them. up and you guys will try and find out where you can find this uh, number, right? Yes. And listen, I'm not terribly yeah. committed to these VIP passes, but it, like if we have to jump through too many hoops, I I just say get on with the game, but. Uh, if somebody no, 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 I, 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 I already planned for this uh, pocket, don't worry. Okay. <laughs> All right. Um, so, hmm. if, so close if you to her chats. So, so, uh, give me, uh, blah, 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 uh, 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 give me a library searches uh, to, to check to see where, where this phone number came from. <laughs> One thing we know today, so, Bombshell is bad at doing library search. <laughs> I will be on Envy, uh, with the 15, you will you would come uh, with, you have two, two, uh, two points too low to find where this number came from. All right, I will use two luck. That sets me at eight. So what you guys notice is that, that uh, somehow this number is from some kind of rich family within the clan. Um, within the clan? Within the clan, yeah, 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 yeah. It's uh, oh, so it's some money grubbers. It's, Even better. It's 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 uh, um, um, it's a uh, uh, if you check the address, uh, there there's a family of of of, uh, of an executive and a and a med tech who seemingly had that like as like three children there. They are living quite well and spacious. 
Uh, and that's the address which you guys uh, found there. Okay, so... Um... I don't want to hurt their kids, whatever happens, because I'm not that kind of girl. But I want to emphasize I don't want to hurt them. <laughs> Do you guys want to visit the address? Uh, I want to at least case the joint. Hmm. I can at least drive by. See what's uh, what's up. Call maybe call the person when we when we're driving by to see who picks you up. Watch it through the window, see who picks <laughs> up. Yeah, exactly. I see what you're going for. Yeah. Okay. So while you do that, so you drive drive by and and see uh, who's going to pick up the phone. Maybe try to give me perception checks. All right. Perception. One of Envy's weeks. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I so, was about to say one of Envy's weak suits. Go cool. you guys drive and this is almost a perfect crit. And you guys call a call a call call the number again. What you guys see is that Why you can't see, I get this on the clutch rolls? You guys like, see we're gonna be this, okay. this this 16, 7 year old girl goes like like hi Pinky here, how can I help you? And you can see a uh, 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 an, an, an young woman, uh, a teenager, pick uh, pick up the phone all enthusiastically, like. Uh, as, uh, oh, so this is just kind of a shitty teenager. <laughs> it's okay. Are you I just saying, do you say that through the phone? No, I say that <laughs> like the I, I say that to to like the the crew the phone like I push the mute the the mute button. Oh, okay, okay. And actually, no, no, I do say up. that through the phone. I do say that through the phone. I want okay. to scare her. She's like, uh, I'm not a shitty teenager. Um, I do you want to buy anything or not? I'm just going to hang up. We already know who we're looking for. And Envy is <laughs> going to say to Red Boy and Adari, okay, we just need to scare the with, absolute with, with shit out of her. With your perception, what you notice is that once you hang up, you see her go go a little by like a trantum and see her f throw her phone against the wall. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> and that's, that's what you guys see when you drive by. And Envy's just going to say, okay, you just need to scare the absolute shit out of her. I don't want to hurt her, this girl, but I won't mind, like, holding her parents hostage if it comes to that. <laughs> okay, we're just... Envy, Envy's not that kind of person, is he? <laughs> Are you okay? Do we need to bring you to a doctor or something? <laughs> no, 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 no. Look, look, look. Okay. I don't want anybody to die here. That's where I stand. Yeah, okay. <laughs> well, well, we can at least scare her. She looks like a spoiled Exactly, dad. exactly. I too, either once was or am still, I can't really tell a spoiled brat. So I know exactly how this goes. You just need to scare them. Yeah. So because due, due to the, the exposition, uh, which is is, is, is is building up uh, you notice that uh, within the glen uh, uh, a few lesser drones fly about uh, it seems to be like like security stretched a little bit thinner on the normal streets like uh, per normal as if, if as if most of the the, the the security and police has been con concentrated on the exposition building all right and how close are we to the exposition building? Uh, uh, like, like maybe half an hour away, 15 minutes away. So security is definitely less here than it usually is. Yes, indeed. Cool. I'm uh, once again, very glad that I decided to bring the two lawmen for this. Um, who are not lawmen, but still. <laughs> oh no, you're lawmen, that's your role. And that's, that's okay. what you bring to this table. And, and, and you're a media, not an influencer. See how we can all play with words? See how that hurts? <laughs> <laughs> I am a media influencer. It doesn't hurt. It's honestly. No, no, no. Just a media. <laughs> I didn't. Uh, I didn't. Listen, I didn't refer to GM, you guys. As just... I, I'm sneaking into the backyard. 
Yeah, sure. <laughs> Give me stealth check. Yeah, no, I'm going with. Um, I, uh, okay. Oh wow. Give me stealth checks. Oh god. You, uh, no, no, no. Are... I, I, I'm insistent on going alone. <laughs> Oh, okay. Sure. Okay, okay. We're sure. stealthy outside of the perimeter and sure. be there for you. So, Red Bull, okay, you, well, you sneak into the garden. You notice that it's pre- a, a pre- quite pretty garden. Uh, it's 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 like like uh, th- these people seem to be well <laughs> off. This is going to be the only combat in the game. <laughs> and it's just to scare a, a teenager. <laughs> what you do? Yeah, right. So, uh, and uh, give me a perception check because I presume that you are going to look into the house see see who's present. Uh, sure. Oops. <laughs> I, I, it seems like, to honestly, be uh, that's that's yeah. that's one avenue. Uh, I don't care who's in there. Um, oh, okay, okay, yeah, go ahead. So, what were you going so to do? So I have um, these fun little cyber legs uh, with the grip attachments. I can just walk up the side of a house. Turns out. <laughs> Go ahead. So I, Hell yeah. I don't know if you want me to keep rolling perceptions. No, no, like, no, 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 no. You, you can. So, so you, so you want to go up to the, uh, yeah, sure, you can go up and uh, you enter a balcony where where it seems to be that that it's on the same level as where you guys saw the girl on the other side, uh, but here you are at the balcony of a master bathroom. Mm. Bathroom, sorry. Um, okay. Um, well, uh, I, I guess I'm going to open it, do some breaking and entering. <laughs> Just... Sure. It's, uh, so, so you uh, go to the door and it seems unlocked. So you can just walk in. Uh, yeah, I'm going to kind of poke my head around, see what the, what the layout is. Uh, I'm looking for like an open door. I'm looking for, uh, for pink stuff. I'm looking for, uh, Glitter, pony material, some Lisa give, Frank shit. I'm looking for a kid's room. If give me give me a perception check. <laughs> Drop another one. See how we uh-huh. So when you uh, so so in the master ba- ba- bedroom, you you don't see that many strange things. But uh, when you go on to the what's the English word for it? What's the Dutch word? When you go in the hallway, it's a hallway in, in, in English. Yeah, just yeah. a hallway. Yeah, in the hallway. Yes. Uh, what you do notice is is that you hear some kind of uh, funky uh, uh, teenager music, like 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 which which is currently popular uh, with some kind of. Uh, oh, now, now, now we know uh, how a hip Ronan's music tastes. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> These youngsters these days. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm gonna kind of creep down the hallway into that room, um, and presuming there's somebody in there, I'm gonna close the door and lock it behind me. Yeah. So, so you see this 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 girl uh, 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 dancing about, uh, looking some news, and uh, when you walk in, she. She, she, she first first she she screams at the top of her lungs at seeing you inside like <laughs> and uh, tries to basically uh, yeah at first uh, run to the door uh, but because you're blocking it she uh, runs to the other side of the room and she starts to try to, to throw stuff at you do, like, do, like, yeah, do, um, it's 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 do only that's, that's and not an issue. do me and bombshell hear the scream yes you do if you guys are I not get a ch- all right, so I'm trying to be sneaky. Do I not get a chance to try to stifle that? Yeah, sure, do so. Because what I want to do is, if she if she has time to scream and run around the room and shit, uh, then I should have time to like crank Drive the radio yeah. and <laughs> um, uh, just very casually take up a lot of space in the room. Yeah, um, go ahead. Give and yeah, you so so you grab her, I presume. Not yet. Okay. <laughs> not yet. Is, not yet. We'll, we'll, we'll see how hard she makes life for herself. Um, uh, I but I do turn the turn the dial on the radio, crank it up, um, <laughs> and then just to her, I say, "All right, listen here, love. You're in way over your head. You're playing <laughs> at being a businessman, but you're playing with the wrong people. You understand?" 
And she should go, I don't know Be what you're talking about. Very careful. Give me the VIP tickets. And you never have to see me again. <laughs> She's like, then I have to look around. It's a lovely place you have. She's like, I, I don't have them. They're there for my parents. <laughs> <laughs> uh, she said uh, they're uh, from the parents. Yes, they're, 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 so, so 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 she 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 doesn't really have those tickets. They they they're like she she was they're they're, they're from my they're, they're they're my parents' tickets. They should be somewhere <laughs> downstairs. <laughs> well, she has six of them. That's well, that, that's what she advertised. Okay, 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 okay. Mm -hmm. Um, um, uh, tell me, Pinky. You love your parents. <laughs> she, 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 she tries to look away as if, as if, as if she, 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 she doesn't care. But you really notice that that she really cares. <laughs> I think, I, I don't care. I don't yes. care. Yeah, I don't care. <laughs> and tries to look away, like, like, like. She's trying to be this tough teenager against this really big man. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to learn how to do business with the big boys, this is your first lesson. Go get those tickets from your parents. I'll wait right here. And if I hear anything, this entire building comes down, your parents well, quite honestly, are going to be turned into red oatmeal. <laughs> <laughs> she, she, uh, so she uh, runs down, and uh, I'm actually going to follow her into the hallway till we get to the point. Um, like I don't know the layout of this place. No, no, but okay, there's, so, there's like a if, if there's like the an hall, overlook yeah. balcony or something. Yeah, yeah, there's an overlook balcony. So so what you what you do notice is is you you can follow her down down to the stairs and you notice that she walks into uh, what seems to be like like an um, a living room and you hear her open some uh, drawers looking around fan frantically like like if some as if somebody is trying to to look everywhere with so, which which uh, where, where you look for something but you cannot find it and, and you slowly trying get to look for the tickets you think and you and you slowly get frustrated that you're unable to find them uh it, it takes about five minutes or something before she comes uh running upstairs a little bit haggard and and she will give you an uh, an envelope, and it's like, <laughs> please Check don't, it. please don't tell my parents. <laughs> Check the envelope. Oh yeah, sure. I'll, yeah. If, if I was a nicer guy, I would have said, I'm gonna tell your parents because that always works. So. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna, uh, you know, peel back the envelope, take a look at what's inside. Uh, what you do notice is that there are actually uh, four VIP tickets inside. Uh, okay. They um, are all on a name. Uh, on what a name? name. Under? Yes. Uh, give me a moment. I. Uh, where is it? Give me. So it's all, all of the uh, last names are Miller, M-I-L-L-E-R. And it's an, uh, an uh, Marcus Miller, a Celius Miller, an, uh, a Susanna Miller, and a an Hannah Miller. I think he looks like a Hannah to me. <laughs> um. If you would, if you would hazard a guess, it would seem to be that that it is a ticket for the two parents and two of their children. Mm. All right. Well, I'm, gonna, <laughs> well, uh, I'm, I'm gonna take these, um, uh, and I'm gonna say, uh, what did we learn here today? <laughs> <laughs> Lock the doors so don't those scary men don't get get in. Oh, wrong. Uh, and then I point at it with a giant finger. Um, uh, no amount of locked doors is going to keep a scary man out. 
what you need to do, though. And I'm going to, like, point her face so it's staring at me. I'm going to, like, pitch her uh, chin between my thumb and forefinger and point her directly at me. You need to be the scarier man. Say you understand. Uh, and with, with, with her uh, cheeks hold by you, is I understand. Yeah, and then I'm going to, uh, yeah. I'm going to shove her back into her room yeah. by the face. Uh, I'm going to say, better luck next time. And then I'm going to slam the door, jam it shut, uh, and leave yes. the way I came. <laughs> Fuck yes. I love every single piece of this. <laughs> this girl is scarred for life now. <laughs> well, if she's going to be a gangster, she better be a good one. <laughs> it, honestly, that is where I'm thinking. Like, Envy is literally just like, if anybody knows my own people, it's me. And I don't like my own people, can I be honest? <laughs> <laughs> And that's a four VIP tickets in my four possession. Four VIP tickets. They they are they are uh, on on a name. So so you uh, so how how you guys are going to do that? Uh, that's on to you. But uh, it's yes, it's only a name, right? No no other stuff. Are go, are going are they going to check? Uh, uh, What's so. your name? <laughs> It's up for you guys to, to figure out. All right, so now we need to either all be really good liars or all of us forge IDs that match the name, that match the names. I'd rather go for the last one because I'm not good at lying. <clears throat> last time I got told to pick an acting role, they tried to kill me. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm just, I'm just not getting shit. It's all good. How, so, how, how is the leg? Um, <laughs> um, dice might know uh, how to get onto some fake ideas. Yeah, so. he either knows what we're looking for or how to get it. Um, I'm going to call dice. So, friendly neighborhood you don't Look like we're. Family, though, is the thing. We're going to have to have a story, too. And okay. Envy, hold on. Uh, Liquid, did you ask something? No, I thought I thought um, Bombshell was calling I was calling him. him, and then Envy continued. <laughs> so, okay. So, uh, Bombshell, you were calling Dice. Yes. Friendly neighborhood fixer. How may I help? Hey, Dice, it's Bombshell. Um... We got our hands on some tickets. They are named. Um, do you know someone, or do you? Or can you do it yourself to get us some uh, fake ideas that to match the names? It'd be better if I call someone else. I tried to do it earlier myself, and it didn't go so well. So let me uh, let me see if I could call someone for you. It would be great. All right. Hell yeah. Eddie Pockets. <laughs> Husband, wife, other wife, potentially third wife. <laughs> okay, we that's don't funny. need to look like family. <laughs> we can we can just be like adopted or have uh, have the, the the like a one big uh, polygamous uh, family. <laughs> Question. You guys can all be brothers and sisters. Just, you know. Is bombshell like lighter than envy but darker? That, or, but darker than Red Boy. Y'all could be brothers and sisters, you know. <laughs> it, does, it doesn't have to be all like parents and kids. Okay. Exactly, and you can all be adopted kids. <laughs> you know, you have those rich parents that adopt a lot of kids. You know, you don't yeah. have to. The, the best way in order to spoof people like that is like, don't overthink it. Just like go in and pretend like you belong in the place. Obviously. Okay. That, that's you that's real life and You nice always knowledge. need a story in case they ask is something that I've learned quite recently because very recently I tried to walk into some place like I belonged there and I got stopped because I didn't have an ID. Well, What's the got... worst that could happen? <laughs> <laughs> Somebody tries to shoot me and then I'm, I, I, I'm ready for that eventuality now. <laughs> wow. Ronan, oh do you God. need me to um, roll uh, anything to make sure, like, the guy that does it is a good one or anything like that? Uh, uh, so what what do you want to make? 
dice. What I'm trying to do is like get in contact with a with a good forger this time uh, to mm -hmm. help those guys out. Okay, so so it, I kind of like you want to make fake IDs or something? Yeah, basically to match the tickets. Yeah, sure. Hell yeah. So what do you need me to roll? Uh, you can try and forge it yourself. Uh, that will be a DV-17 to make them at least passable. Um, uh, since I don't want to... It's a 17. I have enough luck. I might as well do it myself. With, with my uh, 8 base, no unleveled forgery. I'd, re I'd rather call someone yeah. who's, who's good at it. <laughs> <laughs> after after trying it myself. <laughs> sure. Alright. Alright, it's gonna be while this call is going on, Envy is going to pull out her laptop. Yes, it is in her inventory, you can look. And she is going to work on like she's gonna work on uh graphic designing a, a new ID and just like having someone else print it out for her. And so this is going to be my attempt. And wow, would you look at that? So while Dice is calling around to see if he can 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 contact a trustworthy forger, he manages to to contact a few untrustworthy one where where the even Dice was like, eh, no, I'm going to. And Envy on the background goes like, uh, yes, got it. And all of them go like, got what? And then she shows like like four <laughs> fake IDs. Yes. <laughs> She learned how oh, to do it on man. YouTube. <laughs> oh, um. Just as long guys, as it, just as long as Pockets is rolling in as Hannah, it's, it's gonna be awesome. <laughs> right. Yeah, yeah, I mean they're, they're they're not gonna question it. Envy <laughs> is going. Envy is going to call Dice back and say, "Never mind on getting those forgeries. If you can print them for me, I've already got them designed." Yeah, yeah, the, and they the, look fabulous. The the, the IDs just, the IDs are more digital than actually uh, play. So so you you manage to have digital uh, ideas for 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 people. But yes, finally. Yeah, I, I, I want to interject here just so I have something straight in my head. Yes. Uh, Stitches, you were the guy who in the hotel mission chopped off a guy's hand when we had him subdued, right? Yeah. Okay, just double checking. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that was in the uh, like, Six Hotel. Yeah, yeah, for, for like, th this yeah, whole game. Yeah, valuable cyberware. This people yeah, this, don't. This whole game, I was, I was concerned, like, wait a minute, is this not the person I think it is? Um, you are the person. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Good. Yes, you, 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 you guys are going to go to a cyberware exposition with some psychos. We have the Stitches the Psycho, we have Bombshell the Psycho, and we have Red Boy the Psycho. And we I'm have not the Psycho, I have a humanity and, of 40. <laughs> and, now, and now Envy has joined that club with her rocket launcher. So, <laughs> I hey, my seven of eight empathy. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't matter. Anyway. My empathy is pretty low. It's my, uh, my, my, my humanity is seven. <laughs> so at the end of the day, <laughs> It's it's uh it's it's starting slowly early in the, in the in the Thursday. You guys managed to get all the tickets together, and um, uh, I presume that all of you are getting ready to go to the exposition, the cyber exposition. Uh, absolutely, yeah. I'm dressed yep. up in my like uh, my business best with some uh, uh, my slacks in my shirt, like all on, nice Should, should I read really past the picture of Pockets in a suit that I found? Oh my god. Ah, the monkey. Uh, <laughs> Ooh, please do. Red, Red Boy. Remember, differentiate the character from the player. <laughs> please. Red Boy is also a big boy, but not as big as Red Boy. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> I've, I've, I've seen how Pocket looks like when he turned on oh, his, yeah. his, his, no, his, his uh, webcam. The thing yeah, is, though, you, you said that Red Boy <laughs> is uh, almost as big as Red Boy. Yes. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I, I thought mean, that was is also a big boy. <laughs> I was, like, so confused. My brain was like, what? <laughs> you guy, he's so handsome. <laughs> These snozberries <laughs> taste like snozberries. <laughs> Return to monkey, huh? <laughs> Return to monkey. <laughs> <laughs> So 
Yo, how are you guys? Um, <laughs> how are you dressed? Well, I, no, no, no. I, I presume that, uh, yeah, you can show pictures on, on how you guys are dressed. Um, yeah, no, this you is, guys this is already Kong know what I <laughs> um, I am going to say, uh, because we're not expecting combat, Envy is leaving her armor jack and everything but her pistol and her carry-all, like, mm -hmm. or, like all of her armaments besides her pistol on her. Sure. And the pistols in her carry-all. Wonderful. Good to know. Okay. Well, I, uh, she's, got, she's got that nice single sleeve sweater and the and the pleated mini skirt. Hell yeah. She's looking hot. Yeah, so, I've got a a, a, a blue uh, kind of pinstripe suit with nice. I bought, actually bought cufflinks for it. Aw. Uh, nice. Yeah, I have uh, super chrome cufflinks with light blue accents. Fuck yeah, that's rad, um, actually. But yeah, nice I'm gonna have, have my shotgun and my carry-all, <laughs> and I've got my sword on a back scabbard under my jacket, under my backpack. So no, um, so okay, so so shotgun in the carry-all and sword on the back. Yes. Okay, and liquid or oh, dice. Sorry. All right, Dice is wearing uh, a black suit with a white shirt and a black tie. He's got um, he's got two smoke bombs uh, hidden along with his uh, very heavy pistol that's concealable with a silencer mm -hmm. and um, one flashbang. Oh, okay. thanks for that pistol, by the way. That thing's gonna come so handy. And uh, Bombshell, you had a question about the rules? Yes, so most conventions do have rules about what, what you can bring inside and what not. I want mm -hmm. to see what their rules are. Oh, <clears throat> definitely. There are indeed some rules with, which, which, which are easily found. It's, uh, they tell you that it's a high security event. Mm -hmm. uh, so they uh, will not allow any uh, anything bigger than, than an, an pistol inside uh, All right. uh you there will be a, a, a check before you enter the the premises during uh when you uh, when you show your ticket mm -hmm. uh, in that case i will leave my shotgun behind and i will just bring my sword and after um. that they uh they will uh, let you go in and uh, you are free after that to go in and out uh, whenever. I can't believe Actually, that I Red did Boy has like a car, did right? Better, I did better Absolutely. forgery. Can I leave my shotgun in the back of your car? Trained forger. Uh, yeah, totally. I mean, I plan on bringing my entire fucking arsenal in the trunk of my car. <laughs> <laughs> Last time I went to yeah. an expo, they tried to fucking kill me. I'm Aww. Like, he's, he's, cool. he's like, he's like, so, no, uh, if, if this goes tits up, I'm making sure this whole building goes down. <laughs> so yeah, Envy's armor jack and rocket launcher are going to be in that trunk as well. Oh, that is a nice outfit. Uh, for Natari, I probably leave my armor as well because I mean I have such a nice outfit. I cannot put armor over <laughs> over that. Um, she does have her pistol on her hip and um, her uh, <laughs> pop-up melee weapon will be in her arm. She does have to leave her precious new Kadachi mono tree <laughs> in the trunk. Have you had a chance to use that yet? Got the spicy sword. <laughs> Ah, uh, yeah, I have, I have had a chance to use it, yes. I am so happy. It was so nice. <laughs> the devil did not see it coming. I was like, what? <laughs> uh, I'm reminded of getting to use my rocket launcher in Mr. K's game. That was wonderful. Is that so, the one yeah. where you got the, the person on clarity? <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, yeah. It was uh, so nice. That's what I bring. I probably bring my query all. Um, I probably have to leave my grenades. <laughs> so, yeah. You guys okay. are all dressed in the nines, got all your tickets, and uh, you guys. Uh, it's it's about the time that that uh, that that the it's it's the event is uh, starting. Uh, already on the news, you see some red carpet happenings where where a few of the higher society people are already showing up. Uh, for a pre-event 
and um, uh, like I said, you guys have a VIP tickets. So uh, we all of them have now VIP. I tickets. think all and of you. No, I don't. I'm I'm just backroom. Back no, room. no, you do because we got four, and we can yeah. give you one. <laughs> Okay, so, uh, uh, let, let me make a concentration check to see how prideful Stitches is being. You can't get to see if you're going to take, take the <laughs> oh ill-gotten gains. Oh my god. No. <laughs> what did I roll? 16. 16. Uh, All right, so... He will be very, very grumpy about this. <laughs> <laughs> like he will take it. Take okay. it. <laughs> so, so, uh, so you guys can uh, show up, and uh, so uh, you guys come and come in Red Boy's car. I come by bike. Oh, okay. Uh, if someone wants to join me on my bike. Oh, it's got to be me. We're it's fucking be, roommates, like babe. <laughs> That's cool. That's cool. So, so you Envy and I own on the bike. So you guys uh, drive up, and uh, it, it's quite. It's you see the center uh, in front of you, um, and uh, you guys drive up to the first uh, gate, as to speak. Security is everywhere. You see drones flying about. You see di all kinds of different kinds of security uh, badges and and clothing around. You see, uh... Can I make a perception check for a very specific badge? Yes, yeah, sure, go ahead. What for specific badge are you looking for? Uh, I think you know. <laughs> That's cryptic. Yes, also watchdogs are, are, are walking about. I told you he would know. Uh, watchdog, <laughs> you say. <laughs> oh, God. It's, it, you see oh, beat man. cops, you see sheriffs, uh, and you see, basically you, you feel like 80% like, like of all, all, all the security within the Glen is at this place congested. Just a reminder, Stitch's last gig was the one where he broke into a... Uh, uh, into a watchdog space and it had to be carried out. <laughs> it will be fine. Well, good news <laughs> that I got us some new IDs. And, uh, Dice so, has a cousin so, in the watchdogs. One of the NCPD is like, like uh, yeah, hello, uh, tickets please. When you drive up. And, and I hand over the, the ticket for uh, Cecilius Miller. And he's like, uh, right. oh, okay, oh, okay, hello, uh, sirs. Uh, and uh, you can go up to uh, that uh, special uh, parking spot. Uh, and he shows you a parking spot, which seemed to be uh, guarded with extra security, a whole, a whole lot of empty, and with a whole lot of more expensive cars and AV9s, AV4s, completely tricked out. Uh, it, 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 that place is like, like, like every vehicle which could be there is, is like completely chromed out tricked out like, uh, these people yeah. are, have, have spent quite a few quite a few eddies on their vehicles and uh, you guys can just drive there simply uh, even when Maketi shows up also she will be uh, pointed to bombshell. that shell bombshell she will point it to that mm -hmm. uh, to that spot there and you guys can uh, park uh, park there. Uh, what you do notice is that the entrance is just some uh, a, a few uh, security guards standing there uh, talking, lacing about in the at the entrance. Yeah, so I'm gonna know. let everyone else go first, and then I'll bring up the yeah. rear. I'll be kind of hanging back by the car, uh, fiddle, pretending to fiddle with my agent. I kick right. you out of my car. Leaning on the leaning on like this on like the the trunk. <laughs> All right, okay. that's fair. So, um, so but Envy. before any of that, sorry, yeah. Envy, uh, GM, you I just want to note that I did uh, legally purchase two regular customer floor level tickets, and I'm going to give them to some of my red boys. Because it, nice. it, <laughs> sure, yes. I, so, I want them to be in the building just yeah. in case it goes tits up. There is Smart. a precedent yeah. that they will be there. Smart idea. Yes, I love it. I love that idea. Yes. So two red boys uh, with us with the standard tickets get to stand in the line, and you see them in a very long line. <laughs> 
uh, but eventually they will also get into the building. Uh, yeah. They won't have their, their, you know, fancy weapons. But uh, you know, don't don't they don't the, like the Keanu Mounties have uh, like grenade launchers? <laughs> um, that's that's one level up from where I'm at. They don't have any uh, weapons, but they still have combat stats, and if they need to, they can still fight. Okay. Yeah, and, and most of the time, from what I can see, is that, that the Red Boys are either fighting melee or using their heavy pistols, as far as I can see, yeah. or very heavy pistols, right? Yeah. Uh, when, when they're inside, yeah, for sure. Yeah. <laughs> so, so yeah, I think the only thing that they, that they are not able to use then is the assault rifle, which yeah, they also come sense. with. Yeah, okay, good, good. I don't think that's much of a problem. Yeah, I, I think that's totally fair, because they're not going to be coming in with an assault rifle. Uh, yeah, well, and, and yeah, Bombshell's uh, colleagues are also inside, walking around the security uh, people for, for other executives and such. So, uh, yeah, they are also inside. Love love how you, you use those tickets. Smart. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, Envy is going <laughs> to just, like, affix the GoPro that is usually on her glasses to the neckline of mm -hmm. her sweater. And she's going to put the glasses, the smart glasses, mind you, in her carry-all. And okay. she's going to say, all right, Hannah Miller, let's do this. Mm -hmm. So uh, what you guys notice is with the VIP entrance is that there is also some kind of a red carpet entrance where a lot of the high, uh, where, where mainly celebrities, where, where all the kind of celebrities, the power players, uh, names that you recognize is like, like, hey, the, the, there's that person, there's that person. I, I, I like uh, uh, Michiko Sanderson, some of the some of the other corporate faces. Yeah, but especially with oh, the wait, do we see me? Do we see Michiko Sanderson there? Yes. Envy is immediately just like. <sighs> Like she's she's basically on her knees at that point. What? Calm down, calm down. He's so pretty though. I know, but still, calm down. We still All have right. a job to do. Dice, right. is, Dice is gonna use uh, the, cra then, the crowd. Then, and then, and just like... kind of looks over at Envy and it's kind of you know gives gives her a quick glare and like don't approach. Um, no, Envy doesn't dare. She has way too much respect for that. <laughs> also, she's scared. Dice is gonna Dice is gonna use the crowd and like the distraction of this like I guess celebrity or whatever, uh, so that he's not so no photos are taken of him uh, as he walks oh, in. Oh, uh, there there are a lot of media taking photos and 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 uh, uh, and uh, films. Yeah, yeah, Envy so, is already rolling, by the way. So Dice is going to walk around behind those guys to get in. <laughs> yeah, definitely. You can do so indeed. And uh, you you can walk uh, past them if you want. And uh, then you will go into some kind of, 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 of the uh, uh, shielded uh, entrance where you guys, where a few security guards are standing and they are like, uh, tickets, uh, please, sirs and missus. All right, uh, Envy is going can I, to... Can I see this going on? Uh, yes, definitely. Okay. Envy is going to walk up first and proudly present her ticket. Uh, which ticket did you have? Uh, I have a ticket for Hannah Miller. Okay, so he, uh, you give him also the ID, it's like he checks the ticket yes. and he gives the ID. Uh, ah, welcome, uh, Miss Hannah. I uh, hope you will uh, enjoy this uh, this day. And uh, um, he, he will uh, give you also an, an, an card. It's like, a, here's your uh, card room. Um, it's on the sixth floor, uh, the uh, left uh, tower, and uh, it's uh, room uh, 67. All right, thank you. Uh, left tower of room, or left tower of room 67? Or room mm -hmm. 67 the left tower. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Does she get searched? No, she does not. Okay. Um, oh. as, as everyone else is uh, kind of, um, uh, you know, going through and getting searched, I'm going to, uh, or, you know, going through and getting checked in, I'm going to pop the trunk uh, place my carry-all inside and lean over the trunk, kind of blocking as much as I can with my body, and mm -hmm. subtly shift my shotgun 
and a whole bunch of armor-piercing rounds and incendiary rounds into my carry-alls. Yeah. Um, and then I'm going to close the trunk and I'm going to uh, m- mosey on up. Um, Do keep in mind that I am that my carry-all is literally a purse that you could not carry a shotgun in. If your carry-all is big enough, they might search you. Well, I, I guess I can probably still see the other people being searched. So uh, who the... follows behind? Yeah. Uh, I do, because we arrive together, so... Yeah. So, uh, so, so um... Uh, you will ask uh, tickets, please? I will uh, hand over my tickets. Tickets? Mm-hmm. Uh, which name uh, were you? I took the one with Susanna. Susanna. He uh, checks over the ID. He checks over the tech. Ah, yes. Welcome, uh, Susanna Miller. Uh, and uh, here's your uh, room uh, pass. And it will be uh, 68. All right. Well, thank you left, very much. Left tower, sixth floor. Uh, shit, I've already forgotten what fucking floor that I'm You're supposed 67. to be on. 67. Yeah. Okay, oh. so... Thank you very much. Listen, it, 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 it's, hold on. If Stitches got into my trunk to grab his shit, then I have to go in after Stitches because I would have opened my trunk for him and closed it. Sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. So, okay. so then, I'll, then I'll go in after uh, Bombshell. Yeah. Can I, yeah. Can I just do a, a security tech to open it? <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> I don't trust the guy who didn't go on the op to get the tickets. <laughs> I'm not just gonna let you get in my freaking trunk. <laughs> so, so, uh, so it, you uh, you show him the the, the you show him the dice, you show him the ticket, and and he's like, he's like uh, ah yes, uh, welcome, uh, Mr. Lincoln. Uh, uh, nice to have you here. And he will uh, give you uh, also. Here's your uh, room number. It is uh, fifth floor, and it's room fifty one. Uh, of the left tower. Uh, welcome and enjoy your stay. Sir, can you what, tell me, can you tell the, me where the, the bar is? You pop the trunk on uh, Red Boy's car before he can walk over. What's the DV to pop Stitch's head with my hands? <laughs> <laughs> he grabs can, I, can I ask the guard where to get a drink? Uh, <laughs> yes, definitely you can ask him. Why are you two making so much trouble? <laughs> uh, and He's trying to break into my car and bring heavy munitions into this thing. Uh, I'm the victim here. <laughs> yes, uh, Mr. Mister Lincoln. Uh, yes, uh, of course. There is an, uh, an, a bar on the fourth floor. Uh, there is also a bar on uh, the ground floor. And uh, there's also in the in the back rooms, there is an, uh, a special bar for, for VIPs. Um, please in the, enjoy your stay and uh, remember to, uh, to 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 read your itinerary uh, of all the kinds of um, expositions uh, and um, what the, what are they called again? Oh damn it! Uh, um, presentations. Book. Sorry, yeah. And the presentations we will, which will be held uh, in the upcoming three days, you will be able to find them uh, in your room. Oh, thank you very much, sir. Yes. And okay, Stitches and Red Boy, you guys are 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 at Red Boy Scar. What are you two doing? <laughs> no, I'm 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 uh, fumbling. Uh, I, I'm trying to do a security tech check because he's he's probably got to walk at least some distance uh, before um you know, which should give me time to you know take my tech scanner and you know fiddle with the door locks. Yeah, yeah, but the, the problem with that is that you, in your head, have narratively put me away from my car when I, the player, have not said that I've left my car. Okay. So, oh, wait, so, you, you you hadn't left your car? No, he hadn't. No. Okay, then in that case, I won't do that. <laughs> yes. So, because, okay. like, like, like Red Boy said, that he would open the car for you if you wanted to okay. get your stuff back. Okay. Um... Right. Okay. So that, that that's resolved. Um, yes. Yeah, I will. I will. Uh, Red Boy will see a bunch of armor-piercing slugs and incendiary shells being shuffled in. Um. And then I will head up along with Red Boy to get checked in. 
Mm-hmm. Well, he's got a when he sees you shuffling all that into your carry-all, he's got a big smile on his face. He says, "Oh, I knew you were one of us." <laughs> uh, uh, Sitches so gives a knowing wink. Uh, and you guys also uh, walk uh, towards uh, the entrance, or not? yes, uh, I'm I'm going to let him go and see how his double bag uh, situation works out. Yes. Um. So, um, so Stitches, you uh, come to the entrance, and yeah. what is the ticket name of yours? Uh, I am. I think it's like Cecilius Miller. Mm-hmm. And he will uh, he will check uh, your ticket and he will see your ideas. Like uh, welcome, uh, Mr. Miller. Uh, uh, do please remind you that uh, that you have to keep uh, your uh, sword and your shotgun uh, in the rooms all times when you are on the convention floors. Uh, otherwise, uh, wait. So they saw me. Yes. I specifically well, said I was game. I was covering the back of the trunk with my body. Yeah, but when you go, you. but when you go in, they will see the sword on your back, right? Yeah, but just the sword. Uh, is your shotgun concealable? Uh, it is inside of a very large backpack. Yes, but is it concealable? It's one of the things I don't like about red is that very binary. Uh, yes. <laughs> I know. So, so no, it's not okay, concealable. Can I make a conceal reveal object check then? <laughs> um, I don't think that's what concealable and not concealable means. Sasha, Sasha. Uh, so it's in the. They're back, also but... they're also fine with you bringing the shit in there. So still, if I can avoid it. Um. Okay, so what does envy? What does concealable, non-concealable mean? Um, so basically, if something is concealable, then that means like if you are say noticed to be to be having weapon on you, you can make a conceal reveal object check in order to put it in order to make sure that they don't mm-hmm. notice that you have it. And that's only for things that are concealable. If it's not concealable, yeah. then you cannot conceal reveal it. Jeez. Uh, okay then. Yeah, I will. Uh, I will. And I'm not say. Okay. Yes, I will. I, I will make sure to keep it in my room. Wonderful. Thank you, uh, Mr. Bill. And uh, here's your uh, room. Uh, it yeah. will be uh, 66. Uh, it will be in the left tower, sixth floor. Okay. And uh, enjoy your stay. Y'all I have no idea that. how fucking crunk Envy's going to get on, like, in that room. <laughs> uh, uh, Red Boy, I presume that you're the last one walking in. Uh, yeah, I mean, if they're fine with us just bringing shit as long as it's not on the, uh, on the the out on the floor, then yeah, I'm going to load up my fucking, um, uh, my carry-all with the fucking million grenades that I should have brought to the last expo. <laughs> Oh my god. So, so, so you're bringing an entire bag with grenades? Absolutely. <laughs> All right. Anything else? Here's the thing. Knowing that they will allow somebody to bring in a shotgun is one thing. I wouldn't, like, see that and then think, oh, I can bring my rocket nope, launcher past else. them. Okay. So, <laughs> you, so you give them uh, the ticket. Uh, what was your, your name again? I think Marcus or... I, I, I think already. Marcus is the only who hasn't been taken, so I'm going with Marcus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Marcus, uh, he looks up to you. He's like, uh, welcome, um, Marcus Miller. Um, uh, please do that. Uh, uh, um, and he's, he sees that very all. And, and she, the shape is quite clear what's inside. Like, uh, please, sir, uh, I hope you will keep that in your room uh, at all times. Uh, and not on the on the exposition uh, floor. Uh, uh, of course, it just it, it can't be left securely in the car. You understand? Uh, we we have enough security to keep it safe. If you wish uh, wish us to keep it safe for you, sir. VIP like myself doesn't take chances with hired security. <laughs> uh, of course, uh, sir. Uh, enjoy your stay. And uh, here is uh, your uh, room. It's a uh, room seventy on the sixth floor of the left building. Uh, please enjoy your stay, uh, Mr. Miller. Mr. Fucking Borg in 
a monkey suit fucking like talking big shit about himself. <laughs> yeah, that uh, welcome to Red Boy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, exactly. I love Yeesh. it. Okay, so so see, I I hope you guys can see it for you. These are security guy uh, security guards, which which are basically there to to protect all okay, the, so the the, the, the expensive people. The, and they, the, they are um, not really hired to check these people because hmm. remember, the, the high society rich people don't really like to be checked. Yeah, it, it, it's it's kind of yeah. like a, a more it would be an awkward situation if I made a scene about it. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. So I've I've checked the rules on weapon concealment, and it specifically says, as I thought it did, under clothing. Um, so I do not have my shotgun under clothing. I have it in a bag. So can I still right make there? a conceal reveal object check? Sure. Um. Okay. Give me an uh, fifteen to beat. Okay. Uh, I'm not going to bother spending luck on that. Um, uh, hey, can I spend my luck on it? I want somebody to be armed to the teeth while we're in here. No, only okay. the person itself. Okay. Uh, luck is, is luck is something which which changes your uh, thing and dice. Yes. No, I get it. All right. I would like to. Can I do like a fla use a thing of luck to do a flashback um, thing? Yeah, sure. What do you want to flashback? All right. The same guy who got me the VIP tickets. Mm -hmm. I want him to meet me at the bar and hand me my, uh, my microwaver. Oh! You could have just, uh, bring that along if you wanted. For your luck points. No, I want, I, I meant, I meant, I want, a cyberware expo. I meant I want to give it to him, um, at the bar to give it to me when I'm inside, like, on the floor past security. Yeah, sure, yeah, definitely. He will be there waiting for you, and uh, he will uh, hand you over uh, your microwave. I, I meant when I get on, on the floor of the of the expo, past the security. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sweet. He can definitely do that for you. Nice. Oh, you will have your microwave. So you guys are uh, on the exposition floor, and I'm going to drag you guys up here. Okay. Wow, fancy. I like the roof. Envy is delighted. Her eyes are lighting up, and you can see them because she's not wearing her I smart glasses. I can't see the exposition floor. It's not a map. It's, uh, it, should, it should be visible, right? I can oh. see it's, um, it's like some sort of like kaleidoscopic view of, from like above of a building but it doesn't seem to be like an actual floor like certainly can't see any tokens on it oh no no, um, no oh yeah there, there are no tokens on it yet yeah, yeah. This, so, uh, so this is the floor and the thing that you're seeing that are kaleidoscoping yeah. are like uh pillars and decoration and shit yeah that is hurting my brain oh my, my apologies but I thought it was a, a very nice, fancy. Uh, it is uh, highly fancy. In inside, I thought it, it was as, as to give you like like an uh, a view on how it would be inside with with all the stuff. Ah, this this is isn't meant to be like the map. This is just a a handout, basically. Yes, 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 yes. yes. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I I, right. I have I I will I will be honest. I have uh, almost no battle maps. I do have a few just in case. Uh, but mainly I have all these kinds yeah. of pictures where, where you guys can uh, yeah. fill in for yourself with, with just, the help just, of this just picture. Just a bit of feedback. Maybe next time, rather than putting them as map backgrounds, put them as handouts that you can show to us. Um, uh, you could. No, we should do feedback at the end. Yeah, I'm just saying so I don't forget. Yeah. Uh, and mm -hmm. and uh, there is also an upper floor, and there we go. There's also an upper floor where people are walking about, uh, skylights, uh, and it's it's quite big, and it's already starting to bustle. Uh, and from where you guys are, you you, you have quite a, you have a proper view of, of of how big it can be. But you're in 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 an um, a more um, secure place or, or 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 empty place, like like a more private place. Sorry. 
where you can do your things. There are elevators where you can go up to your rooms if you want. Uh, there are security at every uh, door, uh, which you can just easily walk through, uh, and where you can enter the exposition halls and such. And uh, you can walk to the Red Room. So, so go on and tell me, what do you guys want to do? And we will start um, with... Hmm? Well, I'm just thinking... Uh, uh, are we going to go in order? Uh, yeah, sure. D- uh, dice, go ahead. All right. Um, I'm just going to walk around, look at security, look at the different booths, just get a good familiarity of where everything is. I'm going to talk to my friend who uh, got me the VIP ticket and ask him where, like, uh, the Rockland back room and their stores are going to be and stuff like mm-hmm. that. And just uh, try to figure out a plan the first day and just, like, enjoy the stuff. Also, I'm going to, like, scope out for some neuralware and some, um, you know, some pain editors or something expensive that I'd be interested in taking. <laughs> Man, some chipware would be nice. Um, Envy is going to be sort of uh, delightedly browsing every single like stand from like ev- from like the cyberware expositions to even like food stands and trucks that they have around, <laughs> just so that she can like figure things out and build up a report in this scene. Uh, definitely. Well, what you guys see is, is that there, there are all kinds of, of, of uh, stands, uh, uh, all kinds of, of uh, wonderful stuff. Um, there's even a an, an, an water wall, which you can... Uh, Ooh, that looks uh, awesome. which, which, which is showing where, where certain stands are from. Uh, what you mainly see is that all, uh, with, there are mainly all kinds of different cyber limbs, which, which are unique shapes, unique colors uh, some of very uh, rotten you you see you see all kinds of, of, of uh, you see even find find uh, a, a cyber hand which is fully encrusted with diamonds uh, <laughs> diamond knuckled cyber hands thank you so much Diamond gorilla hands. That is that'd be awesome. <laughs> there, there should hurt if you hit. There, there's there's also a military uh, 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 section where a lot of, of, of combat uh, where is being shown where where uh, where you have pop pop up uh, melee weapons and. Uh, where they show off a an, 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 an concealable uh, assault rifle inside a cyber arm. Uh, all kinds of, of, of wonderful stuff. Um, the newest cyber eyes, which, which uh, even have a more improved uh, version of the low light and infrared uh, stuff. Uh, although, the, as so they claim. Uh, <laughs> uh, and uh, th- that is all what you see. Uh, the foods and drinks due, due to your VIP tickets are is completely free and on the house. So, That's all yeah. the food. Okay, then I, uh, Stitches is going to be uh, living the life in the bar. La- nice. <laughs> um, I have left my carryall upstairs in my room. Yep. Uh, I, each in you, all of you in your rooms, if you go there, you will find interrogatories where all the kinds of of, of, of uh, presentations will be held. In which rooms they will be held. Uh, and yeah, can I can I yeah, see in- if any if Rockland or Max is showing off any cyber chairs, and if so, at what, where, and at what time? Yeah, give me an an, an, an easy all day perception check. Uh, I can I do like a uh, library search? Uh, sure. It won't give the plus two from my age, and I'll just remove that. Well, actually, actually, it's the same sort as use uh, perception. Um. Yeah. So, so what you notice is that uh, uh, Rockling will be holding. Uh, 
uh, four different presentations over over the coming three days. Yeah. Uh, where uh, a special presentation later in the evening around uh, there will be one presentation around 5 p.m. Um, and there will be a presentation around 10 p.m. And the one yeah. at 10 p.m. is a, a VIP only. Yeah. And is this the one for the Cyberchair? It's got to be it's VIP only, right? That is something which which they which it do, which uh, it doesn't say, but it does say that they uh, will show something revolutionary. Okay, uh, I will message the party with this information before I head down to the bar. Okay. Uh, when I receive those messages, I will reply. I will go to both. I want to mm-hmm. be at both presentations. W- what time is it at the moment? And uh, about Stitcher's Red Boy Bombshell, give me a perception roll. I see nothing. <laughs> Red boy, uh, what you notice is 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 uh, when uh, uh, Stitches told you like, hey, there are also are some uh, watchdogs around. You notice on the interior that also Arabindo uh, Pharma is uh, having a few um, uh, presentations, and there will be one at uh, also 10 p.m. in the evening, uh, where, where uh, it even says that uh, an, a certain special person will do the presentation to uh, <laughs> to make a very unique and uh, groundbreaking uh, uh, inve- to show a groundbreaking invention. In the world of cyberware, and is this, is this person named on the itinerary? Uh, no, it's not named, but it does say so that it's uh, that the granddaughter of the gotcha. C- of the CEO gotcha. will be there. Um, absolutely. So uh, I'm on. Uh, I'm in room seventy in the left tower, right? Mm-hmm. Yes, uh, I think only Dice is one below you, and I think for uh, the Wait, rest. So of did, did nobody get room sixty nine? Because we've got sixty six, nice. sixty seven, sixty eight, and seventy. Okay. Yes, and none of us got it. <laughs> I, got, I know. I got room fifty one. <laughs> nobody gets to be nice. <laughs> I knew if I would put that one there in, it's it's uh, I would get those remarks. So I purposely did not. Well, you got them anyway. Ah, it's like the missing 13th floor. Yes! It's like like there is no room 13. Can I make a perception check looking specifically for uh, stuff that has to do with neuroware, uh, cyber audio, or cyber objects? Yes, definitely. Thank you. It's... <laughs> Give me that uh, perception check uh, for me. Thank you. Oh, oh yeah, dice definitely. You what you are able to find is that um, how are they called? Let me double check. Raven Micro Cybernetics uh, oh are introducing a new kind of uh, neural link, uh, which in theory should uh, e- uh, should be e- uh, easier to install uh, install into the body, and uh, the that the human body is uh, would, would more easily accept it. Although how much of it is true, you don't know. But there will be a presentation around uh, il, uh, about 6 p.m. or something about it. Gotcha. So what I want to do is walk around. Mm-hmm. In the meanwhile, before the first presentation of uh, probably the chair will go on, uh, I want to walk around, see. Uh, which companies are there, uh, which cards they have, uh, uh, which companies are uh, hired for for uh, protection and such. Uh, I want to see if there are people like uh, 
if there are uh, any guards at doors standing there, uh, if they uh, have a certain movement pattern. Uh, I just want to like take it all in, not looking at Cyber, just looking at all the other stuff. <laughs> Give me your perception check. Ah, I want, Give I want me to... your perception check. Can I, can I roll one too to do the same thing as well? <laughs> sure. So what you guys see is that uh, almost every kind of security corporation has be, has has is at least has at least some presentation. Uh, most of the of the high society and the, and the higher level executives have at least one um, uh, person, uh, uh, one security personnel with them, walking with them. Uh, mainly inside the building, it's Lazarus. Uh, who is uh, who is wa- who is walking about? Um, you do notice that an, at a certain wing there are also uh, a few of the of the uh, watchdogs which are there, uh, which is small con- contingency. Uh, uh, almost every cyber cyberware company is present. Has has some kind of presence in here. Um, uh, because they feel that this is the place to show off and to hook uh, big fish uh, to to sell their stuff and earn some money. Uh, when it comes to security, um, when you go to, into the back rooms and in the VIP areas, it's it's like the security is there, but they don't pay attention to you. Because uh, because they they're like like hey, hey if you walk around here hey you should be here um, they uh, any um, um, boundary on on boundaries on on where for example where where you can go from the VIP entry uh, part to the backroom part uh, there are checks. and when you don't show the proper ticket they won't let you go through. <laughs> <laughs> and it will also be at the standard and the But I believe bars. that it was stated on the VIP tickets that we would have unlimited access to the building. Yes, but they are still checking whether if, if, if somebody right. is yeah. trying to get in with a standard ticket to get into the VIP uh, Right. Part. So that's so, why it's always checked. Yeah, Lilu Just Dallas case. multipass. <laughs> Been referencing that movie so much lately. I don't know why. <laughs> Which room? Which uh, movie? The Fifth Element. Fifth element. Multi pass. <laughs> oh yeah, multi pass. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. I've, I've, so, so I've I never even heard of a game named Corbin, so it kind of. Thanks. Good to know. Okay. And I will probably eat something before the first presentation. Yeah, I will right. also go to the, the first presentation and, you know. So, oh. first off, um, I think I have a little bit more of an idea of what I want to do now that Envy's probably through the whole shock and awe of being here. Wow. Here? Wow. Um, I want to go into the VIP area and find the lowest down looking employee. Yes. So, I imagine there's like a special bar in the VIP area, for example. Mm -hmm. There is. Yep. (laughs) Right. So, um, actually, here's a good first first place to start. Any janitors about? Not that you can see. Roll me a perception check for that. Okay. Okay. No, nope, there's nobody janitors. Uh, I'm just as stuffy as everybody here who I am who I am here to undermine. Great. <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> oh man. No, it seems what you do find strange. What I do find strange. Uh, what you do find strange is that uh, everything seems to be uh, clean, spotless, and but but you don't see actually people 
uh, in your vision doing that. Oh, so it's either been done beforehand and they're trying to keep it spotless or it's automated. One of the two. Or they, it, it seems like that, yeah. <laughs> or they have All active right. camouflaged uh, janitors. <laughs> All right. Hmm. That, that is awesome. They give the janitors active camouflage. That'd be funny. <laughs> <laughs> janitors get optic camo. All the help gets optic camo, so you literally don't have to see them. Exactly. <laughs> That That's would be the up, most cynically upper class thing ever. It really would. <laughs> <laughs> in, in fact, in fact, can I call my friend to see if that's the case? <laughs> sure. Give me a persuasion check or a business check if you can find it out. I got a, I got a business check. That seems more the thing. <laughs> He's like, uh, he, he, you contact him and he's like, hey, guys, how's it going? And, uh, you know, I don't know. I do know they hired some company for, for, for keeping it all clean. Uh, there were, uh, it, it, it wouldn't uh, happen to have been Zira, though, would it? Uh, but uh, I do know that Seraphim is uh, is the one they use for drones to keep an eye out. But I don't, as far as I know, they they are not the ones that uh, that they do do the cleaning. Hmm. All right, uh, can I check my itinerary again for any uh, for any like military or something that has to do with camouflage or new camo camo for a presentation? Sure. I don't know why I'm like on Give this. Give me a uh, bu- 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 la- How is it in English? Uh, bureaucracy. 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 Check. Where do you find it? In all the information. Uh, yeah, there seems to be one. But it seems to be like, like it's an invite only uh, thing. All right. Who do I have to talk to to get in on that? <laughs> You want to listen in into all kinds of things. Um, and, um, also, just a question. The oh wait, no. You, you deal with what you're dealing with. Sorry. Give me a conversation check, dice, gotcha. oh. to see if you can find that information because you will most likely be asking people and questions and such and whether if they are if, if, if somebody knows who got an invitation into that all right i want to roll this uh let me know how much uh luck i have to spend for it you will have to beat a dv 17. never mind <laughs> easily so so you 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 talk to you talk to a few people within the vip room and and there there is this what you can see looks like 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 a military guy with quite a few decorations. He's like, hey, yeah, 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 yeah. I have been invited to that uh, that one. Uh, uh, what are you what are you asking? Like I'm I am a purveyor of fine things myself, as you can see me sitting here in this awesome suit in the VIP area, and the things that I dabble in are always special. And I would just like to take a peek at this thing. Yeah, I'm. Uh, my my boss asked me to to come here and to check uh, check out uh, whether it would be something uh, for 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 us. And you notice that this guy is a, a Militech uh, colonel. Uh, oh, and then I tell him, you know, my dad served for Militech uh, down in um, down in South America. Oh, he did now. I so this before. So, so your Militech uh, family, wonderful. Well, you know, because you're so interested, give me a persuasion roll, whether you, you manage to persuade them and roll me a DV-17. Ah, can I, can I use luck? You... Yes, you will use, need to use two luck to beat the 17. Gotcha. Can I give him a complimentary roll as a former Militech employee? You are also a former Militech? Yep, uh, served uh, in doing uh, surgeries for them during the war. Give me an, uh, an, an, uh, a persuasion check. For you, it's a lower DV. Yeah, okay. Um, 
Yeah, so you so you only need to spend one luck dice to, to beat it. Okay, I will spend that luck. And he's like, yeah, sure. Um, I will bring you along. Uh, we, we Militech have to stick together, right? Make <laughs> sure those uh, Arasaka bastards don't uh, join our, uh, come back to our soil again. And um, uh, that presentation will be would be around uh, 11 p.m. in the evening. Do they know about my ex-girlfriend? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. They're Militech. They don't all know each other. <laughs> no, Why, do you know Bill? <laughs> Envy's ex-girlfriend currently works for Arasaka. No, I don't know. That's, uh, I, yeah, that's whatever. So it's 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 slowly starting to become busier and busier. Uh, more people um, uh, are on the floor. What you do notice that uh, the the normal um, the vendor floor, where where all the people with the standard tickets could come, it's getting packed. It's 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 like 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 an, an ant colony down there. If you if you look from from from. Uh, one of the balconies where, where you guys can be. It's like you guys can just relax and have all the room and walk room, but in that place it's completely packed. It's like if you were to walk through there, it, it would take you quite a while to, to maneuver yourself through through that. Uh, Are there only any back ways that, that you go via the, the VIP area to other places on the completion floor? Yes, they are actually. They are even uh, specially designated for the VIP per people where they are even uh, they, they are sent to your agents where you can ask them to, to for, for a background and then the agent will help you through the building so that you can uh, go through those uh, back rooms. So I have a, I have a question. Uh, I haven't really done anything since we got in the building. Um, on my way up to my room, I'm gonna drop my stuff off. Uh, mm -hmm. Knowing what I know, I wanna look for watchdogs activity, seeing Aurobindo on the itinerary, like, I'm on the hunt right now. <laughs> I, I, I send a text to my boys who are down there, like, um, um, uh, stay on your toes. Um, it could get interesting in here. Uh, and then, um, <laughs> uh, like the letter R, the letter O, bindo, <laughs> uh, itch in building. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Yeah. Do you want uh, want to have them uh, uh, do an uh, a, a check uh, on the floor, where where if they can see something? Um, sure. Uh, if if that's a if that's a thing I can do. Um, I, you I can ask people, them uh, if they uh, definitely posted. Uh, so they don't have uh, traditional stats, but they have like the little combat roll there. Yeah, the that's that's is that fourteen. That, there we go. I oh I need to. Get, get their tokens out, of course. There we go. Uh, there we go, and then we go like this. There we go. Uh, so, so they are walking about the the floor for you, and and they are like like uh, yeah, boss. We do see a corner where uh, where they are at. Uh, should we go at, get get at them? <laughs> Not yet. <laughs> Stand by. <laughs> Sure thing, boss. And they uh, they they keep walking about. Uh, they will stay around that area a little bit. Yeah, I I, I kind of want them to keep tabs on what's going on. Uh, I'm trying to find if I can at some point which room she's staying in. Mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. and <laughs> going so, going full circle with uh, what we've uh, what we've established with so, the breaking into that little girl's room and scaring her. <laughs> <laughs> so the payoff is going to be breaking into this girl's room <laughs> and potentially killing her. <laughs> so yeah, you can do that. So so you can uh, so you can try and, and and go through all the floors and walk through the to, through the hotel uh, part, and then you can give me perception. Uh, there's also in the lobby of the hotel part there is an. an What's again? How, how's that person called again? It's, it's a special name. Concierge. The concierge is there. A few of them even. 
Yeah, so. absolutely. So um, on my way down to the floor, yeah, I'm going to take my time. Uh, I'm going to check things out. Uh, so you said left tower, right? Yes. We're in left tower, so that implies at least a right tower, correct? Yes, they are. There are two towers which which uh, consist of the entire hotel. And, and on... The fourth floor, and on uh, yeah, on the fourth floor, there are two uh, uh, sky bridges, as as you can call them, and they are like uh, 50 meters apart or something like that. It, it, you you could actually do like you, you walk like in an, in in a sort of an, an, an um, uh, not a square but an triangle. No. But, uh, a but rectangle? Yeah, right, rectangle. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, it, it's because it's it, it has two uh, longer uh, ones. Yeah. Okay, um, so, how, so... Hold on, how far away is right tower? It's uh, the right tower. tower. It's, it's about 30 meters. <laughs> That's how large the sky bridges are. So just just to double check here, the towers have staircases and elevators. Yes, they do. Okay, that's all. But then the, then a sky bridge over to the other one in case we need to. So Ooh, I, I guess there are two. Uh, I, yeah, yeah. Sorry, yeah, two yeah. sky bridges on the fourth floor. Yeah. Um, uh, what's the situation? Can I see uh, across, like from my window, into the other building? Uh, definitely, yes, you can. It's it's a little bit difficult to see, of course, because it's 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 thirty meters away. So so uh, unless you have some kind of tele optics or micro optics where you where your eyes are a little bit better, then uh, then you can see a little bit more detail. But you can see people on the other side. Yes. What is the floor uh, I, of the walkway made up? So uh, I, the, I, the we're, we're we're not there yet. Can I? Uh, I, I just want to scout real quick. You, uh, no, you I just want to ask if it's glass or clear. Uh, the sides are, so you can look outside. Okay. So the floor is not, that's all. And Red Boy, yes, go ahead. Uh, all right, so what I want to do is I want to scan the windows in the side of the building, and I want to see if I can see watchdogs over there. Um, Roll me a percentage. And, check. like, in, in a perfect world, if I see Ms. Zhang... I, I know exactly what I want to get out of this session. <laughs> mm -hmm. Roll me a perception check first. Let's see how, wh wh Let's how much you how much you see. Yeah, only an eleven. So uh, I was like like if it's just, so I would want to have to beat a, a DV thirteen to see at least things that you that that are interesting for you. Um, Although, hold on. You can succeed, but you will have a consequence to it. Succeed with a consequence. Um, yeah, dude, it's more narratively interesting for me to see something. Okay, so you look, so, so you walk about, you 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 go slowly, you you look at the other side, and what you do, know, do notice is that there are um, indeed watchdog security are a little bit more present in the other building. Uh. What you do notice is they also notice you and they point uh, at you. Awesome. Uh, I'm going to wave with my little, uh, like with my fingers, like a little finger wave. <laughs> like, hello there. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you you see them uh, like like converse a little bit and then they you see you you see them move out uh, basically or or move to a certain direction but at a certain point you lose sight of them. Uh, what floor were they on? They were on the sixth floor. Okay. Six. Perfect. This, this is uh, this is dope. So, um, I'm gonna text. I'm gonna text. Somebody's got to know what I'm doing. Um, I would text Indari. Uh, she was there for sure. She knows that these horrible behind home motherfuckers uh, are gonna deserve every bad thing that comes to them. I'm gonna text Bombshell, uh, and I'm gonna say. Um, Bindo, R.O. Bindo, that's how he types it, uh, is here. 
bitch is in the building going to Bright Tower to find an audience. <laughs> uh, and so they saw me at the sixth floor. Um, I saw them. So I like presumably I'm also at the sixth floor when this happens. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna open a window. Uh, these windows cannot be opened to the outside in uh, the hall base. I'll, I'll, I'll find a way if I have to. <laughs> <laughs> um, you want to break a window? The, it's like 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 in those um, uh, hotels where you have those windows from outside that the, that the entire wall is a window. Hmm. Yeah. Um, and, and and that's the, the, those are hallways guess, on the outside yeah, where you I can guess see. I guess I don't want to. Yeah. I guess I don't want to do it in the hallway. Um, fuck it. I'm going back up to my room. <laughs> yeah, sure. That's where I'll do it. Yeah. What time is it? Uh, it's now slowly getting around 7 p.m. So uh, Nadari and I went to the 5 p.m. talk. Oh, sorry, the 5 p.m. talk. Sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. So yeah, so it's it's slowly getting to 5 p.m. My apologies. Yes. <laughs> okay. Oh. So after we yeah, with that, that's, that's what I'm doing here. The message. Point. So, uh, Nadari, do you tell me what, uh, anything that, about what, uh, what Red Boy sent you? Yes, but I will, uh, send to Red Boy, do you need any help? Okay, so I'm still in the dark. <laughs> yes. Um, and, uh, I, I, I would definitely, uh, like, like, as this is going on, uh, do you need any help? Um, I, I would say come join the party. <laughs> <laughs> that's yeah, that's what I would say. <laughs> He's not gonna say he needs help, but he will say like, "Let's fucking do this." <laughs> Out, outside the um, outside the, I guess like the 5 p.m. presentation. I'm not gonna go in, but I'm gonna be like kind of outside of it, and I'm just gonna lean up against the wall and put on my um, infrared goggles or infrared smart glasses. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. And, oh, I'm sorry, Red Boy, are you done? Uh, yeah, that, that's the only scene I wanted was, uh, like, something pursuant to something that I'm probably going to try to do later. So, yeah, I'm good. Okay. So, uh, so yeah, yeah, uh, yo, uh, yeah, I, I just wanted to show you the, the hallways where you walk through when you go uh, from, from one side to the other side in the... Uh, and uh, where you can uh, walk without any problems. You, you do notice that sometimes you see if, uh, other executives with, with their family or, or an, another woman besides them or, or uh, executive ladies. It, it, I mean, it's, it's all kind of, of, of uh, high society uh, people. And this place is awesome. At, at a certain <laughs> point, it becomes 5 p.m. And I think Stitches and... Nadari, we're going to the presentation of, yeah, of, of, that's of correct. marketing. Yeah. And oh, uh, if there's a presentation, Envy wants to go too. Sure, you can go in. Yeah, no problem. As you can see, I uh, there is quite a bit of room. And uh, during this presentation, you will hear... Is it uh, just me or is there a bar over there on the right? There is also a bar, yes. Envy is there. I will take a seat at one of the tables. I am not going to fill it all in with 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 uh, tokens no, I'm just because I feel it. it's a little bit too much then uh, because it's <laughs> but, but what you can see is that it it's it's packed it's it's busy uh, all, a lot of, of of you see executives uh, uh, making all kinds of deals which you can hear on the background talking uh, speculation on what uh, uh, Rockling is going to show uh, uh, here and. Um, uh, so, at a point, pres presenter comes up, is like, ah, welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to uh, our Rockling Alc Alcomantics. Uh... Um, one question for you, uh, Ronan, is, can I, uh, can I use uh, one point of luck to be flashing back to just before the 5 p.m. I want to 
try to make friends with the bar staff around the entire thing. Sure. Give me a per- persuasion check. Persuasion? Hell yeah. That is going to be a plus 10. Well, oh. no, they hate me. <laughs> no, envy. You may succeed with that a That is a maximum fumble. All right. With a consequence, you say? Mm-hmm. I will take that consequence. Wonderful. Okay. So, yeah, they are friendly towards you. They are, they are nice and they, you, they chat you up and such. Like, hey, yeah, the, the fun. And... Uh, uh, they 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 seem to enjoy your presence. Yeah. And um, so, Rockling uh, Augmentics show off their their new cyber chairs, uh, and and they sh- basically what well, what they show is they show the the, the 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 old chair which is slow and sluggish, and then they present a version uh, a version two point one uh, six uh, to which is uh, even a little bit faster, and they show off that it walks uh, just a tiny bit faster, and it's a uh, more accurate than than the, their predecessor. Um, uh, uh, which they happily present. Uh, it's 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 like uh, give me concentration checks, all three of you. All right. Hang on. Well, that's. Oh. Envy. Yeah. No. I'm gonna. I'm. I'm losing. I'm losing the track. Right. <laughs> no. So what what well, what happens is that uh, Effie, you you kind of of of, of uh, doze off doze off a little bit like like th- this presentation is so boring so business like and and and, and corporate like that you're like oh, this is so boring nothing interesting is happening here why can't there be something interesting please and, yeah and- <laughs> I'm not that worried about it I'm. I am honestly here for two reasons, to be seen and also to uh, make friends with the staff because I think they're going to be the ones that know the, that know the most. And uh, Nadari and uh, uh, Stitches, uh, what you two see, no, notice is that at the end of the presentation, which was boring as hell, yeah, you notice right. that they, they have a kind of like, a, yes, and come to our presentation at 10 p.m. We will have something to show for you. And they show a little teaser movie where where there's an all new kind of, of, of chair with, with flashlights and then uh, with, 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 with flashes of light and, 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 and snippets of the new chair. And um, uh, both of you give me a cyber tech roll. <laughs> You're asking the most least tacky person in this room. <laughs> I have a four, basic. I'm going to roll for you. <laughs> uh, Stitches, you noticed that this might be the chair which uh, uh, which you guys are after. Okay. And... Uh, at the end of the presentation, go like, uh, yes, uh, ladies and gentlemen, enjoy something of the food, our drinks, and uh, uh, if you are interested in more information, you can uh, find us here at this uh, stall here, and they have an entire, uh, in the front, they have an entire stall with the pers- uh, personnel, um, uh, writing things down, uh, talking to, uh, to the visitors. Okay, okay. So I ask Stitches. So they are probably only going to tell at 10 p.m. about that amazing chair that we're looking for. Indeed. This presentation was really boring. <laughs> As a. As the presentation is going on, um, yes. Dice would like to be like outside. Mm-hmm. Uh, he's gonna have his smart glasses on with the infrared, and he's gonna yes. kick a trash can over, and then apologize, and then like just sit there, watch the area, and see like who, like if anybody comes or any drones come to clean it up. Ah, 
<laughs> Give me a perception check, yeah. Okay. Yeah, what you notice is that, uh, like, maybe three minutes later, after you, you trash that place, you see, like, uh, from from some kind of, of uh, back door uh, of an em or an employee door, you see uh, three people walk out very quickly, uh, clean it entirely up, uh, set it up uh, completely, and then they are, like, like, within two minutes later, they are back into the employee uh, door, and uh, it's as if nothing ever uh, uh, if, if, if nothing ever happened jesus christ talk about on call um can i tap one of them on the shoulder like sure before they, before you can they, do that before they go, go all the way back in there you this person while while they're cleaning you tap them on the shoulder sure uh, he scared he, this person scares shit uh, it's like uh, so, sorry sir that you were uh, you had to see this uh, we will be uh, gone very soon uh, uh, give us a few uh, seconds it's an interesting suit you got on there show me uh, these are just our normal overalls, uh, sir, from our company. It's uh, uh, the 100% uh, cleaning company, as you can see. Uh, we we will get it clean, or you get your money back. Uh, okay, so I so like I dip the glasses down to make mm -hmm. sure that I can actually see them in real life too. Am mm -hmm. I able? Am I able to? Yes, you are. All right. It was like. Then I'm just like, okay, I'm sorry. Um, I'm sorry about that. I accidentally tripped and then just let him go. Uh, that's uh, no worries, uh, sir. That's why we are hired uh, by uh, by the exposition. Uh, 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 we, we will be out of your sight uh, as soon as, uh, as possible. And uh, you want to do something else before they are gone? It's like... I just want to make sure that they're not invisible to like normal sight. Right? No, no, no. These are normal people, and uh, w what it seems like like these are even just like like your regular people that 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 you find on the street that like like your normal employees, like 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 low level cleaners, and and uh, and nobody else notices them. Or does everybody else? Know? Uh, what, indeed, what you do notice is that all of the other executives and high society members which walk by, they don't even look at these people as if they don't exist. Then I, I asked them, like, how is it that they're not able to see you? Uh, 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 sir, um, uh, uh, I... We are just uh, lowly people. Uh, we, we are not worth even to be seen. Uh, uh, we have to do our work quickly and efficiently. Um, even talking to you right now is a, a, a breach of contract. And uh, I, I, if, if they find out, I might be fired. All right, I slip them, I slip them uh, 50 eddies and say thank you for your time. Uh, thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Uh, and uh, he runs off after his uh, two colleagues are waiting at the door, like, like come on, Jonas, come on. We need to get out of here. Gotcha. It's his favorite song, My Name is Jonas. Is it, are they like super fast or something? <laughs> or, uh, uh, like, is, what you, other, other than like other people can't see them. Like, what you any? do notice is that they uh, they do have quick reflexes and they they move quite fast yes as if as if they uh, were chosen to be um, that they, they are um, their physique is 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 such that they are quite athletic and 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 can move quickly gotcha all right that's all I, that's all I wanted to do and then I guess like at 6 p.m I'll head to the Raven cybernetic neural link thingy yeah. So, uh, the presentation. Uh, so, 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 at six, at six p.m., uh, dice goes to the Raven uh, Micronetics uh, presentation. Uh, I'll also go. And stitches will also go. And yeah. what will the other people do in the meantime? Just, just so I know what what you kind of want to do. Hmm. Uh, 
That's a good one. <laughs> I have no clue. Probably made up with envy or something. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yay! <laughs> so, uh... How are you uh, doing? <laughs> oh, friends? man. Um... So, okay, so, Ronan, you have, you have not yet told me what punishment is, and I need to know if it's going to be something that's phasing me right now. Like, have I gotten pissed drunk or something? No. No? No. All right. Have, have I tipped out the ass? No. Okay. Ah, you're going to make this really hit me when it happens. Damn. Don't worry. <laughs> All right. So, oh, sorry. I, this is a Ronin gig. Always worry. <laughs> I'm very worried. So, so the Raven micro uh, 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 micro netics uh, micro cybernetics uh, gig happens, um, and uh, they show off pretty cool stuff. What they do show off is is like like the the, the, the new neural link which they're showing off. They seem to have been able to. Um, uh, enhance it uh, to make it smaller and less intrusive into the body, uh, which seems to be really cool. The, the only problem is is that it is uh, that this uh, uh, was so expensive that it almost doubles the price of of, of, of the current neural links which are the present. The thousand. Hmm? So it's a thousand. Because mm -hmm. a basic neural link is five hundred. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Alright. So I'm gonna use my VIP to go to the back and get a closer look at these things. Oh, yeah, you can. You have an, uh, at the end of the presentation, an employee goes like, yes, oh, hey, welcome, uh, mister. Uh, you want to uh, uh, see our new wares? Uh, our pride uh, is this uh, newest neural link. It will make, we will make sure that it takes, uh, it, it will even be way easier into your body than anything else currently on the market. Uh, and you won't feel a thing. It is like, like is, is it, if it is just a part of your own. Ooh, how many do you have uh, in production? Or how many do you have... Uh, yeah, how many uh, do you have uh, made so far? Oh, oh, we only just have a, a few made so far, of course. Uh, we are not uh, completely fully in, in, in production. Uh, uh, just to, uh, th th there are still, still some things which, uh, which need to be tested uh, to make sure that, uh, that there are no uh, bugs and so, uh, you, you, know, the, you know the deal and such. Uh, but uh, th these ones here are already uh, fully tested and, uh, and working. Uh, uh, unfortunately, due to the supply, we can only currently sell uh, one per, per per customer, sir. How many do I see there? You see uh, about a dozen or so on uh, on the stands. How how big are they? Like I have no no idea how big a neural link would be, but I would presume that it can fit in 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 a carry all. I mean, like the, the Elon Musk neuraling things are like the size of a coin. Yeah, so it's not that big. Okay, um, using... With my perception roll, can I see like what kind of security they got around it or like around them and stuff? Oh, you don't have to roll... Uh, 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 you don't have to roll for that. You do notice that there are uh, uh, two drones of lesser, of, of Severa are, are flying over the... the, the, the stand and if and a few security guards on both sides uh which are standing there uh, earlier when i got to the hotel and stuff uh when i was looking stuff over did i ever find out if they have like a storeroom for each uh company that's there can you, can you repeat the question i didn't hear it properly um for each of the companies that are there uh displaying their wares are there any storerooms off the floor that they're using uh, for cybernetics, this room is their also their store, their their store basically, because they, this is their own private presentation uh, room. This is a different room than the one with Rocklin. Uh, only I joined in the change to the picture. Okay. <laughs> During the itinerary, did it say what time they were going to shut down the floor? 
yes, it, uh, the, the, uh, the last presentation will be at 11 p.m., which, uh, which will be uh, the one from Ar Arabino Pharma. Uh, I think that was... That was no, it wasn't Arabino the same time as the... Um, Sorry, yeah, that was... Rockland. Yeah, 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 as Rockland. At 10, the last at 10, one's like yeah. Militech. Yeah, the last one will be Militech, yeah, at 11. And after that, uh, it's, uh, the exposition halls will be closed. Uh, all the people will be requested to uh, leave the exposition uh, uh, floors themselves. Uh, of course, they, 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 the, the hotel floors are still available, all the rooms are available, uh, and you can easily walk in and out of the, of the hotel and to the parking lot and such. All right, cool. Thank you. <laughs> uh, you're welcome, uh, sir. Uh, do you want to buy anything uh, from us? Uh... Uh, I want to. I want to walk around and see more stalls to see who I'd want to do business with. Can I get your card? Uh, yeah, definitely. And uh, you will receive an 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 an. an, uh, an uh, a basic uh, card uh, with the contact information of a Raven uh, Micro Cybernetics. Gotcha. Uh, what is his name? Uh, his name is. Uh, I will give you. Uh, I will type it because I have a very difficult time typing it. Gotcha. <laughs> uh, Bartholomew Kersey. Bartholomew Kersey. Okay. Bart. Um, okay. As like as I like go to shake his hand and take the card, I want to bump into him awkwardly because like mm -hmm. I tripped on something, and mm -hmm. try to take his key card. And give me a pickpocket. Gotcha. Ah, oh, This is gonna be ah oh, lad. Okay, so you can succeed with a consequence, or you are unable to do so. Um, I, I want to unable to do so, but like, uh, if it falls to the ground, I want to get a good look at it. <laughs> you know what I mean? No, 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 no. Uh, you, you, uh, in that case, you will be unable to do so. So you won't be able to find his guard. Oh, okay. Then I'll be like, oh, I'm sorry. Excuse me. I had yeah, a few yeah, too many drinks. No, no worries. No worries. Uh, it's, it's okay. And uh, have a nice day, sir. You too. <laughs> And uh, the presentation ends, and uh, it, it was a cool presentation, and um, uh, this was the one at 10 p.m., and I think also, no, nine. Seven. Seven, sorry. I, I keep remembering <laughs> <them> correctly. <laughs> I, I, I retracted in a hurry down and you started talking about him. Yeah. <sighs> So I'm I'm with Envy at the bar. She introduced me yes. to the bar staff. Um, but I will whisper to Envy. So, how uh, do you have any plans to do this? Because this place is so highly like secured. And yeah. So like basically, um. I'm going to check over my shoulder real quick. Can anybody, uh, like, does is the bar staff paying attention to me? No, they are not. They are they have been busy with all other uh, visitors that uh, come up for food all right, and things cool. and such. And I am going to whisper, uh, whisper to Bombshell. I'm thinking, you know, that these guys might know everything. They might get us into the places that not even we're supposed to, like the employee areas. Maybe we'll get a... Maybe we'll have a chance to... just pick it up and walk away. Hmm. And, you know, besides that, if that doesn't work out, then I've still made some friends. 
And like, honestly, I could be using some more friends. I've just got you and my mom right now. And like, I work with Dice and I work with Barbazoo, but like, come on. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <gasps> You, By the you, way, out of character, uh, Envy doesn't think of Dice as not friendly or not worthy of being friends. He just, she just doesn't think that Dice would consider her a friend. No, no, no worries. It's a, it's all right. Like, um, Dice, Dice doesn't really get close to anybody. He, he's more like a, a surface level acquaintance to most people. I mean, he's yeah. not like a dick or anything, but like to most people, he's like a, a work friend. You know, that's like, kind of like what it's not a terrible like how, way to live the edge runner life. <laughs> yeah. Quite normal. No, Envy expects that and she doesn't hold it against him. <laughs> but if you wanted to be friends, she would. Dice is flattered about that. <laughs> we might need to meet up with the rest of, uh, of our guys. I'm wondering what they're doing. All right. <laughs> Here's something else that I want to do. Um, it, while I am in the bar, um, I want to see if I can arrange a party with the other uh, bar hoppers. Uh... Uh, but there are, there is, there, there's, there are already is going to be a party later tonight after the the. Oh no! An after party okay. where things get super turned. <laughs> <laughs> it will be in the in the in in one of the 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 the, the bigger um, um, rooms of the hotel. Nice. It should be fun. You should join it's us. This is just going to send a, uh, a group text Absolutely. just to check how everybody's doing. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. So. I want to be in that party. So Stitches sends you all the texts and, and uh, Red Boy. I'm listening, GM. What's up? Yeah. So so Stitches sent you a text uh, like, hey, guy, how is everybody doing? All right. So we're at like 7 p.m. right now, right? Correct. Yes. Three hours before the uh, the expos that uh, I care about, <laughs> so mm-hmm. I want to see if uh, during all this time while they're kind of like wandering around doing their thing, um, I want to see if my red boys can kind of get information from the concierge about the Orbindo suite or something like that, and I would, I would also like to see if I can find a. A not a, a more subtle way to uh, get outside the building somehow. Um, uh, not not like out through the lobby on street level. But yeah, like yeah. If I if, if I know that those dudes saw me, uh, I'm looking to like spider do some Spider Man action. Oh yeah. So uh, y- y- your room, uh, all of your rooms, uh, all have a balcony, which. Uh, nice. Uh, which uh, which goes like 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 a little bit of a stairs. So you so if you uh, would walk out and you would look up, you would see another balcony uh, 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 above you, but with with a little bit of room, like like as if if the sky is right above you. Um, okay, cool. Uh, so they they kind of like hang out a little bit from the building. Yes, um, they do indeed. And it's it, it, it has is a, there like. Yeah, is there a particular amount that it hangs out? Uh, not that much. I would say almost it's 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 for it's it's it would be for you with your jumping abilities. It would be like 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 jumping stairs up and down. Okay. Up um, and then it would stop at the fifth no at the fourth uh, at the fifth floor. It would stop. And then it would just be all uh, windows, like 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 a clean thing. And you would have to do some climbing to go to to to. Uh, well, basically with your feet, you you could just uh, like like uh, go like a bat, then and then walk underneath, and then walk down the the 
uh, stuff. Uh, if you would go all the way up, you could go all the way up to uh, the eighth floor, and uh, up to there it would stop because then at some point you have to go further up. There will be all kinds of penthouses up to the tenth, uh, up until the tenth floor. So eighth, ninth, right. and tenth floor are penthouse floors. Awesome. Ronan, I want. I, I I I just I just want to know how hilarious this is that. Pockets is just like, yeah, I want Red Boy to do rad shit, and you, knowing full well that this man has the body to do it, are just like, yeah, you can. <laughs> yeah, I personally appreciate that as well. Uh, it, it, it definitely makes me feel like, ah, um, uh, yes, uh, I, 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 I have, like, I, I am doing what I set out to do with Red Boy, so I appreciate you giving me the hookup. Um, I hope I'm giving everybody the chance to do what they are good at, so... Yeah, yeah definitely. Um, so, I'm, I, I want to wait around just a little bit, because I knew uh, that maybe uh, an hour or two ago, uh, Watch Dogs mobilized. <laughs> they, they saw me, and they're like, oh, what the fuck? And, you know, um, uh, I, I'm assuming that they're coming across the Sky Bridge to see if they can find me, which is why I changed floors. I moved to a different place. Mm -hmm. um, and I want to see if my red boys can give me any information whatsoever. Sneak a look, ask some questions about. Um, uh, I'm, I want to. Or bind those sweet like. Yes, yeah, sure. So I want I want to roll from you in that case whether your boys are able to find something of that. Uh, what would I? Uh, hmm. What would be a good role? Um, I think your red boys would be more into the interrogation, right? Or well, not? Yeah, I'm, I'm fine with that. Yeah. Uh, just asking, uh, because you, you tell me what how your red boys would, would, would act or how they would find that information. Uh, so that uh, I... Basically, the way I see them in my head is there, um, he surrounds himself with violent sycophants, right? Mm -hmm. so, ah, exactly who I was thinking. <laughs> yeah, so what I want to do is uh, I want to persuade them, like, um, uh, uh, the, the blood rainbow is coming, boys. Just listen to me. We'll get through this and we'll get to where we need to get. So uh, I'm cool with persuasion. Uh, or yeah, sure. Or Go ahead. Do that. Oh, definitely, yeah. He's so, a fairly persuasive boy. Yeah, they, they, they it's, it's, it's like oh, they, they almost got kicked out because of, of how insistent they were. Uh, but they, uh, luckily, they, they managed to uh, sneak back in later on. Um, uh, but they managed to get you the information. It's like, hey, boss, boss, uh, we found uh, we found where they are staying. It's uh, in the in the other building. They are on the ninth floor in the penthouse. Uh, I, I, I would not suggest uh, they, they, they they have some heavy security there. We saw some uh, some new uh, new vans uh, come in from Watch Dogs. Uh, yep, yeah, uh, I'll. I'll send him the little uh, little text back um, uh, find your way to the right tower play it cool don't do anything silly that's my job yes sir and uh, they will do their thing the blood <laughs> rainbow is coming <laughs> my, uh, so for reference my first red boys ever were a knockoff trauma team and they had a meat wagon which is basically just a wood chipper that they would put parts in uh, and scrap the cyberware from people that they couldn't save. Um, and at the end of that, how I baptized them both is we stood in front of it and passed in it after our victory. It was pretty messed up. That was um, pretty, that sounds very metal. Uh, but anyway, I digress. So knowing that they're on the ninth floor and knowing that the balconies stop uh, at the fifth floor, right? Seventh. Seventh floor. Oh, even better. Yeah. They stop um, at seventh floor, and then eight, nine, ten floors are the uh, the the suites, basically the 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 the, the big ones where there's maybe like maybe two suites on each floor, basically maybe. Okay. Uh, so in the right tower, I'm in the left tower. Uh, I'm I'm waiting to like uh, 
the sun has probably gone down at this point. Uh, yeah. Yes. Somewhere. Yes. Yes. The smoke is down. Uh, lights are are coming up. It's like like the entire building lights up in the in the evening sky. It's uh, uh, lights from everywhere are are, are are moving about, and it's, it's, uh, you you hear some music, different kinds of music from different kinds of places. If you would be outside, uh, you see people partying outside in, in the parks, uh, drinking, uh, talking loudly. Uh, you see even uh, 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 two idiot uh, boys uh, walk on the outside or on 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 the um, uh, on the uh, roof of one of those uh, skywalks. Oh, nice. That, that that was one of my ideas. Um, <laughs> you you so. see them there there they are laughing and making fun, and you see a few of their friends on the other side, uh, daring them to go on. But because of the winds, it's quite scary. And at a certain point, you notice that they they crawl back on hands and feet. <laughs> yeah, definitely. So I'm going to. Um, uh, did gonna... did Red Boy respond to Stitch's text? Uh, I, I don't know if I've gotten the text yet, but I will before you my did. You got you got it I, right I, after the uh, Rev and Micro Um uh, I, I think we're kind event. of doing like a, a concurrent time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. it's a concurrent yeah. thing at the moment. So, so this okay. while the cybernetics going, Red Boy is doing yeah. this. Okay. Um, like like Dice yeah. is doing his thing. Right. So I, I wanna uh, I wanna find a a room opposite me in the tower with the lights off, mm -hmm. uh, and then I'm going to use my fucking jump boosted cyber legs to from my balcony sprint and over to the other tower. Sure, give me an athletics roll. It's quite um, a long so jump. With my jump boost, uh, and if, if I got you into a, a trap here and you still want the athletics roll for sure, with my jump boost, I can jump uh, with like a full dash 32 meters. Um, and then I would and still need an athletics roll because yeah, the, given the, that these, both towers are thirty meters away, I should be able. To uh, the no, no, the 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 walkways are thirty meters away from each other. Uh, okay, so that's that, that's my uh, discrepancy then, because when I asked how far. Oh yeah, sorry. No, they said that they were 30, okay, the, so, the, the walkways were thirty meters long. Oh, my apologies. Record. No, they were fifty okay, meters okay. apart. Oh, apologies. Okay, so yes, no, 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 no. And uh, then, uh, uh, yeah, sorry. They, they are 50 meters apart and they're 30 meters long. Correct. Yes. Okay. So uh, yeah. Well, uh, yeah, yeah. So I'm, I'm just trying to get a clear. Uh, no, no, sense no, no, of no. What's it's, going it's, on. it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Thank you for because uh, sometimes I, uh, I I also make mistakes. I'm just a human being. Uh, but so so you can jump 32 meters theoretically. Yeah. Just theoretically. I, I, I mean, just just because of the jump boost. Uh, do give me an athletics or a roll. Uh, don't fumble. Uh, I don't have much of a choice, but okay. What do you Fire. <laughs> yeah, I mean, don't roll a one. That's basically what I mean. So, so that's 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 all. Uh, uh, yeah, you make it. I think that's fair. Um, so, 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 so uh, sometimes when I ask for roll and I say don't fumble, uh, it it. As long as you don't roll a red number, nothing is no, nothing nothing happens. The only thing which which will happen then is that I would most likely give you a consequence on it because it's a 100% success. But because I still want to juice it up sometimes, maybe because in my own mind I know what kind of things happen. That's why I asked the roll, just so an explanation for it. Yeah, no, no worries, no worries. I'm happy to do it. Athletics is one of the things I'm good at. So um, yeah, you jump easily. That's why I play you, him so physically. So so, so you, you jump and you're on the other side of uh, of the balcony of the other building. Yeah, this so man I would is like crazy. to. Yeah, so I would like to now uh, go through this stranger's room, uh, presumably empty. All the lights are off. Um, uh, yes, maybe not, but presumably. Um, and I would like to be in the right tower without having gone through the lobby of the right tower mm -hmm, or mm -hmm. across the sky bridge. Yep. Um, so if so, if they're posted up looking for me, mm -hmm. it's not going to be at one of those checkpoints. Give give me a perception check. Uh, sure. Oh, my boy. <laughs> so so you jumped to the other side. And you you looked behind you like 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 uh, 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 being impressed about your own jump and how how gracefully you managed to do this. Uh, what you do notice is that that uh, uh, that in one of the sky bridges you do see some watchdog personnel walking across to to 
the other building to the building where you jumped from and then they will leave they will leave your side they are inside the building uh, in the left building uh, yeah uh oh okay gotcha um so i'm going They're to like, uh, like three th three of them all right perfect so I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and text that information to the red boys i'll text that information to bombshell and then i'll get the text from stitch asking what was what were you asking i was just checking in with people okay Let's see if you're um, okay yeah, but then I'll, I'll, I'll type back and see. Now that I know if I'm okay or not, I can respond to that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, then then he would say, um, uh, doing great. Uh, the the air is lovely tonight. <laughs> and, uh, that's, that's my response there. Uh, and basically what I want to do is I want to hunker down um, in mm -hmm. the, the right tower. I know she's on the ninth floor. Mm -hmm. Uh, and I know she has a conference to announce at at ten. Mm -hmm. So I'm on recon duty now. Okay. So and that's all I wanted to do. So uh, do you want to find her before she go? Uh, be, uh, so do you want to see if you can find her before she uh, manages to go to the presentation room, which uh, which is uh, of course a few floors down. <laughs> Just, just so that I know what your plan is with your, uh, with your recon. Uh, all right. So my plan is when she goes down to the um, uh, full disclosure, when she goes down to give her a presentation, mm -hmm. um, uh, she will not be in her room. Correct. I am going to be waiting for her in her room when she returns. Check. Okay. Okay. Then just so that I have a picture of of, of what. Yeah. 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 That, I, I, I think. I think that's my point. intent. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Okay. So, uh, envy and bombshell. Yeah. Um. Uh, so shall we regroup with the other guys? See where they are. Um, yeah. Envy is going to be like within the building bar hopping like all fucking night, I promise. <laughs> like until party time and then it's after party time and she's going to make the most of this. So you're not going to be at the presentation at 10 p.m.? There's a presentation at 10 p.m.? Yes, it's yeah. the one that way they announced. Oh, you. I said that in character because Envy <laughs> wasn't there for was, wasn't awake for that. Yeah, yeah, so it was in the itinerary, <laughs> and they <laughs> announced the it in the in the meeting. <laughs> did you doze off, honey? I did. I I, I may have. Um, so I have been <laughs> drinking all night. <laughs> we need you sober, not drunk. <laughs> Ah, oh, come on! But like, it's, you can it's, drink it's... after the deal is made, and after when then when we we got our stuff, you can drink all the one uh, all the drinks you like. I will even if we are done with this whole thing and we're gone here, I'll even take you to a bar, no. and it's all on me. No, but <laughs> no, but you don't understand. All right, this is this is like, um, like okay, so like uh. <laughs> <laughs> this is in, this is again in character um uh so so like like um this is like my um my plan yeah please explain your plan while we were rocking to the guys i will send uh because we have a group chat i sent uh, to the guys so hi uh, we're doing fine because they just asked us about how we're doing, and um, we are uh, looking for you guys. Are you also going to the the presentation of 10 p.m.? I uh, I text back a simple yep. <laughs> so do I. All right. Yeah, I gotta go to the 10 p.m. presentation. But like the the party tonight, though, I, I'm like okay. Do you tell everybody so, about the party tonight? Yes. <laughs> it's Arrow. Who's not getting an invite? <laughs> <laughs> Everybody's going to party. But, yeah. So... I need you... I, I, need, 
I text Envy, even though she's drunk. I, I especially need you to text this guy to be there. And I send her Bartholium Kent Kersey's name. All right. Uh, at the party? Yeah, to invite him to the to the after party where everything's gonna get lit. All right, cool. Um, Envy's going to try very hard to find this person so that she can invite him. Um, but she is drunk, so you do have to make me take a check. <laughs> oh God. Right, can't can't I do anything to help her sober up for the moment? Can I, can I <laughs> trick, trick, trick her into going by promising debauchery and riches? Can I take She's bomb drunk and easily suggestible? <laughs> <laughs> so, so first, that would probably a, work on her while she, so, that would probably work on her while she was sober. To be so fair, envy. Roll me first a perception check. Whether you were able to see this person, find right. this person. Can I also okay. text Bombshell to like be like, hey, make so, sure she does it. <laughs> so what you so 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 at a certain point you 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 walk around together with Bombshell and you see this person which which dies described to you, but what you do see is that he is uh, in the arms of an other lady uh, and they're 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 basically talking a little bit, uh, 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 hugging each other. And uh, you do notice that a an, an smaller boy of like like maybe five years old runs up, and you and you can hear him like daddy daddy, and then um, he gets Aww. picked up by uh, by that uh, by uh, by Mr. Kersey. That's cute. So what you see what you what you've done here, Ronan, is you're trying to get it so that I won't come up to this guy and ask if he wants to go to an after party, but you see, I am a deviant. <laughs> mm -hmm. I'm just describing... I'm going to ask... All right, yeah. I'm just describing I'm the going... situation. What you do is, you, is yours. Right. I'm going to go up to this man mm -hmm. and, his, and I am going to address him and his wife, mm -hmm. and I am going to say... Hey, so like after the party, the par the the party at the first night, um, I'm thinking about throwing an after party, and I w wondering if me and like you know we you we got a couple of like cool like kind of people coming in, but like I was just wondering if you look like a, you look like you really bring a lot of class to the to the whole thing, and like you can show. A lot give of people me, that like. Give me a persuasion how check. How visibly oh, drunk pardon. is Envy? Give me a persuasion <laughs> check. Um, do I so do this want me to put luck into that? Uh, no, you fail either way. Okay. 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 So if you if you can manage to beat a um, uh, twenty one with your luck, then I will allow you to. Save it. Ah, uh, damn it. Uh, I've, I only got seven. <laughs> if I had two more. Oh, no. <laughs> so close. That's okay. Um, so this man is look. It, it looks at you and he's like, uh, sorry, uh, uh, miss who? Uh, my wife and uh, my son have uh, other um, plans uh, for I'm, tonight. Uh, uh, I'm, so I'm, I'm Hannah. Yeah, uh, yeah, Hannah. Uh, uh, we have other plans tonight, so uh, if you excuse us, uh, have a nice oh, day. Right, and, and, and I'm you... with the wife, and she's just like going this... on like she's like going on like this while walking away, and, <laughs> not uh, even worried about up. it. Mom Shell will apologize to the dude, like, sorry, she's a bit drunk. <laughs> you see him look, look dismissive, and is like, uh, and then walks away. <laughs> at, at this point, Stitches shows up and just kind of grabs Envy by the arm, just kind of look, look, let's, 
Uh, you, sh- you should get some, some coffee to freshen up. You're, uh, you need to be sharp for the presentation. You already slept through the last one. We cannot have that happen again. Last Simply one for this so one. boring. <laughs> <laughs> Give her some, okay. some orange um, juice as well. She needs the vitamin C, even if it's synthetic orange juice. <laughs> <laughs> Can I spend one luck to have uh, figured out that Envy was drunk and brought a very strong coffee with me? Sure. Yeah, I, 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 ba- I basically uh, waterboard Envy with this cup of coffee. <laughs> oh my god, are you trying to give me a heart attack? Uh, <laughs> give me resist drug and torture. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very bad at these rolls, too. <laughs> <laughs> that coffee hit you like a brick, and 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 the coffee Why? courses through your body. <laughs> <laughs> this your way. <laughs> I thought that you were a doctor. You know better than to give a drunk woman coffee. <laughs> That's actually very bad for their heart, but still. Are you okay, Stitches? This is not how I, is This is not your, not your normal f- way of work. Uh, <laughs> Stitches probably has off. zero empathy, so he doesn't even realize that what he's done yes. is going to be dangerous. <laughs> oh my god. Mm, okay, so, 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 out of character, um, st- uh, 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 how, much, um, uh, how much humanity has Stitches left? Seven. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Seven whole humanity. <laughs> He, he has zero empathy. Mm-hmm. At this point, um, Bombshell will take Stitches uh, for a moment alone to give Envy some some <laughs> some bre- breathe breathing, <laughs> <laughs> so she doesn't get more water poured in my coffee. Yeah, oh. and uh, I'll, she will uh, tell uh, Stitches about that uh, arrow binder that they are here, mm. and uh, that we need to be on our guard for them. Yes. Uh, I mean, we we could have uh, surmised that from the uh, uh, the watchdog's presence, but yes, uh, th- thanks for pointing it out. Um, so yeah, that. <laughs> so I look. Um, you know what, uh, Red Boy's up to? He was very cryptic with his messaging. I think he found his own thing to do. <laughs> Good grief. <laughs> I, I don't feel like I was any more cryptic than anyone else. <laughs> yeah. He was, he was, you're, you're the one I he haven't be, seen, though. <laughs> he will be fine. He's Red Boy. He can manage himself. So uh, we, shall we just keep on eyes on, 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 the, on what we need to do? Because yes. I do want to have my payout. <laughs> so so yes. that's... The, the, uh, so so it is a little bit it, it is still a little bit time before the 10 p.m. Uh, show so um, to to speed up a little bit of things I want uh, I want I want to hear your plans on how you guys think on getting this thing outside of the building and and how you are how you think you get uh, gonna gonna get it heist and if you guys want to still get more other stuff and how you think how you are able to do that so um dice i will start with you give me a little bit of an out of character thing what you what 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 is in your mind what you want to do all right in my mind uh we uh, basically um they had to bring the thing in a truck or something so we steal the truck steal the thing and drive away but i mm. do want those 12 uh I do want those 12 neural links from Raven Cybernetics for what they did to my family. So it sticks it to them and I make some money. Um, mm. Like, if all else fails, I'm just gonna, like... I don't know what Red Boy's up to. Does anybody other than um, Bombshell? 
no, currently not. Uh, so, uh, okay, so okay, then I know a little bit of what what what, what you have have in mind or what you what your ideas are. Mm-hmm. Uh, so um, envy, give me a little, uh, just a small right. idea of, of what you think, how you think would uh, okay. you, how you would succeed this mission. So my idea is um, first day, first night. And probably the second morning, Envy is going to be focusing on getting in with the party execs and the bar staff. If she can get in with the party execs, then she might be able to, first off, have have a really great time. Um, Second off, um, she might be able to convince somebody somehow or lift some sort of credential off of somebody to get her into the area where they're staging all of the uh, all of the stuff that they're showing. And yeah, so, so where they're there, where, where they store all the cyberware and such, which is then yes. at that moment behind lock and key, basically. Correct. Okay. Uh, Wait, Bob, um, uh, Bob, hmm? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, uh, GM. Uh, that's what I was asking earlier at Raven, and you're saying they're all at their own expo, at their own, um... Yes, so, so okay. indeed, the Raven Cy- Micro Cybernetics has their own room, gotcha. uh, where they do the presentation, indeed. Uh, after the presentation, uh, you see them uh, haul, haul away their stuff, the cyberware, and, and look at, uh, and, and, and basically, uh, that, that is when they start cleaning up. Uh, so, so after the uh, they uh, clean up, they they put all their stuff in the back room, basically backstage. Gotcha. There, there, there's a, a big storage area there where every company has like like maybe a, a locked room uh, with with also security uh, walking about where they store their merchandise. Okay, so yeah, that's what I was asking about earlier. Thank you. Yes. No, no problem. That's why I'm asking these questions at the moment, so that I can also provide information which I might have forgotten to provide with, with your questions. Uh, stitches. And he dropped off. <laughs> Oops. I hope, Heck. I hope it's not the same thing that happened before. <laughs> Neither do I. But bombshell. So, whoa, I heard the whole repo. Um, I want to post around the place that they put away those cyberware um, to see if, um, uh, like, like who is guarding it, uh, if they have a certain uh, time slots when they are switching up guards. Um, what kind of uh, uh, which room has is is having which um, company cyberware? So um, is it like labeled or could we see like uh, <coughs> people from? Uh, company X putting stuff in that uh, in a, in a certain room because you said that they have like their own rooms each to put it away. I built it myself. So uh, none of you were able to uh, enter that part of. The the, uh, the the exposition yet. So you do see that doors open, and if you take a little peek, you do see a backstage area, but you don't know exactly what is there precisely yet. So who, who is in which rooms? Oh, we uh, can't get in there? With not our... as far as that you know of, but uh, there, there are guards, security guards there. They switch every four hours. Mm-hmm. How do we know this? 
Uh, oh, so I asked people uh, in, in, in out of character what what uh, other uh, how each of you people thought yes, that. Yes, I, uh, I caught that. I, I only lost like the last couple of seconds. You lost my part. So um, a bombshell asked is like uh, if if there were any security uh, details that were switching, and I said yes, they are. Per four hours they switch, uh, and uh, there is a backstage where every company has their own office own room which is behind lock and key with uh with security locks uh but you uh, what kind of security locks you have no idea yet but they store their uh where the, where's there and there are and the and security does walk about there and there are cameras and such there because of course it needs to be protected this is so Kentucky plaza so and uh, st- stitches. Uh, so um, this this is an out of character question. And like 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 I, I yeah. ask everybody is like okay, give me your idea. How how would you think? How would your team be able to succeed? This this. I don't know so much about getting out, but I do know we can probably get in by asking to after the presentation, uh, get a private viewing of this thing. Mm-hmm. Because we know Raven Cyber, Micro Cyber let us into their backroom area. Mm-hmm. So there's no reason that uh, Rockland wouldn't let us into theirs. That's all I've got so far. Okay, yeah, so so convince Rockland uh, personnel to bring you in, in, in the backstage area where they yeah. store their, their all their stuff and that you get a private viewing of it so that you can see Millboard. Yeah, sure. Sounds sounds, uh, sounds sounds cool. Um, uh, well, Red Boy already told me what he wants to do. He he typed it to me while while he was uh, away. Right, Red Boy? Yeah, yeah, you, you know what I'm up to. Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, like this this lady, she she will have an audience with the Red Boy. Mm-hmm. We have unresolved business. <laughs> So that is currently uh, uh, okay. So uh, we will go back into the scene. Uh, let's take a little five minute uh, break so that you can get some drinks, get something to eat, get to the toilet, and then we will okay, get yeah. into the scene and uh, we will start from there. Right? Okay. Hell yeah. Sounds like fun. So then, then I'm going to do, do a little toilet break. <clears throat> My thought is more or less we can do the same thing that I'm doing with um, Oro Bindo here, Ms. Zhang, um, to potentially get access to that wheelchair as well. Yeah. Um, I honestly like the fact that we are covering many, uh, like, sort of facets of entry. Like, I'm very much going into, like, the social route, and uh, Dice seems to be trying to get his inside boys going. Uh, you seem to be doing a direct assault or something, something like that. <laughs> That's kind of his style. If, if I there think were that... like, if there were a red carpet affair where there were taking pictures of VIPs coming in, he definitely wouldn't have shied away from that shit. <laughs> He's a direct but, sort of guy. Yeah, uh, I think that with all the different plans that we have that each of us only needs ourselves for, that this is going to go right one way or another, even if several other things go wrong. That's why I was willing to take the uh, to take the the punishment in exchange for success. Yeah, because like, if my uh, sh- as, if if my right. shit does go bad, you know, it's gonna be fine. Uh, my thought is that, like, on the map that I'm building in my head, we have a lot of avenues covered, like, spatially speaking. So if they, if if things go into the right tower, uh, as far as I know, I'm in the right tower completely, like, blind. Like, like or rather, nobody knows that I'm in the right tower. So that's, that's, that's an overwhelming advantage. Um, uh, bombshell... Bombshell's got to get across somehow if she's going to cover that as well. But right now, so everyone's in the left. I'm in the right. That's at least a little bit of coverage over there. So we're depending on where uh, our payload ends up, um, we should be somewhat uh, on point. 
So yeah, you guys are, might be like making fun of Envy for being drunk right now, but it is tactical. She is, she, she, you guys are not here to make friends. Envy is because that's how she wins. <laughs> I uh, actually love how all of you uh, are uh, working together in your own way, where, where, where everybody indeed is, 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 is looking at, at a different angle, like, oh, oh, maybe I can do it from this angle. Oh, and the other one is doing it from this angle. Mm -hmm. uh, it, I feel personally like it, it feels like, like an, an, an Ocean's Eleven kind of thing, where everybody <laughs> is doing his thing to make it a, a, a combined success. You think we need one more? Yeah, you think I need one more. <laughs> I know that I do have two side goals for this job. And uh and and and, and um I know that there's a lot of narrative stuff going on, a lot of role playing and not that much of, of of dice rolling maybe or or, or, or skill rolling uh, and if, if if i ask for skill roll it's more for for kind of a narrative purpose uh but uh yeah uh, yeah oh cannot wait to hear what that punishment was because i have already volunteered to be drunk off my ass mm, that's what you did yeah, I know. <laughs> that's not my punishment. That's just Envy doing her thing. And, and and it's not a punishment. It's a consequence. So because of of, of your uh, so so basically uh, the, so a consequence is is so um, uh, the you 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 kind of fail, but you succeeded. But you succeeded with 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 something in the background happening without your character without Envy knowing. But you don't. All right. Know, but Envy doesn't know. It, it's like like he, he Envy is like like oh I had a lot of fun. All these people were talking to, and it's uh, uh, and and something in the background happened. Upon ah, that. so what you have the no consequences idea that I'm being played. Uh, that could be a possibility, yes. But you have no idea, as, as far as you know. You have a good time with 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 all the people. <laughs> All that I know is that the food and drinks are free, and I have nothing to offer. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Welcome to me at every wedding I've ever been to. <laughs> Sounds like a good thing to me. <laughs> Get drunk. Maybe maybe think about objecting just for the for for fun. Never actually pull the trigger. Uh, but to be to be completely uh, upfront with everybody, uh, Envy's two side objectives for this job are one to make friends in both high and low places. That's why she's trying to uh, chum up to the party execs and the bar staff. And the other thing is, if she can, she wants to try to get a camera drone so that she doesn't have to fucking buy one and then have a netrunner go in and. Uh, change the programming on the imp to consider her the owner. Mm -hmm. Since we're stealing stuff, why don't you just steal one? <laughs> no, like exactly. That is the plan, right? <laughs> I mean, I don't want to have to buy it. <laughs> if if we're being honest, Dice really doesn't care about the chair all that much. He wants those uh, those neural links because that's the bigger payout. But like, if push comes to shove, he'll just buy it. <laughs> This poor crippled kid. <laughs> it's Night City. It's Night City in the future. Everything's rough. <laughs> if Stitches knew about what was going on with the Aura Binder thing, I think he'd be interested in that. But since he doesn't, he is completely focused on getting the chair. So basically, everybody, everybody's thing kind of like meshes together. <laughs> but yeah, no, very legitimately, Envy is steaming like out of touch out of like like out of uh like her mind's not on the job that's right. kind of the point <laughs> so stop splashing fucking coffee in my face stitches 
So, um, uh, so uh, I will set up the scene, uh, and if I have it wrong with your character, please uh, correct me after I've set up the scene and end it all. So, from, from, so we get back into the scene, we see Dice doing his thing, trying to get into the, the see if he can get into the backstage to rob uh, Raven Micro Cybernetics from their special neural links. Um, uh, um, we see uh, Envy and uh, Bombshell getting ready for the presentation of Arrow Bindo, Farmer. Mm -hmm. And Stitches is and also present. And Stitches Before I go to the um, uh, Rock and Augmentics show, I'm going to get go up to my room, get my carry-all. Mm -hmm. I'm going to empty out everything except for my shotgun, okay. uh, my ammunition, mm -hmm. and the cryo pump. I'm going to sure. wrap the shotgun and the ammunition in the cryo pump, mm -hmm. and everything else is going to be um, just left scattered on my bed. And I'm going to take my carry all down with me. Yeah, worries. And Red Boy is uh, is hiding at the fifth floor in an. Oh, and I have my room. my med tech bag, but that's that's a separate like messenger bag that I have. Oh, what, what did you take down? Sorry. Uh, uh, and Red Boy is on the fifth floor in a dark room, waiting to enact his plan. Yeah, more or less. I'm, I'm trying to like uh, watch the elevators and mm -hmm. see when, uh, see when it goes from nine down to the bottom, mm -hmm. uh, down yep. to four or wherever the the, the room is. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm trying to choose my choose my time strategically. Uh, Red Boy's not a he's not a stupid man. Mm -hmm. uh, oh. He's just presumed to be stupid because he is huge. <laughs> Oh no! Yeah, that's something I'm starting to really get the get the get into my mind. This is very smart, big man. This is uh, Oleg from Saints Row Three. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Maybe. Or the heavy weapons guy from Team Fortress Two. So, uh, uh, so uh, to, to help you a little bit, um, uh, what you get, uh, what you also can do is, is like I said, every four hours, security changes in the backstage rooms. Uh, you can also try indeed persuade personnel to get an. an, 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 an we can combine the plan. We can get in and then try and leave the as the guards are changing. So yeah, so so anything it's 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 okay. Also with the truck, yeah. Uh, I mean, there is enough normal hotel personnel walking about. As dice find out, it's it it's only in the background. They 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 kind of like like they are in and out, mm -hmm. but they are there. So uh, so to help you, dice is also uh, has a way an 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 in in that way. So, exactly. just letting you all know. Oh, uh, Sesho, Red Boy asked you something, which uh, I uh, talked over. Uh, another thing for the uh, the GM. So the itinerary also tells you like which rooms the things are going to be held in, right? Yes, correct. All right. So um, the the wheelchair uh, like special VIP showing. Mm -hmm. um, uh, where is that going to be? That is on the four, first floor in the right building part, or at least in in the close to the right tower of of the of the entire building. Okay. And the arrow binder one is going to be uh, sorry, no, the rockling one on the left one, and the arrow binder one on the right side. So and they are they are about like maybe fifteen minutes walk from one from one uh, room to the other room on the first floor. Okay. Noted. Um, so what I want to do is I want uh, I want representatives at the Orbindo one, if I can. Um, uh, like, helmets off, you know, just kind of show up if it's not a VIP only thing. I want to see it the is, it is. Thing. This is a VIP, if you, the, the, these, 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 these oh, ones them are, are okay. VIP, VIP, VIP only ones, yes. So looking at the itinerary, then um, I kind of want to, and uh, this, this is just, we feel free to tell Red Boy no, um, mm -hmm. but uh, I want to sort of confer with Bombshell um, about like, hey, the Orobino one is in the opposite tower at the same time. Um, maybe we could get eyes on that too. 
you know, dot, dot, dot. <laughs> Can I get in contact with my um, with with the the people from my company? Sure. I want to ask them if they can keep an eye on on the other uh, presentation that's happening. Uh, which other one? The rock the one? one? No, the one from Aerobindo. Yeah, sure. Roll me a persuasion check. I'm not good the persuasion. They're like, ah, I don't know. Do we really have to? I mean, it's such a hassle. I mean, we, we have to, t- to already keep an eye on our own. Uh, uh, um, how, how are they called again? They, they have a special name in, in bodyguard duty. Principles? Uh, Principles, yes. We, the, thank you, Dice. We have our own principles to which, which we are to break. Eh? Do we really have to? <laughs> they, so, so they are quite reluctant. Hmm. So can I um, bribe them? Maybe. <laughs> I'm really, I'm really bad at bribery. It's a five. I know. Ah. <laughs> uh, Damn, uh, okay. I think I, even I, I'm that, better at bribery. Okay, so, so I, 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 maybe I'm getting a little yeah. bit confused. So we have the two presentations at, at 2 p.m. Uh, 10 p.m. 10 p.m., sorry, 10, 10 p.m. 20, yeah, 2200, that's what I wanted to say. Yeah. Uh, who is at the Rocklin, just for my... Uh, Envy is at the bar at the Rocklin. Okay, okay, this Envy is at Rocklin. Uh, Dice... I'm in the I'm in the back trying to uh, Check. get get those neural links. Stitches. Which one are you? Uh, I'm at the Rockland. Uh, yeah. Okay. But oh, I, yeah. I do have my my bag of tricks with me. Yes. Okay. Um. Are you at the Rockland or at the Arabino one? What I'm going to do is still. I'll be fine. You can leave me here by myself. I promise I'll be fine. You you have dice and a Stitch word. is watching over you. You're fine. Exactly. Um, I want to say that I'm... I'm hung over on someone's couch that you don't know. <laughs> <laughs> and Envy's going to be fine with that. Maybe it'll make her ex-girlfriend jealous. If oh, Envy God. doesn't blow her cover, she could just like she could just like leave the expo like normally. And, and I will go to the one from Arrow Bindo, but I'm going to be secretive about it. Yeah, Envy sure. is under the highest cover. <laughs> uh, how okay. are you being secretive? Not against you guys. I will say I will attend this other meeting because it's the same time and I'm really interested about what they're going to do now. She's being secretive because she doesn't have to change much to fit in. No, it's more that I don't want to be seen by any of them. <laughs> she's afraid to be recognized by the watchdogs. Uh, a bit, a bit. At, at least she's all done up, which is normally not. So she will, she will look very differently from what she's normally is. Yeah, like new wardrobe and style. And look at, look at the uh, bombshell babe uh, get up. Look. Give me a wardrobe and <laughs> style check. You get a plus two because you guys dressed up. So. Wardrobe and style. <laughs> yeah, oh. they they don't even they don't notice that that, that, that uh, your your bombshell that uh... looking very hot. <laughs> so yeah, <laughs> and I will go to the other meeting because Wonderful. I can't get okay. my people there. So so okay, so then I know <laughs> a little bit of the scenario. So um, uh, the Rocklin. Uh, starts uh, and the Arabindo starts. Uh, okay, so uh, Red Boy, y- at this point, I think you and Dice will be the first people that will be acting. So I will first go to Red Boy and then I will go to Dice. Gotcha. Can, uh, I, can I do one more thing? Yes. I want to send a Red Boy a text message by saying I will be at the Arabindo presentation and. Um, I will let you know when she's coming back up. Oh, uh, <laughs> yeah. so what you guys 
Okay, so um, Red Boy, what you notice is that at a certain point around half past nine in the evening, uh, you do notice that uh, an elevator first goes up to the ninth floor and then it goes down to the first floor. Uh, you do notice that a few uh, watchdog uh, security is uh, walking about and 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 uh, checking it, uh, ch uh, checking out uh, and and walking about in this part. So uh, with the movement of the watchdogs, you can be pretty sure that Miss Zhang, the your target, uh, has moved towards the press conference. Excellent. Um, so uh, presumably uh, she's got a full security detail. Yes. So, um, uh, 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 you, although you don't know that, uh, you do know that uh, indeed. Uh, 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 blah, blah, blah. So you 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 can be sure that she indeed has a full security detail. Yeah. Yeah, it, it, it just makes sense. I'm, I'm not saying I know for a fact. I'm just saying I'm presuming. Um, yes. So, uh, again, paint the picture for me. There's no um, exterior access to the, any suites above uh, floor seven, right? Uh, well, you could try and climb, uh, but uh, you would be in the open. So, so you would need to be quite stealthy about it. Um, because if, if, because these suites also have large um, um, uh, balconies, that like 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 I said, in a suite where where you can sit outside and we have this really big open probably place, in a hot tub. Like, yeah, with a hot tub oh, and and then be in the hot tub. Which it's it's almost like like, like <laughs> it's 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 almost like 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 a big garden. It, it's it's like almost like a full apartment with 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 garden and such. These these are really high and stuff. It's it's this, it's insane. Like like the, these rich people live it up. It's like like even. In, a, in, a, in their normal day, this, this is a, a kind of place where people who have too much time and too much money spent it. Uh, all right, cool, cool, cool. Um, so, so you could go from the outside, uh, although, like I said, they, they, uh, the uh, drones are flying about, of course, eh, because hey, they, they, those are the highest uh, VIPs there are possible, so they need a little bit more security. So if you want to get up, you would have to, I want to have you a few stealth ones. Yeah, that, that makes sense. I, I think going up that way, despite the uh, the risks, is still the the safer way to get up there than just walking through the hallway and presumably going through like an armed detail and having to kill like six dudes. Yeah. So I want uh, from from the floor from where you are, I want to have three stealth checks. Uh, the uh, where they they uh, which all need to be a 17 or higher so you need to beat 16 um okay uh, and uh, uh, if you I'm, if you I'm mention cal calculating my guaranteed chances to fail one of them um but i will go ahead and uh, you want three of them right oh yes oops. yes okay. i want three of three. them all right, one, easy, two, three. I'm putting a point of luck in. Yeah, sure. <laughs> so, so uh, what, what you managed to do is Red Boy. Uh, he looks at the drones flying about, the lights, which 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 go all over the place. It's it's dark, uh, lots of lights, but 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 because of all the lights, there are also a lot of shadows where 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 you are able to hide, and. Red boy with his quick thinking, easy climbing with his legs, uh, is able to scale the wall up uh, in all the shadows. Uh, sometimes hide in a in a corner, uh, in in a where a light flashes by or where a drone flies uh, uh, away. And um, at a certain point, you are able to climb on the balcony of the third of the ninth floor. Uh, it's a large uh, balcony. It's like like almost like a garden. There's a hot tub there. There are, there are seatings. Um, we can do see inside. There are the lights are on. You do see a few security guards walking about. 
Uh, not that many because most of them are gone. It's like maybe like you see two or three of them in total, uh, if you would count them. Uh, but they uh, most of the time mo they, you see them uh, after they did a round walking. You see them all lazing about a little bit at the bar of the kitchen, uh, getting a drink, laughing, uh, like like they are in a relaxed mode, like like uh, as if they are on a break. I. Love it, A, uh, but I have questions. <laughs> yeah. Um, so the the garden balcony, mm. like it's got a, it's probably got a place to stand. Probably got a nice view of the glen. It's yes. Got hot. It's got it's got a hot tub. It's got a garden. Uh, I want to know. Does it have like um like uh it must have like blinders, um so that you can sort of like uh, make it so you can't look through the glass. Obviously. Yes. It indeed. Yes. And I'm I'm wondering. Bulletproof glass, regular glass, stuff like that. It's uh, because bullet, it's 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 thin bulletproof glass. Okay, because my uh, my plan from here on out is I want to catch her out here. Mm -hmm. Um, in, in as compromising a position as possible. Maybe mm -hmm. she's going to the hot tub. Maybe she's going out to just you know mm -hmm. take in the sun yeah. or what? take in the sun. Uh, take take in the moonlight. <laughs> the opposite. So, of the so what, what um, you don't notice is that the hot tub. It has his it has its own place. So if you would be in there or close to there, you would be out of sight from all the windows. Yeah. So uh, I'm I'm gonna tuck in there. Are there, for now. there are also a few other spots which where where you could hide. But yeah, that's just one of the spots where you could hide. Yes. Yeah. So so I'll I'll, I'll tuck in there and then uh, you know fingers crossed when she comes out there, mm -hmm. that's when I want to quietly close the blinders. Mm -hmm. um, uh, wedge the thing shut and then have a totally civil discussion. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, 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 we'll talk at length about how she uh, so, mobilized tanks against uh, me. Uh, uh, sure, rocket, sure, ro sure. Rocket robot spiders, all of that. Sure. Okay. I'm really gonna squash so, this beef. So, so you're, 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 you're up you're there hiding. The so, okay. Dice. Um, yes. You are going to try and sneak into the backstage of the Raven Micro Cybernetics, right? That's correct. Okay, so tell me, how are you going to try and do this? Well, I'm gonna go down with my use, uh, get as far as I can with my VIP pass. Mm -hmm. um, is the backstage locked? Uh, yes, there are security guards there, uh, although it's not really locked, but there are security guards there uh, and you do see that only certain personnel uh, with a personnel badge uh, are allowed to, get, to go in and out. Uh, and you do see sometimes go, it's a double, it's a, bi it's a big double doors. Um, and uh, sometimes they go, come, uh, they they walk in with nothing. They come out with something big, uh, or they they bring something back inside. Uh, that kind of uh, stuff. Is the um, is do the, does the maintenance have access? Uh, yes, they do. All right. So because because now that you 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 actually paid attention to it, if 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 if, eh, if maintenance personnel is around and such, I will give you that 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 you you keep attention to it. and you do notice that that there's all kinds of personnel walking about which which uh, which seemingly seem to be ignored by most of the people. But now that you know that they are there, you notice that they they walk about everywhere. It's like 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 they're 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 like busy bee workers who do all kinds of stuff. They, if, if a glass of wine falls over within within a few minutes, the, uh, it's completely cleaned up and you only see maybe like a, a, a little stain if you would really look at it. And there's a new glass even with wine in it. As it and, and the person wouldn't even notice, he would just grab the glass and drink from it. All right. Um, That's kind of stuff. Do I recognize the same guy I talked to earlier? Uh, give me a perception check. Okay. Uh, they all seem to be they, they all seem to look like the same because they're all wearing the same uniform alright uh, I am going to I am going to uh, step away from the backstage mm 
mm-hmm. uh, a little bit, uh, get into like a secluded area, mm-hmm. and then kick another trash can. <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> and within minutes, uh, a few of the, the cleaner crew come up and, and they start cleaning it up. Uh, I want to tap one of them on the shoulder. I was like, hey, um... Uh, yes, sir. Uh, the, the, yes, what, what can I do for you? How much are you getting paid to do this? Uh, just our regular salary, sir? Um, if you would allow me to, uh... If you would kind of like lose your badge for uh, for about fifteen minutes, uh, there could be five hundred dollars in for or uh, five hundred eddies in, in it for you. Five hundred eddies? Uh, 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 well, uh, I, I I cannot maybe use your badge. Uh, give me a uh, trading roll. Gotcha. He's like, I don't know if I can do that, sir, but, uh, 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 if, if, you, if you uh, accidentally misplace it somewhere, you'll uh, get it back. Uh, <laughs> uh, sir, uh, uh, yeah, sure, uh, but, uh, the batch only won't, won't work. Uh, come with me and, uh, he will take you, uh, in, in the, in, in kind of like, like the employee, uh, hallways. And what you do notice is that these are very small employee hallways. It looks like a, a completely hidden, um, a maze system within the building itself where all the employees can go in and out. I, I don't know if you guys know, like, like, like the, with, with those, um, it's uh, kind of like Disney underground, like, 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 like in real life, those parks, those, those really parks where, where, um, uh, for example, like Disneyland, where, where all yeah. the kind of characters have, have those backstage labyrinth where they can can pop yeah. in and pop out. Well, something like this. You can uh, it's like like it's it, there are kind of hidden system within the hotel where employees can um, walk in and walk out so that they are not seen on the open floor, basically. Okay, so I'm gonna do that. And, the, I'll, I'll, let him, I'll let him uh, yeah. take me there. <laughs> Yeah. So so, and he will give you his uh, his pass, and he will give you a uniform. Sweet. <laughs> All right. So I am gonna go directly to Raven Cybernetics uh, spot where that is. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They they uh, so so with your uniform and the badge, you basically even with the uniform, uh, you you you're, you're being ignored, and you can just walk in. All right, so I'm just gonna go in in there. Uh, is there drones in there? Uh, a few security guards walk around, and a single and, and a few drones indeed fly 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 about indeed. But they are at an, an in in the pattern, so so they like, like they are on patrol, and it's quite a big area. It's a quite open area, uh, open area, uh, uh, maze like area, and you see all kinds of of, of rooms with with. Uh, 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 tags of companies on them, uh, and and if you try the doors, you notice that they each of them are locked. Are they electronically locked or? Uh... Yes, they are. All right. Uh, I'm gonna wait until like uh, the drone pattern and the um, and the um, security guards are like far enough away, and then. Uh, Give me a stealth check. Gotcha. Stealth check. We're doing stealth checks. It's right over there. Yeah, sure. So, so at some point, you 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 are alone, and nobody is around you. So, what do you want to do? I want to take my silence pistol and shoot the lock to get in. Sure. Or the or the hot pocket, whatever would get me in. Oh, Maybe. you have that uh, microwaver, right? Yeah. <coughs> sorry, sorry. I thought that I was muting. Okay, so give me an 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 an, an ranged attack roll with your microwaver. As long as you hit the lowest range table, then I will allow you to that you you. Uh, that the lock got broken open. Gotcha. Oh, you you. 
Dice sneaks around, looks around, and, and nobody is around and with Rike Raker. Hits the lock and you hear that click and it 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 you 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 the, the door opens just a, a little bit. Sweet. Alright, I ease my way in there. Mm-hmm. Locate the stuff. Mm-hmm. Um uh, so what, what what you find here is is you you see all kinds of cases with cyber limbs, cyber arms, uh, cyber legs, uh, neuroware, cyber eye. Uh, uh, it's it's uh, uh, you f- you find there and uh, give me a consume reveal check consume. and a beat and you have to beat a DV seventeen for me. Uh, can I put three luck into that? Yes, you can. All right. I will do that. <laughs> and after a little bit of searching, you are able to find the the, the, the chest with with the um, uh, which seems to be to have the the, the new unique uh, neural links. Uh, there's just one problem. What's up? It seems to be uh, um, fingerprint uh, lock. That's all right. That's it's the briefcase. It's it's a small briefcase. It's it's a small briefcase. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like like a um, a thirty by twenty centimeters briefcase. I got it. I got his. Uh, I got his card anyway, so I can lift the print off that. So I'll just take the case, and then like I'll head toward the motor pool warehouse, mm-hmm. um, and like uh, see if there's like key fobs or anything just hanging around. Uh, hold on, hold on. Uh, I I missed that l- l- last part. What is, so, so you 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 bring the case along with you? Yes, I do. So you go. You, so you go outside the the room again, right? Yep. Sneak past uh, the drones and all that too. You give me another stealth check. Gotcha. Uh, man, I just saw it too. So you would fail this one. But I can make you succeed, but there will be a consequence to it. All right, I'll take that. Okay. You could put some luck in. <laughs> oh, wait, yeah, actually, I got one more luck. Can I use that? Uh, th- th- you need to beat a 17. Ah, oh, never mind. Then, yeah, I'll take it. Uh, so you're able to sneak past them. So now you're outside of the backstage, or did you want to go from the backstage to some kind of... Yeah, um, I, want, I wanted to go to like big dock. the big dock and uh, snatch a truck or get like a key to a truck or something. Oh, yeah, definitely. You can. Uh, so uh, with a little bit of sneaking and with the help of your friend, which you, who you paid 500, uh, please remember that you have to. Oh, I already uh, put it in the shop, I believe. Yeah. Did I? Did I not? Uh, I I don't know if you over if you already did. I didn't check yet. Oh, I think. Oh no, what I did was like I gave him fifty by accident. No, that was the first time. Yeah, oh, no. I did twice. It was yeah, another guy. It was twice I did it. I must have like uh, copied and pasted the thing. Yeah. So you managed to go to to the back end, and there are trucks uh, around there and such, and and and, and then you see some some. Uh, some working personnel uh, my, uh, loading uh, and offloading stuff. Uh, you do see some security guards, but but nobody is really paying attention to you currently. Gotcha. Um, well, then I'm just going to get into the driver's seat of one of them and then text the rest of the team, hey, I got my hands on a truck. I'm gonna text uh, Dice. Um, hold until I and uh, hold until I uh, give you a, uh, another message. I will roger that. <laughs> and then so I'll, Dice. Yep, and then basically I'm just gonna pretend, try not to be noticed, and just sit in the truck yeah, waiting. Sh- <laughs> sure, no problem. Yeah. So, so that was what Dice did. So. Uh, we go to Envy and... Oh, boy. Uh, and... Um, 
at stitches. So you, the two of you, go to. Sorry, before we go in, I'm gonna. Yeah, go to, look, I understand you're you're young. You want to have some fun. If you want to, uh, if you want to go off and uh, just party a bit, and uh, I think I have this covered. I have a plan. Sorry. Got I it. Wanna, yeah, I, I just want to jump in real quick, Laurel. You sound like you got hit with a microwaver. Your mic is going nuts. I'm so sorry. I uh, I switched to my computer and then I got my or I switched to my phone. And I was making myself some food, and now I've spilled the food. <laughs> Partially. Okay. Yeah, just so I'm I'd let you know. Wait, I, I can go to Bombshell first and then go come back to you two uh, if you. Um, it, it sounds to me as though uh, Seisho has a plan for this. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I, I, I see that picture. Okay, Sasho. I'm so sorry that I keep getting that wrong. I thought it, I thought that you like corrected me the other way the first time. That's my bad. Yeah, it, it's fine. Um, I I do think that uh, yeah no I I'm with I'm with Sasho's plan. Envy's just gonna party. It's gonna be his his show right now. Okay, so so Envy is going to party and and have fun. Um, and so the Brooklyn uh, presentation happens, uh, and uh, the, the they go like like like. Yeah. So before I do that, I would like to check uh, my map from the Brooklyn presentation and from the mm -hmm. back room. Mm -hmm. How hard is it to get to the car park? Um. So uh, it would be like like almost like a st straight line. There would be some 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 lefts and rights to it, but uh, I think if you would take a, if you would uh, uh, run for it, I think within maybe five ten, yeah, in maybe about five minutes, you are able to get to the park park lot where okay. the dice would be at the loading dock. Yeah. Uh, okay. Good. So then we can uh, can get on with the um, can I have already, presentation. Can I have already like started the truck? <laughs> oh, definitely. Yeah, sure. All right. So the Rockland presentation starts, and uh, what you guys see, what you what you see is is a, 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 an, in, a, an incredible chair. It's it's like like it's it's smooth. It manages to go up and downstairs without with with ease without with the people uh, sitting in it. And what's even more unique about it is that uh, it, uh, um, it it you you do, you don't have to use an interface plug for it. It's it's somehow they are, you are able to place uh, some kind of headband on your head and with that you are able to control the um, uh, chair with ease and uh, the unique part of it it also has a cyber arm a single cyber arm which uh, moves the route uh, which they can control it's a very unique chair and something uh, special um, and uh, that is the presentation which you're showing how special this chair is that it's, it's just new it's like like uh they, they present like yeah this is just uh, uh out of the presses our scientists work work on it um you don't need any kind of interface plugs to connect with it and you also don't need to use your arms or hands to control this chair like it is your own uh, uh body So after the presentation, I'm going to go up to whoever gave it and set and uh, can we mm -hmm. in introduce myself. I um I've got a I I, I agreed to speak to someone just now, but I'm yes. probably going to come back in 45 minutes. Uh, maybe to the to the back room. Can I can I get a close look at the chair? I have a a client who's very interested in it. Oh oh, uh, you want to want to, want to have a personal viewing? Uh, uh, yeah, maybe half an hour, forty-five minutes. Sorry, I just need to brush off, uh, talk to, oh. or someone I promise to speak to. Oh, I don't know. Give me a persuasion check. Okay. <laughs> oh shit. Uh, 
hope your cool is better than your empathy. <laughs> <laughs> How much? I, I have five lock. Is, will that be enough to get me there? Uh, yeah, sure. Yeah. How much do I need to spend? Five. Okay, then. So be it. Uh, it like, uh, yeah, yeah. normally we don't do that, sir, but uh, you know what? In, uh, if, Actually, if, I, if, I have if, full lock. If, if you realize. can, if, if you if you can grease my, my uh, if, if, if if I have a hard life and I don't get paid much by by Raven Microcybernetics. Wait, isn't this Rocklin? Oh, sorry, Rocklin, Rocklin Cybernetic, uh, Augmentics. It would help me a lot. Okay, um, I'm going to. Um, okay, this, this is. Can you just give me a. I don't know what I'm going to do here. Um, okay, if you can, um, uh, if, if you can get me in once, uh, once I've had a look at it, just to make sure that this really is, you know, worth my time, um, I will, um, uh, I, I, I will make sure to send you 500 eighties. But you have to give me your contact uh, information so that I know you're 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 for real. Yes, and I give him my my real contact information. Okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, come here back uh, for, for 45 minutes later, and then I will 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 manage to do something. Good. So I'm going to spend the next 45 minutes just in the bathroom. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm going to make sure that I have incendiary shells loaded into my shotgun. Mm-hmm. Jesus Christ. Mm-hmm. <laughs> um. And then I am going to um, head uh, back out to meet this guy for the private viewing. Wonderful. So, so uh, for this private viewing, so he, he lets you. And in. as I as I arrive, I'm gonna uh, on my internal agent to quickly text Dice. 10, 15 minutes. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna, I'm gonna so so dice you have <laughs> already been waiting for like uh, 50 minutes or something like that or 45 minutes because uh, you were sneaking in while this presentation was happening mm-hmm. and you were waiting for for stitches to contact you just letting you know gotcha so and and once we I get to bombshell uh, I will I will we will turn back the clock a little bit so that uh, that it will be her presentation. But yeah. uh, please do remember that that uh, a few things which I'm going to mention soon will be all at the same time. Just letting you all know. Yes. So, shit is just, uh, 45 minutes later. Uh, he, he, you see a very sketchy person at the door, the person that, that you talk to, and yeah. uh, when he sees you, he winks you in, and he walks you to uh, the uh, walks you through the back room. You see security uh, 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 walking about. You see drones walking about. What you do notice while you're walking is that there's an uh, that that security and drones are. S- looking for somebody as if they are have a purpose as uh they seem to be the the, the they seem to be um on guard i was kind of hoping that by arriving near the end of the shift i would be i would catch them when they were their laziest uh so yeah didn't work. but something else happened yeah i i figure um so oh, but, it doesn't change the plan too much. But, but, but um, you, you, you and that person, you, you can go to the Rockland Augmentics. Yeah. Uh, it's a quite a big room compared to other rooms. Uh, yeah. And uh, when you guys get inside, he uses his mask, get inside, and there are all the uh, all the stuff there. Okay. I'm going to walk over to the chair and kind of start inspecting it mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, are you really inspecting it or just faking it really inspecting it give me a cyber check check okay yes this is the chair which you are looking for and which your your employee would would pay quite a bit for yeah oh, but that's but not really what I what, what I was trying to check was 
how 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 prototypey is this thing? As in, how likely is it that I could say go on a rampage through a building, riding this thing uh, without it breaking down? <laughs> so uh, this thing uh, is 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 uh, isn't broken down that that easily. Um, yeah. Uh, it's uh, it has uh, compared to other cyber chairs, it has a move of eight, so it moves quite fast. Yeah, uh, and it seems to have uh, uh, roller skates also behind it. So if you push it to the limit, you would even go faster. Uh, we're talking like compact ground car kind of speed. Uh, no, 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 no. Uh, so a normal movement would be eight, and if you would run with this chair, you would run another two extra squares because wouldn't skate feet on it. Skate feet are an extra three squares. Oh, extra three squares. Sorry. Yeah. And that would give me nineteen, which is the equivalent, which a compact ground car is twenty. Oh yeah, then it's almost like a, grump, gr- a compact compact ground car. Yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna move this thing over. Um, can I just? Uh, try out the legs. It's gonna be styling. Um, oh, definitely. This 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 thing is 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 tricked out. It has it has yeah. chromed legs. Uh, the the seating is very very comfortable. This all has that kind yeah. of of memory foam where you can really sit into it. It even has some yeah. uh, some harness which you can lock yourself into so that you would yeah. never fall out so of I it. So I want I want to sit inside and I want to kind of test the harness. Uh, and I want to place my my backpack in my it's lap, like, sir, sir, kind of slightly open. Don't, don't, sir, please don't do that. Uh, 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 you just look at it. And <laughs> okay, can I can I just test the, the headband because that is the most important part for my client. <laughs> I don't know, sir. Uh, uh, give me another persuasion check. Can I can I do a face down? Sure. Um, and he has my real name, so I, can I use my fame for this? Uh, definitely. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Poor dude! Good job, honey. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Not the crit. Well, okay, so even if he has a low of cool two, then it would be a three, but okay, there. Yeah. So yeah, no, he's like, like okay, 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 sir. Since, just since for I, a little while. I, since I, I've broken as well, I, I am gonna sit down, um, do up the harness, mm-hmm. place the bag in my lap, mm-hmm. and then I'm going to make a grab for his badge. Sure. Give me a brawling check. Grab his badge. Yes. So now you have his badge. Okay. I'm going to activate the chair. Mm-hmm. Um, and I'm going to pull out. What does uh, activate? Does that bring the chair in action? Yes, it does. It has uh, four legs uh, yeah. and one cyber arm. Though there so are I'm... no augments in it except for that the legs have the skate feet. Yeah. So I am going to take my my action to activate the cyber chair. Now that I've done this. Mm-hmm. Uh, once I've done that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, well, we're I'm all go- in narrative currently, so yeah. so don't worry. Yeah, I'm going to pull out my shotgun. Mm-hmm. And I am, which will probably again take an action. Uh, and then I'm going to start racing for the door. <laughs> God fucking hell. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, fucking hell. All right. Uh. Okay. <clears throat> Uh, okay, so fucking hell. Okay. Uh, da, 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 da. Uh, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Why? <laughs> there was supposed just, to be no just, just a face at the moment is amazing. <laughs> you're, you're killing me, dude. Okay. I'm killing myself with this strategy. Oh. You're fuck. still pretty much alive, honey. So. I know CPR, so you'll be fine. <laughs> it's fine, just, you know, waterboard him with coffee. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not that low of an empathy. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, 
this God, is why, why is this happening to me? <laughs> this is the fastest wheelchair on the planet. <laughs> <laughs> it is. It is a, a scary wheelchair. Okay, so... Okay, so we're we're in the in the, in 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 the back, and uh, we have uh, stitches on a wheelchair, and oh my god! Okay, no, we have some uh, we have some local security. Why don't you guys see the names of that? Or do you see the names of it? No, we don't. No names. I don't even see the tokens. Oh fucking hell, I know why. Because I'm a fucking idiot. Oh, you put them on that layer? Uh, yeah. <laughs> I, I can tell because you just shifted the entire background. <laughs> there, now you should be able to see them. Yep. Uh, okay, can you ping where they are? Uh, uh, the, the, this will be more narratively. I'm just po po poking yeah. the, 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 the. I'm going to give them a second to kind of approach me and to, if possible, give them time to bunch up. So, so uh, yeah, so so these are hallways. Uh, the, this chair fits in the hallways, but nobody yeah. else will be able to to go through it. Uh, yeah. It's 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 because eh, on, on how it moves uh drones and a few automated turrets from 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 uh from from the uh, roofs of, the, so, of the so we're saying that i've i've made it out of the back room uh yes you made it out of the well you're actually this is the back room and you are going to through the halls to the loading dock okay uh i will give you a few skill checks uh whether you succeed or not so one thing that I'm doing to lay down covering fire mm -hmm. is I'm putting out the occasional incendiary shell. Mm -hmm. So can I start off with the shoulder arms? Uh, yes, you can indeed. Okay. I'm just going to roll this as a skill check. Dang. Uh, yeah, definitely. So the That's first shot, cool. you, you, you come racing up and, and then you shoot with your shoulder, shoulder arms like the shell. Security dives out of the way, and and they they they, they you you manage to go past them. Yeah. So. Okay. Uh, um, and then uh, I would like to use concentration to remember the route, um, through the um, through to the loading yeah. dock. Hold on, hold on. If if you give me a moment, uh, yeah. because this is way more fun. I I like I like where this is going. So I'm going to yeah. to, to do it a, a little bit different. Uh, I want this one. Uh, no, that's the wrong one. Uh, give me this one. Yes, thank you. You guys should be able to see that one, correct? Yep. Um. Yep, yeah, two clock. Two clocks. Yeah. Uh, are they big enough for for, no. for you guys to see? <laughs> they are now. <laughs> they are now. Hang, hang on. Um, wait, am I? Oh, I realize why I can't see it because I'm looking at a, a handout. That's why I couldn't see things. Um. So okay, uh, the the right yeah. the the left one is uh you win yeah if if and uh, the right one is you lose okay so if the right one so is 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 full before the left one then you are caught okay right um so my next check will be concentration to mm -hmm. navigate to recall the route that i need to take Yes, and because of your agent, who where you already checked before, it's a DV 14 to beat. Okay. Uh, 13, sorry, 13. Oh no! Uh, they, they managed to catch up to you because you got lost. Uh, yeah. And they, they, they will try and, and fire at you, so... Give I don't have evasion. Uh, no, but the chair does give you evasion somehow. Wasn't it supposed it has, to be a It gives you higher line? reflexes. <laughs> it's a magic chair. Wasn't it it's supposed a magic to be chair. a straight line? So give me an evasion check to see if you are able to get into cover before they're shooting you. Okay. 
and that is another success for you. Yes. Okay. Um, I am going to then um, brandish my shotgun uh, <laughs> to to kind of scare them to not to you know get further away at the very least or to bully it best. Okay, but you, you you already uh, used your shoulder arm skill. Yes, I'm one. using persuasion. Okay. Ah, uh, sorry. You you you, uh, you need to be the thirteen. Yeah, and I don't have luck. Yeah. They, 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 these guys are like like you're stealing company stuff and and they they, yes. they, they train your their their gun, guns at you. And okay. I, so give uh, me an an an, an uh, athletics where if you are able to to uh, with the chair if you are able to to uh, like like uh, this chair is quite yeah. unique and you are able to climb up on the wall and 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 to, it's like a spider I mean, chair. It, it's it's implied that. Um, these, uh, even the basic slab chairs can do things like go upstairs. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Uh, but yeah. Uh, I'll give you an athletics. Um. God damn it. You're not rolling anything else. <laughs> no, 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 no. This it, it, this wasn't very easy because the chair helps. It, it's like like this. This chair is like like insane. It's like a spider climb chair. So so I just needed him not to fumble this. It's like an open-handed attached okay. coma. Okay. So, so so you manage to steer the chair up up to the. It's it's like like this chair is is racing towards them and and they are training their guns on you and then you manage to you're like like shit I want to dodge and then you know personally notice that the chair uh, it retracts its wheels, climbs up to the uh, wall, climbs up to the ceiling and then whoosh, runs past the security guard is like what the fuck. <laughs> I was considering I was say, there are so many great uh, wheelchair gifts. <laughs> <laughs> I'm shocked. Yeah. Um, what skill do I want to use? Um, Fucking handy cable. I'm going to use perception to find useful signs to help me take a shortcut. A yes. Beautiful. So I've got. Is it four yes. successes or five now? No, it's uh, it's you, 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 uh, you have one success left and one uh, th uh to to succeed. Yeah. So uh, it's clutch time. This is clutch. Yeah. Full clutch. It's okay. I'm gonna use deduction <laughs> to figure out which vehicle dice is in. Can I, can I just beep? <laughs> You could do like a complimentary check. Yeah, can I? Can I do a? I don't know. Just drive vehicle. Uh, so uh, to be able to 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 uh, get into it, I would say I want to roll. I want to have a stealth track from you, so that you that that you were in time to hide the chair inside the the okay. the truck which dice is in. Yeah. And hold on, before you roll, I want. You to beat a DV15. Okay, that's gonna be pretty difficult with an eight stealth, but we'll we'll give it a shot. Can I give him? Hold a on. Card? Okay, so so so. so uh, Yo! <laughs> nice. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yay! I make it in. Nice. Dice hit the gas. So, uh, as you guys know, alarms are kind of going off, and 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 and, uh, and, and the security guards are running up, looking around as such. <laughs> it's it's like 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 uh, uh, all kinds of, of bells are whistling. You you hear kinds of closing. So, dice, what are you going to do? Uh, I'm gonna throw out a smoke grenade, and I'm gonna mm -hmm. hit the pedal. <laughs> And you're going to take a. You're going to try and run or drive away? Yeah. Sure. Give me a drive vehicle check. Yes. 
Yeah. So, oh, so, yeah. so you managed to 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 to, uh, to drive away. <laughs> My nomad roots showing itself. <laughs> And uh, now we go a little bit back into time and at 10 p.m. Nadari. Yeah. You go to the meeting room of the Arabino Pharma. You see a few rich guys uh, sitting there, a rich woman, and you see Miss Sang Yu uh, presenting their presentation. What you also see is the bodyguard which was with her only he's a little bit more robotic he was dead right he is now a little bit more robotic than you've last time seen him oh my what what is doing here <laughs> i will text this to uh, to red boy to to say that uh, you remember that that that, that bodyguard I thought he was dead. Uh, he's alive. So, so m more, 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 more body are you, are parts. Are you taking a picture of him? I don't have. I ha oh wait, can I do that with the siren? Hmm. I don't know. Oh, the implanted agent. Yeah. I have an internal agent. Yeah. So, so uh, red boy, <laughs> bombshell. Uh, takes a picture of the guy that you killed, but he's way more cybered up than before. Perfect. I'm just, I text I'm back. Just <laughs> <laughs> I'm just imagining, like, Red Boy just like, ah, oh, the game is on. And and he's just standing there in the corner, not moving at all. Okay, I I will just be the most um, uh, in inconspicuous person there. Inconspicuous. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, so there we go. There. <laughs> Miss Miss Sang Yu starts. is like, welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to our special uh, presentation. Uh, tonight you will see something uh, special, and uh, I wish uh, that this information will not leave this room uh, to the public until we uh, 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 do so ourselves. Uh, and uh, I will show you the following things. And what she is showing you is that she is showing uh, a full skeletal, body skeletal cyberware where Basically, the entire skeleton of a human being can be replaced with a cyber skeleton, which is more durable, stronger. Um, uh, basically, it's it's like like it, it replaces all your bones. So it's a it's titanium like a, a linear frame on steroids, basically. It's a linear flame on on steroids. Yes, indeed. You just said three ah, so of Red Boy's favorite words. <laughs> <laughs> Linear frame. It's and and she will show show uh, she will point to to the cyber top bodyguard. It's like like this is uh, uh, this person here uh, volunteered uh, uh, to be the first uh, person to to have this uh, special uh, 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 implant. <laughs> and uh, as you can see, uh, he was uh, he was a broken man before, and now he can just walk, talk like every other person in, in this room. <laughs> the, the, this by the way is great i literally still have this guy listed on my sheet because i thought he was that important his name is uh matsunaga tero uh-huh <laughs> yep i fucking i have his information i have been vying for this uh like this showdown it's, it's, uh, I, I hope I, I hope I, I surprised you enough, guy, uh, with, with this. Uh, oh yeah, you did. Um, oh, God, the Red yeah, Boy needs did, his own fucking not, video game. I did not expect this motherfucker to have made it out of that shit alive. <laughs> Me neither. 
uh, and uh, Miss thank you shows other stuff like like yes and uh, and here you can see our our special unique cyber wear arms and and it, basically what 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 happens is that a an, an normal normal arm it seems like a completely normal arm and it 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 somehow changes uh, into an 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 an, 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 an fun. You have no idea how it's almost like like magic. It it, it like it, it looks like like the the, the hand like like uh, uh, shrinks into to the arm and and a, and a gun comes out of it. Oh damn! <laughs> That's cool. Uh, of course, these are uh, the, the, this these these arms and and the limbs are somewhat uh, um, experimental still. But uh, of course, uh, if you are interested in your own. Uh, to have your own bodyguards upgraded, then uh, you can contact us. Uh, and uh, she shows all kinds of, of stuff like these, like 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 special kind of cyberware. Um, what are if you want to, to have your bodyguards, which you own because they're not human beings, cybered up like this, mm -hmm. you can. That is absolutely, the kind of person she is. <laughs> I sent the information about that uh, that body skeleton. <clears throat> That's uh, that this normal bones are replaced by a cyber skeleton. Mm -hmm. I will send it to Red Boy. Mm. Not to the others. Well, yeah, that's know. a question I want to have. Do either of you tell Envy about this? Because she's a. Because if you do, she's just gonna be cursing that she doesn't have a camera in there to fuck with her <laughs> shit. <laughs> the doors are closed. Um, well, couldn't you get uh, footage from Bombshell? I do have a picture, but I don't know. I only have a siren and an internal agent. I don't know if you can. Yeah, sure. You you can show a few pictures if you want. Okay. Okay. Do cool. So I do, do have something. Roll me, roll me a security tech, by the way. Oh. Like I'm the least techy person here. <laughs> <laughs> security tech. Well, here we go. So, That's not bad for you. <laughs> yeah. So <laughs> so the pictures come go, go through and 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 Red Boy and Envy and anyone else you're sending it to do receive it. But uh, when they look at it, they're like, "Who made this picture?" <laughs> it's it's like 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 it's, it's so so blurry that there's almost no detail in it. Can I just uh, do a photography uh, skill check uh, to see how how good they are? No, it's it's because the the information once you send it, it got scrambled. Yeah. Uh, there we go. I'm in so the like, yeah, yeah, like you took a very punch. blurry picture. <laughs> Bigfoot's got one of those. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I, I just keep keep laying low for now mm -hmm. because I know there are people from. Uh, watchdog security there as well. Yes, they are. They're, but they are outside currently. Nobody is else is inside besides these six people at the moment, or seven people. Sorry. For real? Yes. I just said the seven of us and they've not recognized. Yes. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> you're, you're fucking. Uh, That's why I had you roll the wardrobe as right style now. check. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's so out of place though. <laughs> Oh man, um, are they there, like going to discuss some things or? Uh, yes, they mainly they they, they come uh, all the, all these uh, CEOs come with questions. Uh, uh, are there any kind of safety measures uh, installed uh, just in case uh, that they can be stolen? And we say, yes, of course there are safety measures. Uh, there are death man switches. There are tracking devices. Uh, every uh, of these. Yeah, uh, just put a dead man switch on your on your fucking bodyguard. <laughs> That'll these make sure they're loyal. All these, all these parts are uh, 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 hand-designed uh, hand or custom-designed for, for, for your own personal uh, uses. Uh, they have each have their own uh, unique uh, stuff. So even if they uh, get stolen, they will be easily found uh, if, if somebody even tries to think about stealing them. Mm-hmm. 
Any uh, other questions? Uh, yes, uh, what about uh, the, re the response times of, uh, of the bodyguard? Ah, good question. Uh, the response times is like, uh, uh, are, are is quick and what uh, what she does she throws ba she she throws a pen at her bodyguard uh, or no no she pulls out her gun <laughs> she, she 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 aims at her bodyguard and um, she she pulls the trigger a loud bang happens but you notice nobody's responding and you see the bodyguard catching the bullet oh wow. <laughs> Dang. Mm. I hope uh, this is a, a good enough demonstration. Uh, Very interesting. Boy. And uh, if there are no further questions, uh, of course you can always uh, know where uh, you know where to find me and contact me. And uh, I uh, wish you all a uh, uh, good uh, a good day and a good night. And uh, I hope to see you all at uh, the party uh, tonight, of course. Very well. <clears throat> I excuse myself and I keep and I. Like I go outside, but I keep an because there are no other doors in this room, or are they? No, there are, there's only one door. There's just one exit. Yes. So. So, so people are slowly going out. Uh, uh, before you guys are let out, uh, the security will let first let Miss Zhang Li uh, Liu uh, out uh, together with her bodyguard, and uh, as you notice, she uh, walks away, and then the rest of the people like uh, with you where you're sitting uh, can uh, exit the room. Okay, I want to follow them on a safe distance. <laughs> sure. You can follow them and you will follow them all the way up. Uh, nobody you know, uh, gives it until you get to the elevators. They step into the elevator. So you're in the lobby of the mm -hmm. right side of the building and they will step into the elevators and will go up and you will see them <laughs> stop at the ninth floor. Okay, I will let my boy know that they are coming up. Uh, absolutely. Uh, I'll, I'll text back um, uh, in position. Uh, she'll never see it coming. <laughs> <laughs> and I will go try to get away upstairs as well. Sure. Um, With the elevator? Yeah. Or uh, the I, I definitely want to make sure that Bombshell has like the the information of like where I am like where homegirl mm -hmm. was like posted up because if, if we're doing this and I'm not like there's no reason to hide anything from bombshell. Mm -hmm. Oh, what what I want to do is go up via the left elevator mm -hmm. and take my grapple gun to go uh, from the left building to the right building to. Uh, 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 a room that you, is. You're already on the right building, and the elevators would go up to the seventh floor. So because if you want to go higher, you would need to have a security pass for it to go onto the. Or you would have to find a room <laughs> where you can climb up. Which, most likely, Red Boy might have told you there is an open door on the fifth floor where he was hiding. Well, well <laughs> absolutely. I, I also want to offer that, like, she's got a grapple gun. Like, I can help her onto the ninth floor balcony. We can just get this done. Sure, uh, then, like, then I'll... The roll. information that we have, yeah. Right. So do you want to arrive before or after she... Before. Okay, so give me... Uh, an, uh, give me an athletics... Uh, two athletics checks. DV-17 to hey, uh, basically be faster. Uh, it's in progress um, right now. Uh, what's happening? So a bombshell was following Miss Miss Sang Lee. Yeah. After the, the, the presentation. Yeah. And I'm now going up. So, so, to she, she's, so, so she's going to climb up and, and try to get, uh, get up there. And where is it? I, I had I had a beautiful. Okay, I'm there. going to roll my athletics check. I have four luck left, so I hope I can manage with that. So let's see. We roll the first one. That's fine. The second one, I put a luck in there to have an 18. So I beat both things. 
Uh, yes, you mm. do. So, so you so so while the elevator goes up, uh, you you are in contact with Red Boy, and you know, oh, oh, I need to go to the fifth floor. Uh, go outside with the purple gun, with the help of Red Boy. You are, you manage to get up, and uh, the, there the two of you are now basically waiting near the uh, hot tub uh, till she arrives uh, there. And where is my picture? There it is. I knew it. This one. Uh, oh, hold on. I will do she this will one. She will be so surprised to see me there. <laughs> 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 I'm, I'm completely unrecognizable, but she will be like, what? Well, you were just in my meeting. What? <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. Uh, So now we pull you guys here. So this is uh, where you guys are. It's it's a uh, luxury. It's a little bit bigger than this picture itself, but it's it's quite luxurious. Uh, it's the hot tub there as such. And uh, at a certain point, you hear uh, uh, the door opening from from, from uh, of of the suite, and you I see. Don't hear a thing. No, 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 that was way further. She had to walk all the way to... to, to oh, okay, okay. Um, and, and you see her walk in and, and, and the bodyguard behind it. And she was like, oh, finally done. Um, and what you uh, do notice, uh, what you guys hear is that... Uh, uh, why is this one on the wrong layer? I don't know. There we go. Uh, come on. There. Uh, uh, and if, uh, you, uh, what you can hear, guys, uh, what the two of you hear is that uh, a phone is going off, and on a bi on the big TV screen, you see uh, this person. Uh, appear on the screen and uh, and he was like uh, so my dear how how did uh, how did it go and uh, she was like uh, wonderful um, I, I think we captured uh, a, a few big fish uh, they should be uh, contacting us uh, us soon and uh, uh, you hear this man ask, and uh, what about uh, this big brute, uh, which uh, your uh, people saw on the uh, in the building? Uh, we're still looking for him, uh, uh, grandfather, uh, but we will capture him soon enough, and then uh, we will know uh, why he has been uh, such a pain in the ass for our company. And it's like, uh, well done, uh, granddaughter. And uh, remember, this is your final chance. I won't uh, won't give you uh, any more leeway with all the screw ups you have done so far. And uh, she's like, I won't disappoint you. And uh, they will hang up and uh, she will stretch out and, and relax uh, a little bit. And uh, what are the two of you want to do during this phone call? <laughs> I'm going to uh, I'm taking it all in uh, I'm out there um, fucking bombshell and red boy like we are we're decked out we're, we're looking spiffy we're in our fucking business clothes looking tight um, my plan I don't know uh, if you have any other plans is to still just wait out here until she eventually wanders out onto the balcony mm -hmm. I'm fine with that so, okay, so at a certain point, the security guards suddenly, uh, which were which were relaxing, are now suddenly busy, and at a certain point, they get sent out, and they're like, "Yes, miss," and only the the, the bodyguard is, is 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 standing in in, in kind of like a, like a is sort of in the middle of the suite, just standing there as if it's a statue. Oh my! <laughs> it's so creepy. Okay. <laughs> He's just a cyber zombie, isn't he? <laughs> I have the feeling that that he is indeed not alive, as in alive. 
Yeah. Uh, <laughs> at, at, a, host. <laughs> <laughs> at a certain point, uh, uh, you, Miss Zangiran uh, will, uh, will uh, you will notice that she gets uh, into somewhat comfortable clothes. She will get in such like, like a luxurious um, uh, robe. Uh, like, like, as if she's really relaxing, and uh, she grabs something to drink and walks outside onto the balcony to take in the view uh, with a quite an, 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 how you can say it, an, an um, satisfied uh, visit. As if, uh, if she managed to get a, a big success. <laughs> I love it. Sliding door? Uh, yes. Um, so, so she slides it open and walks out onto the balcony. She has no clue yet that, that the two of you are there. That it's uh, it's out of her peripheral vision at the moment. Okay, perfect. This is, this is tight. Um, I want to uh, reach over, uh -huh. close the blinders, close the door, and then I want to wedge something in it. To keep it from sliding open. Oh, if you want to close the door, uh, even with this, uh, with with the with the blinds closed, uh, the the door the door uh, it would mean that you are still. F uh, give me a stealth roll. You know what? Give me a stealth roll. Where do you be able to succeed to do that yes. without being seen? Twenty-two. <laughs> yeah, sure. So silently, oh. while she, she 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 hangs over the balcony, basically, or or relaxing at, uh, she's standing at at the edge of the balcony, relaxing, like like like, nothing is wrong. And Red Boy sneaks in, closes it the blinders, and 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 then closes the doors. Although the doors themselves don't have blinders. And but uh, there are not blinders like in front of the doors to be closed, or can no. you have binoculars just watch or change? Ah, oh, man, that's a good point. Uh, Ronin's just silent. <laughs> no, they are not, sorry. Hmm. Uh, okay, uh, fair enough. If there's no blinds on the doors, there's no blinds on the doors. Uh, and I'm just going to wedge it closed. Um, uh, and... Utilizing that stealth roll. Ah, oh, these are my new clothes too. I'm gonna get blood all over them. Whatever. Um, I'm you going can't. to. Uh, yeah. Um, I'm kind of like motion to bombshell. Um, and then like from the darkness, like a voice from the darkness. Uh, I want to give her a um, um, lovely night, isn't it, love? Uh, like while I'm close to her, like in her space already behind her. <laughs> she, uh, catch it. I, I want to grab her. So, yeah, she, yeah. She, she, she freaks out while you grab I her. Can, I can kill you faster than your guards can arrive. It's in your best interest to keep quiet. Uh, what you do notice, um, uh, the moment you do that, you grab her. She, 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 she's scared. And what happens is basically you hear a breaking of glass behind you and this cyber ninja is basically standing behind you with his sword towards your neck while you're holding her. And that's the current impasse at this moment. I Absolutely. Be standing there. <clears throat> I will react because I was standing casually mm -hmm, against mm -hmm. the wall. When he gets out... I will have my pop-up melee weapon mm -hmm. against his throat. Okay, so there's this impasse where Red Boy is holding <laughs> Miss Sang Yu. The cyborg <laughs> ninja is, is a bodyguard is holding his sword against uh, Red Boy's neck and uh, Nadari is holding the cyborg's <laughs> her sword against the cyborg's ninja. <laughs> okay, so... <laughs> That's yeah. a nice visual, actually. F fucking, yeah, no, this is great. Uh, That's called a Mexican standoff. <laughs> yep, 100%. Um, oh my god, uh, I I'm gonna, I'm gonna ask her, um, uh, you should call him off, otherwise you're in for a long fall. If you let me go first. <laughs> um, 
I I don't. I squeeze a little bit harder and I push her like head over the edge a little bit more and I say, um, I'm not afraid to die, love. Call him off. <laughs> I knew it. Uh, uh, she, she's like, like, uh, 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 what, what she goes is, um, uh, 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 oh, hold on, give me a moment. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm stoked. <laughs> my, <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. My, my RPG senses are percolating. I'm enjoying this a lot. Uh, da, 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 da. Um, well, um, oh fuck! I think I wrote his wrote his name incorrectly. Can you give me his his, his name again? What I gave because I, I think I. I will copy paste it from my character sheet. This is Thank what I have. Thank you. Down. Yes. I'm gonna have to amend that dead part. <laughs> Just put a question mark oh. on the bend. Exactly. Yeah, right. I want to say that. <laughs> dead. 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 I don't know. So uh, what, what she what she does is like uh, she. Uh, she it seems like her eye blinks with a little light in it and uh, what you know is that the 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 the, the cyborg is is uh, it pulls its sword back into the into his shade and just stands there still oh he's so creepy i love him oh my god <laughs> i called him off now you let me go uh, yeah, I will. I, I'm, I'm gonna loosen my grip on her. Uh, but yeah, bombshell. You, you, you seems like you have some shit to say. I'm, I'm, I'm interested to hear it. Oh no, I lower my my sword as well. Have it ready. I would have just not shed it, shed it, it <laughs> but have it ready. <laughs> Ms. Zhang, please join me in the hot tub. <laughs> <laughs> uh. And I'm, I'm gonna fucking strip down my underwear and fucking get comfortable. Because there's nowhere she could go faster than I could catch her. Um, sure. <laughs> she, she will. She, uh, and what are you going to do, uh, Nadari? Uh, 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 uh. How deep's the hot tub? <laughs> uh, 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 the what? <laughs> You're getting into the hot tub? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. We're going to have a civil discussion. Oh, God. There. So, so, so th th this is kind of like size comparison on how big Red Boy is. <laughs> That's nuts. <laughs> I, I, I think Bombshell will... Very Korean, I just want to say. <laughs> <laughs> Bombshell will probably just dangle her feet in the water. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's uh, fine. Mi mi <laughs> Where's the size comparison? Uh, it's in the map right now. Can you red see boy it? is this big. This is Red Boy. This is Bombshell, and this is Miss Jang. Yeah, so, I, I see. The robot bodyguard is so much creepier than he was before. <laughs> this is great. <laughs> Thank you. That was entirely the 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 the, the setup of it. Like like you cybered up uh, Red Boy, I cybered up this boy. <laughs> yeah, turnabout is fair play. <laughs> uh, only problem is he has no. Yeah, he he's he's a little bit strange. Love to put it this way. <laughs> <laughs> so okay, so Miss Zhang Yu uh, uh, st st slowly also. Uh, uh, well well she she. she takes a chair and also puts her feet uh, her her feet into the the, the hot tub and she sits there and it's like uh, i uh, did not expect the two of you uh, here and what uh, are your plans now because uh, within a few minutes uh, the entire watchdogs company will will come in here and i can promise you 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 will not survive this oh great a party yep yeah yeah, yeah red boy nods um, and, uh, he's going to say a few minutes, uh, you know, relatively speaking, that could be a long time or a very short time. Let's talk about last chances. Hey, no, we, we, we all know Red Boy only takes a few minutes to get things done. <laughs> <laughs> he's got eyes on the prize here. Um, let's talk about last chances, Ms. Zhang. 
You see, I heard your phone call with Daddy. It seems me, like give, you're give, on thin ice. <laughs> okay, so uh, g give me a moment because. Uh, da, 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 da. Uh, give me a human perception check, both of you. All right. Eh, where? <laughs> where? There we go. It's, it's not bad for me. <laughs> uh, thirteen out of ten. Mm-hmm, 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 Yeah, give me a moment. She will oh. try. She will. She will try and act cool. So it's like, I don't know what you're uh, talking about. Uh, yeah, that's that's Red fine. Boy. Um, I, I don't think it's metagaming to say that Red Boy doesn't give a shit about how good she is at acting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no, 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 definitely. You you guys heard that yeah, phone call. So so she she. But she doesn't know that you guys heard it. Right. Um. So I'm gonna. So, so that, it's it's completely yeah. in, in in character for her to to just. Uh, yeah. Even Envy hasn't tried to lie that hard. Yeah. That, <laughs> yeah. She she really wanted to sell it. Um. Uh. And uh, I'm gonna say uh, uh. It was your last chance with Daddy, spending up all his money, chasing down street rats like me. And her. <laughs> I kind of like, uh. You know, sh uh, thumb over to bombshell. Uh, and here's, here's the kicker. You're on your last chance with me as well, love. I don't take kindly to be shot at by tanks and rockets and all that. So, somebody, somebody's about to run out of chances, you see. If this doesn't go how I want it to go. You understand? She, she, uh, she shifts uh, uh, a little bit. Uh... uh Wondering what she should uh, she sh should do. Um, moments. The, the whole time, I'm like ready to fucking twitch and grab her if she tries uh -huh. to. Move. Uh, she looks around and, and she's like, uh, "So, how do you uh, propose to solve this problem? Because the two of you have been a pain, a thorn in my side for quite some while." Starting at that convoy heist you guys did. Well, love, <laughs> I, I, I think I speak for both of us when I say it's in your best interest to use those deep pockets to buy us off rather than waste your time. And uh, how much money do you expect uh, this to uh, make it go away? Oh. I'm thinking beyond money, love. This is Orbido, major corporation. Status, I'm thinking. Status, money, resources. The whole nine. You'll need to have a talk with your security, of course. Seems they can't seem to be cutting the, cutting the mustard these days. Oh. Uh, <laughs> you want to work for us. That's a generous way to put it, I think. Don't you think so? And I kind of looked at Bombshell. This is a bit generous. Say we work for them, right? You see, we have Bombshell being a bit perplexed by this whole ordeal. She's like, work for them? Why would you want to work for them? <clears throat> <laughs> um... Uh, I, I love know, it. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's, yeah, he's going in. Um, uh, he's going to say, uh, uh, we've talked before about private security and all that. It's, a ver it's very easy to understand how the city works. People like me, we have skills. We need money. People like you have money to surround your people. Uh, surround yourself with people who have skills that you are clearly lacking. And I kind of gesture to the fact that we are on the fucking veranda. What, what, what? Uh, the, this is, uh, at the moment that you say that, she, she, you, you notice that uh, that a certain glint uh, enters her eyes. She, she, she is uh, as if you cut her attention. 
so to speak. Yeah? Uh, I would almost use that gif of uh, Leonardo DiCaprio. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, like, no. uh, like doing the little cheers thing. Uh, no, well, uh, the, the the one from um, uh, what was it called again? Hey Gen guys, Django, Django Unchained. Oh, you've caught, my, you've caught my attention. Mm -hmm. Um, it is it is time for me to take my fiance to work. Oh, oh shit. Yeah. And we haven't even gotten through the first day, so I'm okay to pick this up after I get back, but I do need to cut out for that. Uh, how long? Um, can't be more than like 20 minutes if it's just a drop off. Sure, no problem. Uh, right. and, and, and basically you guys managed to, to, to succeed because uh, Stitches and Dice managed to, to, to uh, get to the goal. Yeah, that's one thing that I'm Someone kind of happy about. Someone actually did the job that we were paid to do. Uh, but yeah, you guys can keep doing can keep doing stuff that doesn't involve me. I shouldn't be aware of this kind of stuff anyway. I'm too tempted to comment, so just keep doing that. When I get back, then you can. Sure. Come back to me. Yeah. All right. Okay. This is going to be so much fun. Sense. I am going to yes. <laughs> oh, God. okay. So uh, she goes like like oh okay. So I'm interested now. Um, you, you. So, the both of you. That would be quite expensive for my corporation, and I have already got my own uh, bodyguard. Uh. Of course, uh, working for Arubindo would mean certain things. Though, of course, with with all that old stuff which is inside you, we will need to rip that out and replace it. Of course. <laughs> oh shit! Is the implication that I would get a fucking cyber suit, uh, cyber bones? <laughs> You'd be a drone like your boy. <laughs> Bombshell will, yeah. will, 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 will get yes. us. That is indeed the implication. Mm. I'm not okay with that. Yeah, Red Boy doesn't like the idea of losing his autonomy. It's kind of what he's all about. <laughs> Himself. <laughs> Hence, even, like, I'm not okay with even working for, for her. And she's like, oh, well, oh, wait, Bombshell does look a bit, uh, a bit disgusted <laughs> at the moment. She's like, hell no. <laughs> she's now uh, standing next to the hot tub with her shoes in hand. So at this moment, you guys hear a phone going off from inside. Like, like, an, phone it, or like the big TV phone? No, the, the big TV phone. Okay. Uh, I don't know if we can answer it, can we? Uh, Miss Sang, is, 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 like, uh, I will need to have to pick this up just to be uh, so that there won't be any, the, no suspicion will be raised. Will you let me? No, I can't let her get too far away from me. Um, oh, I'm going to tell her to pick it up on her cryon. She's got to have the fucking cryon, right? <laughs> she does, yes. You sneaky devil. <laughs> but you don't know. I'm gonna, Give me uh, a yeah, perception I, check. I, yeah, I, I think I... God, I, I would definitely have to assume that she's fucking loaded. Perception. Here we are. Oh, God. Nah. Like I, I, I don't know for sure if she's got the cyber eye, uh -huh. but there's there's just no fucking way I'm letting her out of my like out of my, out of my grasp. I made that mistake one time, never again. So she, the the phone is the the, the agent on the TV is ringing. Uh, I really need to pick this up, uh, else if I, I don't know that they, they might get suspicious, and she 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 is is making. 
the movement to stand up. Mm. I will, I will keep her out of like, like I will stop her and ask her. You don't have any other way to pick up that phone call. No, I don't. Can I do uh, something to see if she's lying? Yes, human perception. Oh God. <laughs> Pip. Why is she so fucking good at acting, though? She she's <laughs> telling she's telling the truth. <laughs> I will step aside and be like, fine. And she will uh, she will she will uh, pick up the phone and this person enters the screen and he says, uh, ah, granddaughter, uh, get me the two people to get, get me your two visitors, uh, inside, please. And she looks a little bit strange. She, she, she looks around uh, and says, uh, but, uh, <laughs> ah, uh mm. yes. Well, I, I, if, the, if the jig is up, I'm going to arrive in frame next to her in the room. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, no. This, you hear it. Um, uh, it's like like yeah. he's requesting to the, the two visitors, that, that her two visitors. I, I wish to speak with them, please. Uh, she, she looks a bit strange, but uh, uh, looks a bit around. And, uh, <laughs> and you hear her, you hear, you hear uh, this man say, it's like a... Uh, Mr. and Miss, please uh, join uh, this conversation inside. I'm gonna give like a skeptical look over to uh, Nadari, <laughs> but I but I will get up out of the hot tub. Uh, all the water displacement <laughs> drops it by like a couple of inches. <laughs> um, yeah, if he if he knows that I'm here, then mm -hmm. um, it, it is what it is. <laughs> Bombshell. She she will shrug and be like, "Okay, so now, go now I'm going to tell you a little bit. This man looks young, mm -hmm. in physical appearance, but his eyes, his speech, uh, his mannerism, all of that tells tells you that this man is old." Oh. <laughs> uh, sorry, can you still hear me? Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah, yes. Right. So this this man doesn't look like 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 uh, he, maybe yes, his face looks like maybe he's in his forties, but his mannerism, his his how he looks in his eyes, um, uh, this the usage of his words uh, really shows that he is way older than. Uh, uh, then he should be. Uh, he is like a ah, young man and girl, uh, lady. Uh, <laughs> you've given my granddaughter quite a chase through the night city. Uh, she even sets her own personal bodyguard at you and she even failed to capture you. Now, um, let's set aside her failures and I have an offer for the two of you, that you come and work for me personally. Red Boy cracks his knuckles uh, and he goes, finally, a businessman, <laughs> let's talk. You hey, he's, 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 he's way into the idea of getting the fucking huge payoff from his enemies. You will work for me directly. You will be, both of you will be my personal bodyguards. Uh, I will give you the, the, uh, all the um, uh, the resources of my company to make sure that you, the two of you are able to do your job as my personal bodyguards. You will each get uh, completely set up to live the life as you wish. And we will forget all of this. I will forget that you have been a thorn in my side and you will forget that uh, we have tried uh, to eliminate you. What about that? Mm. 
I would uh, like to have your answers uh, before the end of this phone call, of course. Uh, well, you must understand. Mate, <laughs> uh, I have a team that comes with me as well. You should be aware of that. I, uh, I've heard of that, yes. Uh, they can be uh, inducted into the a uh, special squad within the Watch Dogs. I'm sure of it, that uh, Dominic won't uh, be able to complain about that. A red boy's got a huge fucking smile forming on his face. This is the come up, dude. He's been waiting for something like this. I, I like bombshell has a very disgusted look on her face she is not planning to work for him oh uh you know what too he's gonna say we accept <laughs> he thinks he's speaking for bombshell as well <laughs> at that point when you say that she will be looking at you like what no no i will not work for this man uh oh oh my god He got, got <laughs> us in so many troubles. No. Oh my God. How does uh, how does uh, old youngman uh, <laughs> respond to this? Uh, the 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 uh, 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 Sao Tao looks at uh, lo looks at the both of you with a big smile. Well, if you're unable to uh, work for me, then unfortunately we will have to make sure that you will no longer be able to. Uh, be a roadblock for our company. Uh oh, that was a bad situation. Uh, Red boy is like looking hard at Bombshell right now, uh, and he's like, um, like through his teeth, he's like, Bombshell, this is we're getting taken care of here. No more, no more fighting in the gutters. We have money, we have influence. What are you doing? I can't, I just can't. Uh-oh, uh oh oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> well, it seems we are at an impasse here. So, um, Red Boy, Taru, dispose of her. Oh my God! Uh, I'm fucking serious. <laughs> Red Boy is like Ronan. You're in trouble. <laughs> It's only business, love. And I'm going to try to fucking dispose of her. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> okay, so go ahead, do your things. Uh, you can do it uh, cinematically on how you want to do it. You can roll skills for it. Um, I like to have it cinematically and have like a little bit of an argument with Red Boy and, and Bombshell about this as well. Like, he's going for her, but they have, like, an argument while fighting. Oh, snap. Go ahead. I will <laughs> leave between nice. you. <laughs> All right. I will find some cool music for it. Oh, my God. I do have a battle music. You'll Yeah, oh get you. Sure, sure, sure. Send it to me. Oh, fuck. Wrong, wrong button. There's fucking no way Bombshell can win. She has no armor either. No, that's true. Oh my god. <laughs> this is this will be quick though. Oh, where, where did it go? Where did it go? Where did it go? Um, um, oh, this um. is so fucked up. Hey, at any point, uh, does our shenanigans cause any alarms in the hotel? Definitely. While yeah, this is happening. Yes. So the moment this is happening, well, the moment that, that, that the red boy is going like, oh, sorry, bombshell, I've got the alarms are going off. Uh, security drones are flying around. Security is getting active. All kinds of also, lights. Probably somewhere the, the sprinklers have gone off because I was I was firing off as many incendiary uh, shells as I could. Yeah, but, uh, but, but that is at that partial. Uh, yeah. So don't use that yeah. one. 
Um, yeah, how many how many incendiary things did I did I end up using? Uh, let's say you used uh, four of them. Okay. Uh, I, I'm not sure how much realism uh, you're going for here. Uh, I mean, it is a cyberpunk fiction, so you do you. But I know that in real life, uh, sprinkler systems don't like activate worldwide necessarily. Yes, that, that's um, why I said yeah. that, that they only uh, yeah. activate on that single part of the, uh, yeah. of, the of, of the hotel. Yeah. They 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 are segmented. Oh that's uh, what I know in real yeah, life. Yeah, as far as I've not been in a building where they've been active. Oh, okay. Um, Dude, Envy's gonna fucking flip. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> she will. It's like I leave for oh. two seconds and now everyone's fighting everyone. <laughs> <laughs> But, but well, uh, let's start because I think the music has switched as well. Yeah, you um, tell me what's going on. I'll, I'll work with you. So, uh, I will say, Red Boy, what the fuck are you doing? Are you crazy? Are you out of your mind? Do you want to work for these monsters? <laughs> um, uh,. Uh, I, I think it, in this moment, I'm like, I, I guess, approaching slowly, like in frame, just like getting into her personal space. Um, uh, um, I'm not crazy. There's nothing crazy about pulling Better. yourself out of the fucking gutter you've lived in your whole life. Oh, you're just going oh to turn God. turn on your own friends. You're, you're just going to do that by joining them. It doesn't have to be this way. Come with us. You see the 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 the, the zombie ninja uh, reach for his sword. I will fucking point at him with a gigantic <laughs> gorilla hand, and I'll say, uh, "This one doesn't interfere." <laughs> like uh, uh, you, 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 you hear you, the South Tower is like uh, okay you did this on your own red boy and he snaps his fingers and you see uh, the the zombies <laughs> ninja you see him, him, him shoot his sword back again and, sta and and walk to the next to the TV and stand there just completely silent motionless as a statue Oh my god, I'm palpitating. <laughs> um, uh, and then then I'll continue uh, with uh, with bombshell. Um, and say, um, uh, what would he say? Um, uh, if it's a choice between you and my life staying on the fucking streets of this shit city, then there's only one option for me. You understand? Uh, and, and the whole time, I guess I'm walking towards her. <laughs> That's a long walk. You can also grab her and have her against the wall or something. <laughs> yeah, if, if you're okay with that, then definitely grab by the lapels of her. Is she wearing lapels? Hold on, I gotta, I gotta consult that. <laughs> it has picture. some very fancy oh, you're consulting it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, so I, I guess like... Um, left hand around the neck like not squeezing not crushing her but like have her and then up on the wall oh so you just throw all your values out of the window <laughs> um oh shit you clearly don't know anything about my values in love Last chance. And then, little squeeze. <laughs> We're gonna die. Oh my god. You guys are going to come into combat. <laughs> Alright. Uh, I want to fucking punch her through the wall <laughs> onto the veranda. Uh, oh, it's sure. So, 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 what happens is, is, is like, Red Boy punches Bombfield onto the veranda. Bombshell, what are you doing? Uh, I, I'm at least trying to evade 
and have my uh, pop of katana get out of my arm. So, so, so while you're where you're getting punched, you you basically move with the motions, mm -hmm. backflip, and you 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 land in a hero pose with your katana in your hand, ready to fight uh, Red Boy. The scene behind the city, the night city scene behind you, alarms are going over, uh, lights going everywhere because there, are, there, there is a fire downstairs in the other building, smoke coming from there, the police hearing alarms. Red boy in front of you, ready to charge you. Yeah, what are you going play to here? Uh, are we like rolling initiative? What's... Uh... No, no, no. Uh, I, 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 it's cinematic. It's all so, cinematic. So, 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 so you punched her, and now, now I will let her do an attack, and okay. you do all something right, right, in return for it. So, well, she's going for a slash. At least she's not. She's going down fighting. I know. <laughs> so, so you're going to charge Red Boy yes. with your katana, and you, 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 you swing at him. Yes. She's not going down with a fight. Red boy, you see Nadari running up to you, swinging at you. Uh, I'll, I'll fucking take it while trying to grab, uh, grab the weapon with my hand. Like just take it and, like, sword stealing has been one of the things I do. <laughs> <laughs> it's I know. true. So, and she be disarmed of a pop-up weapon. Uh, it's uh, basically it's gonna be real painful if it hits. It's, man. it's it's uh, the the sword which she used, she used as a pop up is is basically like like it it pops out of her hand and into her uh, or pops out out of her arm and into her hand. Yeah, but then wouldn't it still be attached to the arm? Mm, no, it doesn't need to be. Hmm. Uh, yeah, so uh, yeah, I'm gonna take it. And I'm gonna try to grab the blade itself. Um, yeah. Worst case scenario, I have her arm completely mm -hmm. like uh, like in my control, so I, mm -hmm. I have like wrist control, so she can't attack me mm -hmm. the same way with it. So 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 you so Nadari slices at Red Boy. Red Boy grabs it. You see you see the sword is cut into his hand. The subdermal armor uh, catching a, f a little bit of it, but but still the sword is now stuck in his hand. And Nadari, what what are you doing? I'm going to use my. Oh, oh no! So, uh, sorry, Red, Boy's Red, Boy. turn. Red Boy's turn. Red Boy's turn. So, um, I want to pull her in and head butter into the hot tub, um, and like drop down in there with her. I'm gonna try to fucking drown her in the hot tub. <laughs> oh my god! Goddamn. Mm -hmm. She will. She will uh, fight back heavily, just mm -hmm. to not get drowned. She will. Uh, with the other hand, she will uh, try to grab her, her gun and to put it against his head to shoot. Sure, so, 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 so uh, Red Boy pushes her underwater, like, like, uh, Nadari struggling. Uh, pull, yeah, yeah, underwater, you see the bubbles coming up. She pulls her gun, it, it, the, you see the gun come out of the water and, and towards the head of Red Boy, and she shoots. Yeah, uh, Red Boy has done this a million times. I'm just going to juke my head out of the way slightly. <laughs> yeah, you, you, like, your everyone and their is mom insane. has tried to shoot Red Boy in the face. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, yeah, and if that's resolved, I want to step on her with one of my fucking cyber legs and hold her underwater um, on the arm that she was trying to shoot me from. So I have one hand by the like by the blade, and I'm stepping on her other arm and like keeping her underwater with my like grip foot. Like it's like this articulated cyber foot. Mm -hmm. Jesus. What uh, what is uh, Nadari uh, going to do? Are She's you going to try and uh, and get loose? Yes, yeah, she's going to wrestle her way out of his grip. All right. So so so. Well, I'll try at least. Yeah yeah no no. So so he holding the sword, uh, stepping, uh, trying to uh, step on your arm. The moment he tries to step, we are Nadari managed to uh, just squeeze out of her. Her sword still in the hands of Red Boy, but she managed to 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 get out of the pool. 
and she's standing there breathing heavily just out of the water looking what are you going to do uh, I'm going to uh, with the hand that didn't have the sword in it oh, uh, uh, Nadari has to get the attack huh? right I oh, oh sorry I thought yeah. that was her thing yeah get me so she will um, say one more time I thought you were our friend I could not believe that you would do this uh, yep with my right hand big old gorilla hand I'm going to grab her around the face and neck mm-hmm. and I'm going to start crushing as hard as I can she, and she I'm going to say like, <laughs> yep yeah, yeah, um, it's just what are you going to pop like a watermelon <laughs> it's, okay, so just just letting you know uh, Nadari has her back uh, towards the, 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 the end of the balcony so 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 if you would just look uh, behind her she would see how she would uh, how, how it is like maybe uh, how how big are these buildings normally like maybe 200 300 Wait, meters high what happens <laughs> oh, oh my well, god <laughs> we're about to find out what happens uh, yeah, Red Boy that's... has gone over to Timor Rabindo and Nadari has not. Um... <laughs> and and that, that's my move. I have her, uh, I, I, my so... other hand on her face and neck. It's just business, love. And I'm just crunching as hard as I can. He, he's crunching you by your neck, hurting you. I'm trying to bite him back in his hand. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful. So you bite him. Oh my him. god. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll take the bite for sure. <laughs> um, but the, all, all I'm going to be doing uh, is just keep like holding and crushing until she goes limp uh, or something else changes. Yeah, sure. Oh, she has no armor at all at the moment, so... I don't know how much uh, do you, do more you she can do, take. What do you do? You want to do one one more epic thing, maybe before? Um, she wants to try to uh, do uh, a martial arts thing mm-hmm. and have her uh, legs around Red Boy's neck mm-hmm. to crush him that way, like to to like. Oh, nice. Oh, okay. okay. So, 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 so he, while he's choking choke. you, you try to choke him yeah. with your legs. Yeah, yeah. sure. So, so, doing, so with, with a strange shoulder. move, the Dari's legs managed to wrap around that thick neck of Red Boy and slowly trying to crush him. And you see both of them locked into battle. Although, I have to be honest, the Red Boy is. is I know, I know. Oh. So, you will by, most likely pass out. First, yeah, 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 but that's fine. Right. So that's yeah, that's, I'm, I'm, I'm totally cool with that just being the scenario. Okay, so that's the scenario, like uh, grabbing at each other, locking each other up, and at a certain point, Red Boy, you feel Nadari go limp. Uh, her legs fall off your 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 neck, and now you have an an dead body I'm of Nadari. Nadari. Oh, dead shit. Oh my god. Um, oh, or unconscious, that's your choice. No, she's gotta die. <laughs> hey, there, uh, there, there, there's a three, after there's a three, after there's, a, there's a, there's a 300 story, uh, building where you're standing on. I think that's on like the ninth story. Oh, yeah. sorry, 300 meters, sorry. <laughs> High building. Oh. Um, what do you mean, like 30 like meters? Yeah. Uh, so, uh, is so, it so 30 my meters? Question, um, well, it, it, like, it's also like a convention center, so who knows how like tall like the the first several floors are to host these things? Yeah. Um, that like I was I was crunching those numbers too, and I was like, um, uh, I was thinking like, could I just jump off this building if I needed to? <laughs> but uh, I didn't want to presume. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep choking her uh, after she's gone limp for a while, mm-hmm. and. Well, uh, what do you think, McKetty? Is it better for me to chuck you off the fucking edge, or 
Is it better? At least you're gonna let her choose how she dies. Or is it, re- or is it better for Red Boy to keep you and have them turn you into a fucking cyber zombie? Oh my god! Oh no, no that would be so bad, though. Um, that that would be so <laughs> vile. That that is completely up to oh, you, man. bombshell. I didn't saw the last one coming actually that you wanted to turn her into a cyber. I didn't know. I didn't know that this would be an option either <laughs> until it was. <laughs> He was like, it's like, like, Ronin gave me the option. Look at the other guy. <laughs> we can do that with you too. I, I do see, see Red Boy do that to make her, or her, his, uh, his, his, like, bodyguard. Because he has Side seen her bonding. fights. Yeah, I know that she can fucking fight. Um, <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna... And- I, it would yeah, no I'm longer be the bombshell. I'm going to kill her there, and I want to keep her. I actually like, like that oh, idea no. to have her as a... As a I do like that idea. It's oh so good, but it's really brutal. I like it's it. It's so brutal. <laughs> <laughs> I oh can't my. believe I came back to it, Dad. <laughs> and when she... And, and after she's... On a thought that shouldn't have been dangerous. After she's fucking dead... I throw her in the fucking hot tub uh, face down and I get back on the call with uh, the CEO of Norobindo. Oh. Wonderfully done, Red Boy. Hey, Laura, I, I guess you weren't told this was the plan all along. <laughs> oh. <laughs> was Red Boy the traitor? <laughs> yep. Um, and yeah, oh. and yeah, he, he ends the call with a big fucking smile on his mm-hmm. face. Um, he's he's not in the gutters anymore. No, oh, Red Boy is what not, cost? <laughs> Red Boy is now 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 an employee of Aerobindo Pharma, the personal bodyguard <laughs> of of the CEO, with a zombie bombshell. <laughs> it's just. Oh my god. I can't fucking believe that. <laughs> That's actually pretty brutal. <laughs> Mankati, first off, are you okay? I'm okay. I'm, f- I'm, I'm completely fine. I'm completely I cannot fine. I cannot refer to you by the name of a dead character. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's okay. You must never speak of her again. <laughs> <laughs> She's been expunged from the annals of history. Okay, so now, now I need to learn a fourth name for Menketty. This is going to be fun. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, actually, no, fifth, because it's uh, Menketty, her actual name, Nadari, Bombshell, and now whatever her next character is. <laughs> this is going to get confusing. Yeah. <laughs> so, okay, so um, since uh, we're... In the five hours, let's. Uh, if you guys uh, are committed, I will. I will wrap it up so that everyone will will yeah. uh, will, will, will get something out of. It. So what is happening? Uh, Envy is partying there, and and a later export escorted to her room because all kinds of stuff happened. Uh, it, there was a break in. There was a st- stealing. Uh, Envy, you most most likely already got the news that dice and stitches. Uh, um, Got off the scene. What uh, you probably yeah. alerted by was the was the giant fuck off sirens that started blaring. <laughs> um, that probably interrupted your partying and maybe gave you a headache. Yeah. So and uh, okay. dice stitches. You guys got away. Stitches. Uh, what what do you want to do with those uh, twelve? Uh, can, can I just narratively? Uh, Sell them so that it will be into the the pool of of, of, of money which you guys. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Uh, or do you want to do something special with it? Hang on, hang on. Uh, it was Dice's plan to get the twelve things. Uh, yeah. So Sasha doesn't really. Or sorry, but um, Stitches doesn't know yeah, I no. have them. <laughs> okay. Yeah. No, that that, that yeah. was my my my. That, that that's why I wanted to. Yeah, I figured you okay. meant that. <laughs> so when do I find out that Nadari's fucking dead? Yes. So here comes the following. So so uh, you yeah, guys are really ready. Interested. You guys uh, uh, bring in the chair. Uh, uh, Before we uh, do that, I want yes. to do a security tech check to see if there's a tracker on it. 
Sure. Um. There is not. Not that you can nope. tell. <laughs> God damn it. Um, oh no. <laughs> so, uh, okay, I'm not. It's, I mean, Sitch just doesn't necessarily. You know, it's probably more in a state of, you know, not knowing. Mm hmm. The point where, when when it comes down to it, he, he is going to ask, D "How how badly do you want this? Can you do? You, could you could you wait a few days to have you know a tech look at it to make sure it's all safe?" Uh, they they will thank you for the for for for, for it. They were like, "No no no, we we really really uh, need uh, need this chair." Uh, okay, he he, will, he won't stop them. We will we will pay you even uh, uh, one thousand uh, more for 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 your success. Um, and uh, so so the three of you each get two thousand. That would be dice, yeah. stitches, and envy. Yeah. Uh, two thousand. Yeah, two thousand. I will. Uh, okay. And dice, you have those. You have those twelve uh, unique uh, um, neural neural links. Basically, what they are, they have the the tech upgrade where it costs one d six less humanity. Sweet. Like uh, if I if I used my um, my uh, my haggle skill to get that ten percent. Like other than one thousand dollars, like how much is that? Uh, so twelve times one thousand plus ten percent gives you thirteen thousand twelve hundred. I will take that. <laughs> uh, you 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 will have to use your uh, haggling skill for 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 that one, the deal skill in the shops to be able to sell them. Oh, okay. So I'm gonna have to sell each one individually. I gotcha. Yes. Yeah. 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 Gotcha. They are they are quite unique. They have the, that uh, Raven Micro Cybernetics uh, uh, brand on it. So, uh, so it would be like very expensive. That would be like the classification. Yes, correct. Okay, indeed. Gotcha. Uh, and well, uh, yeah, Red Boy he sold out to <laughs> Arabino Pharma. Uh, and Tell me about uh, that payout. It's probably going to be pretty good. <laughs> yeah. So, so what what happens is basically a uh, um, red boy becomes an uh, executive seven. So he he is going to stay in an an Breverville mansion, all luxurious. He will also get a few nice, cute cyberware upgrades uh, from Arabindo uh, Pharma Company. I already have them. I, I, I would, I, yeah, I would love to talk to you about how you're gonna kit this motherfucker out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I will, I will, I will, I will let you know. Uh, uh, I, I will. So, I so will. Red Boy still be a PC? Mm, definitely no. not. No, no fucking way. No. Definitely. Oh God. Red love Boy did not like, get to bloom on the battlefield. How could he? How could he possibly stay <laughs> in, uh, a PC after this? A red Boy uh, stopped being an edge runner now, so he's no longer a PC. Yeah. He's uh, he's an NPC. He's he's yeah. now uh, he's now an. Uh, I will also need to talk to you about this, Ronan, because I definitely have some ideas for things. Wonderful. Uh, uh, well, and Bombshell will become a zombie. <laughs> uh, oh my god. A zombie ninja, just zombie like, ninja, yeah. Just like 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 the other one, only then in the surface of Red Boy. Oh, scary! Oh, my God. So scary! Holy crap! <laughs> oh fuck! <laughs> you thought I'm... his gang was you thought his gang was dangerous before. How the fuck am I gonna pay rent? <laughs> and Red Boy. <laughs> <laughs> Last time, you're fine. And and, and Red Boy is. I, I think uh, um, Lindsay is looking for a roommate. Uh, Cassia. She's a med tech. Yeah. Oh, fuck. 
That's all. That's all Envy cares about. How is she gonna pay for it? So, <laughs> no, that is not and, all she cares about. So, that's just so, one thing on my now, mind. And, so once you uh, <laughs> have have cleared that, and, and then uh, uh, about uh, the day after, in the morning news, there you will see the the CEO of Urban of Fire of uh, Pharma standing there in the news with Red Boy uh, behind him. Telling the news is like, uh, yes, uh, yeah, uh, of course, uh, last night was uh, was disastrous. Uh, there was an attack by an, uh, a terrorist uh, upon my granddaughter. But uh, thanks to this uh, wonderful young man, and he taps uh, Red Boy uh, as much on the shoulder as possible, uh, he was able to prevent it. As uh, thanks, uh, he uh, will be able to work for me and uh, my company, and we will make sure that he is uh, just justly rewarded for his uh, services uh, for protecting my uh, my wonderful granddaughter. <laughs> and you will see a picture it. of bombshell uh, with with the as 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 shown as the terrorist. Oh my fucking god! Oh man! Oh. Damn, dude. This is how you chose to retire, Red Boy? <laughs> he's, <laughs> he's always been a villain. <laughs> <laughs> and with that, we end the session for today. Oh, <laughs> oh my god, that was great. <laughs> I feel how like I gotta how did I survive? How did I. How, how did Nadari die and I. Well, looks like I made it out with the merch. Haha. <laughs> oh, man. But, Bombshell, she was a friend of mine. Can't believe that happened. And, and Red, Red Boy. That slimy, that slimy turncoat. And it just goes to show you, you can't trust anyone fully out here on the streets of Night City. All right. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Peace. Peace.